Hello there, Sierra Cube for K. What's wrong, Navarro? <laughs> Thank you very much for the subscription. And good to see you. So yeah, probably some of y'all thought I wouldn't stream tonight. No, I told you I'll be here every day just uh, experimenting with the time. I'm thinking this is it. This is going to be the time I'll be streaming from here on out around around this around this you know this area here the the prime time so let me do my youtube stuff so yeah finally back here to the the good old nintendo love it my favorite console my most favorite console of all time uh doc doc tall chinaman how you doing you all right doing excellent ready for another night of streaming here Give me a second, you know, I'll go to thumbnails and whatnot. Good to see you, CRT4K as well, everyone. So I just need to put a, a thumbnail here on YouTube for uh, viewer discretion is advised and all that. And, um, and pop out the chat in there. And we're gonna play some, uh, first time, first time playing this game. Now I'll walk and talk here. Um, I'm familiar with the game as far as uh, known about it and seen footage of it and um, videos about it over the years, the whole banana in your ears thing, the meme, you know, as long as she says, the banner break guy. Uh, I think the, the video that I watched that got me to really want to play this game here, right, right here, right now, was um, Nitro Red. Now, I've been following Nitro Red for many, 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 many years. He's a Canadian YouTuber. Uh, and he is awesome and he really likes his game in fact he uses this game here as a basis for his intro on YouTube and um, so he had recently a one hour something special he put a lot of work into it looks like it um, and it's amazing he details the whole game and what it meant to him and every little bit of it really dove deep into it and I was like man I I've been wanting to play this game for a, for a while, and I think this this here will sell me into to playing it right now. And that's it, and that's what we're doing. So I'm aware of some of the bullshit in in there, some of the cryptic stuff, some of the uh, the cheap traps, and uh, the difficulty of the last level. <clears throat> and I uh, so I'll try my best to be as patient as I possibly can. Hey, hey, boogie boogie, America! Fuck yeah! Another. Not a great day to be an American. Uh, I love the set, Rex. It's, it's peak aesthetics. Yeah, we're doing our F. Good to see you, Black Panther, Sushi Bells, uh, Balloon Knot Sniffer, uh, Butt Cheeks McGeeks. Some awesome names here today. Salamander. And uh, just watch the, the Nitro Red. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Great. I love his videos. I've been watching him ever since. He looked a lot younger, obviously. I mean, he has age. Still a good, good-looking good fella. I gotta add that. He's a good-looking guy. Um, yeah, awesome dude. I like him. He's very positive. So, just pop out the chat here, and we'll dive into it. Mm-mm. It's gonna be good. It's gonna be good. I like Rayman, too. That was a, that was a great adventure. Too. I enjoyed that game. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Casual 1 a.m. stream. <laughs> That's it. Uh, I went to bed my time. I went to bed at 3 p.m. I was talking to Woogie Boogie about it. As a matter of fact, me and Woogie Boogie went back and forth on Discord about a time that would really work. Because the time I had on the previous few streams were the worst possible, like everywhere. So we're looking at this here. The summer's coming. Summer, it is unbearable to be inside the trailer during the day. Uh, it's fucked. It's horrific. So uh, there's no way I'll be able to stream during the day my time. So uh, we're looking at uh, we're looking around at around eight, seven, six, late evening Eastern time in America. So that's what we're looking at. Okay, well, almost there, folks. I, I I really wish it was an easier way of doing this all this stuff because Twitch is ready. I'm ready to go here, and I got to do all this YouTube. Turn on monetization. Need those peanut those peanuts, you know. I gotta have my peanuts, and uh, and there you go. And then there you go. Plasma plays, and and then do the thumbnail, and then pop out the chat. I think I did it. There you go. 
and put the chat here on my monitor here on top of my head so I can keep track of both because I'm simulcasting so if you're on Twitch or, or YouTube it don't matter but most folks are on Twitch it's my primary thing yeah 8 p.m. Eastern now I've had some folks here just touch this real quick and it's not me being arrogant or anything but I have folks here that goes like oh they, they will miss me being at work and they like to listen to me at work in the background I, I get it and I appreciate it. I appreciate lurkers all everyone who comes here to watch I much appreciated but some folks that go like well my favorite streamer and there's a big streamer right that I like and I get it I get that right I'm gonna have a big streamer that I like you know I want to watch you but like as a second guy because you I get it you're tiny and you know your content is not as good uh, I believe my content I like my content I'll be honest with you not not being Aryan here I believe in all this and I will be taking the prime time I want the prime beef and I'll be here at uh, the prime time Eastern time and if people don't choose to watch their favorite streamers playing Roblox Fortnite Silent Hill whatever they're playing and I'm not mocking anyone far from me from mocking any channel I'm a, again I'm a big nobody here I'm, I'm nothing you know I'm a piece of shit but I believe in my content so I will be streaming I don't care I don't care who's on I don't want to be mining other channels you know never mind what they do they do their thing I'll do my thing that's it I w this is the time that works for me I'm not changing time because of views just oh I need the numbers and I need to be on these no summer's coming here and it's impossible for me to be streaming during the day that that's pretty much you know there's no point in me doing daytime streams right now if in I don't know three four weeks I got to change it all over again so I'm not doing that. Uh, all right. So yeah, Master Picel, and a lot of folks are going to be happy here, Master Picel, for, for for a fact. I know that uh, Woogie Boogie. Uh, a lot of folks in Europe, they're awake. They're, they're still awake until late at night. And so the time I had before that was shit. But I I was like, I bet I rather stream now than not streaming altogether. All right, let's, let's get in. And one thing, I'm, I, I know this game is going to be hard, because every, every NES game is going to be hard. I'm come off it. Um, make sure everything is okay. Before I head on, head on, out, head on out here. Oh, yeah, I want to unplug this crap here. Please, sir, get out. You know, I got to say something on the side here about Windows 11. Kind of pissing me off. It doesn't uh, butt cheeks McGeeks. Follows, thank you. Welcome in. Pleasure to have you around. Uh, yeah, Windows uh, 11 for some reason it doesn't like to eject my uh, my hard drives. It's fucking annoying. I enjoy a few channels for different reasons, but it doesn't make the others bad. Yeah, that's true. I'm like I don't wanna I don't wanna talk about other channels or, or talk about what they do or uh, <clears throat> I don't have any channel to bad mouth here to be honest. Uh, but even like. Uh, you know, it's just none of my business, you know, just I'll do my thing and they do theirs. I'm not going to cater, like, uh, I'm not going to change my schedule or this or that because I don't compete. I don't want to be keeping track of that shit, and I, I never did, to be honest. So, y'all know me, wh whoever has been here for a while. I don't, I don't care about that. So, elimination mode. It's funny how it is, yeah. So, don't be fooled if you don't know this game. Again, it's my first time playing it. Uh... But it might look like Zelda, kind of, but I think the gameplay has little to do with it, okay? Let's just go Rex. No! Damn it, damn it. Well. Okay. Why Ray? Everybody loves Raymond. <laughs> what was that, dude? Um, okay, and then in. There we go. First time playing Star Tropics. Let's go, Ray. <laughs> Music is awesome. I love the NES, man. This, this is this is where I'm, I'm. I'm home. I'm home, baby. Graphics, everything. Now I don't know. Oh, two things. More Ray out of control today. I fucking hate this camera. So what I'm seeing here, you might think, well, our F looks blurry. No, the camera is fucking blurry. Uh, the Moire is horrific. I can go even a tiny bit sharp, so I had to go. I had to severe, go severely out of focus here in order to capture anything without a bunch of Moire. And I'll show you right now. 
go sharp. You ready for more of time? Oh! <laughs> Fuck me. It's horrible. I hate this pattern. I, God, give me a Panasonic GH5S, please. Look, ignore the more You can see how sharp it is here. RF is not garbage. It's awesome. It looks colorful. This could pass for composite for me easy. I would not be able to tell the difference. Uh, it looks awesome. On a CRT, at least, that is. So I have to go severely out of focus here in order to... So there's going to be a little bit of moiré here, especially on the blue areas. But if I, if I, to eliminate the moiré, I have to go do... Who wants to watch this? Yeah, I might, I might as well do this, this here. There you go. There you go. Welcome to me without the glasses. Hi, guys. Uh, there's been some changes around here. I really want to get rid of more moiré. <laughs> Enjoy the stream! <laughs> Alright, let's not do that. Okay, so just showing you a little bit of behind the scenes here. Uh, and like here, it looks good, right? But it's too fucking blurry here. So, you know, that's the troubles of, of the modern man. And this will be perfect here, I, I like it, but the more you know? Pain in the fucking ass. So the GH5S... Uh, has a low-pass filter that severely reduces more ray and is a lot easier to work with, but... You know, I don't have it, so... It's the way it is. Jess and Wiki, how, how you doing? Coming in late? I hear it's a good game, haven't played it. Look at those graphics. Yeah! Uh, hey, Junkyard Dave is here! <laughs> the Atari Vision. So yeah, let me know if the moiré or the blur is too much. And the sound, uh, let me know if the sound is too, too, too loud, like more than one person, right? Just in case. Uh, I have a guy that has his volume blasting on the fucking surround sound. I go, it's too loud! <laughs> but then it's good for everybody else. So you move, you move on a grid here. At first I was scared of this game a tiny bit because of the survival horror elements. No, I'm kidding. Because it looked like it would be an RPG and I'm not into turn-based RPG, sorry. Uh, but it's not. So it's all action. So we're gonna go around here. I love the atmosphere so far. Alrighty. 10 out of 10. Welcome to Coral Co Cola. Thank you, sir. Now this pig will show. I know the pig. Look at the pig. Junkyard Dave. Ah, oh, god damn it. It's hard to see here. Ah, uh, okay. Well. Oink, oink. And then he turns his back and his little butthole can be seen. They actually put a little pixel, a dark pixel for his butthole. <laughs> oh man, this is gonna be fun. It is coin up TV. Now there's just a good old RF uh, 80s set, early 80s. Hi there, King Tom Soapbox. I'm where the pig has a name. Oh, there you go. <laughs> his young car's Dave Symbols is a pig, which is good. It's also my Chinese Zodiac. I like pigs, they're, they're good animals. Mike, you're a nice pitcher, I hear. Show me how to throw a fastball sometimes. So the name of the protagonist is Mike Jones. Now I got confused here for a tiny bit because I remember adding the name Rax and not Mike, because my name is actually Mike. Uh, but it's, uh, it's the character, okay. I thought they were like reading, getting into my brain here somehow. I don't have the team floral hat on today. I miss Coral 1990. Do you think I'm pretty? Is it a rhetorical question or? Okay. Yeah, yeah, you're all right. You don't, you're doing, you're doing good. Your uncle, Dr. Jones, is so nice. We call him Dr. J. Last week, we met Dr. J. He was very busy solving some strange puzzle. So I'm gonna talk to everyone here. Look. I don't like the turn-based part of RPGs, but there's a thing I like about RP RPGs, the turn-based ones. And this is when I'm, I'm watching somebody play and when I play Paper Mario as well. I like the dialogue and talking to everyone. I think it's pretty cool. It feels like you're really there, you know. Nice, the TV matches the NES aesthetic, kinda. Oh no, it does. It, it, it does. I'm gonna go ahead and say not kinda. It, it, it really does, because this here is a period-appropriate set. So this here, the, the BVM, the PVM, whatever. That's, of course, that's not going to be back then. No, 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 nobody had that. 
But the NES, our RF out, and this is a set from the early 80s on RF. Uh, good old NPSC here, and so it is. This, this is something you would have, not the PVM, but this is something you would have back in the day. This is something similar to what I had back in the day, and I grew up with RF only. Where, where do you come from? Americola? Americola, fuck yeah, so lick my butt. All right, this guy here, who are you? Stay away from him. Mmm. Okay. Get hostile. Uh, I heard you were coming. Want to go fishing? You didn't let me. You didn't let me answer. How about you, old man? You look suspicious. Last night I gazed up at the southern cross. So we're in the southern hemisphere now. Suddenly I saw many shooting stars. Legends say shooting stars are omens of disasters. Oh me, oh my, that's just a old wife's tale, that's all. I mean it matches the look of the NS, does it? Oh yeah, it does a tiny Oh, you mean like the collar and whatnot. Gotcha. Part of me, I'm always a bit behind the cue ball there. Uh, Mike, your uncle told told me about you, I feel like we are old friends. I don't know, I've never, never seen it before. You again with the pretty thing, eh? being insecure there. That's uh, it's a little something called confidence. Who's this guy here? I don't think I talked to him. How you doing, fella? Welcome to Sea Island. Uh, Cunt Island? I don't know, it's, it's... Okay, it is a sea, it is shaped like a sea. I'll, I'll give, okay, I'll give it that. Have you met our chief yet? He's waiting for you. He is? That's not it, chief. <laughs> Balloon not. Sniper says a cool I love the sad. Troop says I need help. What, with the poop bucket? Poop bucket troubles? What year? I don't know the year exactly. I think I'll probably have to open the CRT, uh, I would say this is early 80s or mid 80s, definitely not late 80s, I have some late 80s sets here, this is, this is definitely early 80s. Oh, mine is Leo, Nar Nartoy, Nine Fox, happy Friday. So I'll still be streaming tomorrow too, hopefully, if nothing, if the world doesn't explode. Uh, I love the pig, <laughs> with the ass, it's fucking awesome. Did I talk to this lady here? You have to hurry, I'm gonna roast a pig for your welcome party. Oh no! I love pigs, but I also love bacon, so a bit of a contradiction here. I'm a living, living contradiction. Who are you? Stay away from here. Okay, I thought I, I, I know you, you gotta talk to everyone, I reckon. Okay, we gotta go inside this, this hut here. Is that a, oh, there we go. There's a chief, the mustache man. Put a shirt on, dude. I've been waiting for you. I'm Chief Cola and a good friend of your uncle. Listen, Mike, I have some bad news. Last night, try not to be too upset, but your uncle, Dr. Jones, has been abducted. We must keep keep this from the islanders so they don't panic. You are the best hope for rescuing Dr. Jones. Because Dr. Jones got, okay. <laughs> Help, get the kid. I don't know what to do. Can you help me? No. Spread your, do your own thing, man. I'm a kid. I'm gonna play yo-yos and shit. You're the best hope of rescuing Dr. Jones. I don't know what you do. Can you help? Okay, I guess. That's the only option. Good, you're brave. We'll see about Take this island yo-yo, which has changed your star in the Wii version. Uh, you may think this yo-yo is just a toy, but it's very powerful, Mike. You're an ace pitcher. Use it. Got a yo-yo. The chief is right out of the fuck off. <laughs> yeah, I love bacon. Arrow says, what it, what, what's up, nice TV? Thank you. It's a good good looking set. Looks, Mike, it looks peaceful around here, but the dark below. Many monsters have appeared this last few years. Don't let them get you. The fate of your uncle is in your hands. I'll find a tunnel in the village and hurry to Dr. J's laboratory. Laboratory. So, there's monsters, right? I'm gonna tell my kid here. Uh, look, there's monsters. I'm gonna stay in this hut in the safety of my hut, and I want you to get this 
go kill the monsters. Well, Dad, do you have a do you have a weapon? Oh, you mean like a gun? No, but here's a yo-yo. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> no matter what I do, part of the screen has bad convergence. I'm scared. How bad is it? Make sure if you're fucking around the service menu, you, you save all the, sa the what you had before you, you know, before saving everything. Like write down what you had or take pictures. I know somebody could refer. There we go. Uh, CRT probably Andy it has some some good contacts. CRT for K, are you still planning on doing something with the uh, Windows stuff? I don't mean to be nagging you about that, but just wondering. It's okay if you don't, by the way. So it's fine. Just wondering. You're Dr. J's nephew, so you got to talk to folks here, talk to the chief, and and then he lets you in. There we go. The adventure begins. I didn't test the game. I don't know how the game plays. I just know Nitro Red's video on it. <laughs> I'm the shaman and sister of the island chief. Your uncle was abducted because he found a secret in the lost rooms. I have great hope that you will succeed in rescue Do Dr. Jones. Uh, I gotta, I, I'm still kind of recovering from my flu, so pardon me. Let me drink some liquids here. Sorry about that. Yeah, dude, I that'll be awesome. You know. Shoop says scroll up, nobody cares. What do you mean? I got all that message here. Play. <laughs> Tara Span on YouTube says, why the PPE gloves? Why do I why do I wear gloves? Because you touch yourself at night, that's why. No, I'm kidding. I wear gloves uh, to keep my hardware clean. Over the years I got used to it, and the bonus is look at the CRT. If I'm not wearing gloves. Oh, that's not very good, is it? You wanna see uh, the blue man group here? I don't know. Look at that. Put the gloves on, watch the magic. Look at that, isn't that a lot better? So there you go. Especially on this set here, it's very reflective. It's gonna be long, kinda late, and an earthquake here in Jersey. Earthquake in Jersey? What's the world coming to? What in the hell? I didn't know y'all had Earthquakes up, up there. Mike, I meant, sorry, Mike, men and wild monsters await you in the dark below. But remember, the magic of the Southern Cross is always on your side. Now begin the test of violent courage. Good luck. Thank you. Now saving your data, refrain from turning the power off or choose a load of it. There we go. It begins. It has begun. Dum, dum, da -dum, dum, dum, da -dum. It's okay. Well, let's try the controls here. A little jump, so you jump. Oh yeah, I remember Nitro Red saying, so you don't you don't move right away. You can turn like this, and then you move in sort of a grid. So I gotta get used to that concept. Does your hands ever sweat during long session? I'm not a sweaty as nerd, what are you on about? No, I barely sweat, I don't sweat much. Uh, at all, not a big sweater. So no, but I wash them anyways, I gotta wash them. Okay, so yeah, so you press, kind of, you hold, there's a certain momentum. But I'm seeing, how do you jump, like, forward, right? You can't, I need to, need to, need to get in, understand the concept here. Somebody picked a Hitachi here, I read. Sorry, I'll try my best again to keep up with the chat, but it, it gets harder as, you know, as this thing keeps going. Brings it back, brings it back memory for 1994 and replace my old Atari with an NES. Uh, I, I grew up with the Atari, it was my first one, too, my first console. So, total practical for it, no, no problem. <laughs> we do a, do a lot of banner here, so a lot of jokes around. Yeah, that's crazy, Jersey had earthquakes. 
Uh, yeah, Chips, uh, CRT 4K will see you right. He, has, he knows people that have a lot of knowledge on CRT, so he'll, he'll take care of you better than I, I, I could ever do, my good sir. So I got a star here that means something. Some pink slugs. I want to know, how do you... Oh, okay, so you, can, you only jump forward when, when you need to. Well, I, I can jump here because I'm going to fall. Spalex 04, just follow. The tube says nobody cares. Stop playing the victim, tubes. I'll, I'll kill you. <laughs> now, a CRT, CRT 4K, he'll help you. I, uh, I, I would give you generic advice. Or go back to the service manual and fiddle around with it. Like, what could I, you know, what could I tell you? I'm here to help. Like, if you, if you had, no, no, no. If you had no other help, I, w I would definitely arrange something on Discord or something. So if you, if, the CRT 4K, he knows the fellers, the boys, the CRT boys. And he'll, he'll, he'll make you feel good. My Discord is Choopy Tuesday. Mine is CRT Rex. Nice to meet you. Just sat me in there. I'm not. You a sad boy today? Nah, he's just joking around. Chips is never sad, for real. I need to worry about four jumps. Until I actually need to jump. Yeah, that's good. It's, uh, it makes sense. I'm so happy I'm playing the, the NES finally. This is, this is fucking awesome. I can never be too, too, you know, for too long without playing this console. It's, it pains me not to. I'm not an expert of, of the games. I didn't even have the console gr growing up. No letters to Santa granted my wish on having an NES. I was stuck with it with the Atari. But chicken butt. But um, goddamn, am I happy to have it uh, as a grown ass man? You know, it's never too late to redeem yourself. Okay, I think some kind of rat. Okay. So part of me with the chat, I'll try my best to keep up as best as I can, but I can't be here just chatting all the time, uh, like, and not playing, because then that troll's gonna come again, and he really, he's really gonna hurt my feelings. <laughs> Been on Amazon, trying to find a good cowboy hat. The thing with cowboy hat, you gotta sift through a lot of bullshit, like, uh, what do you call it, like Halloween costume shit, like garbage, you know, so, yeah, but it, it don't have to be everything branded too, this here is a cheap one, and it, it served me well, you know, it worked, I think the, the crown is a bit small, to be honest, I prefer longer, and I think the brim is also small, it's a bit on the smaller side for me, I'm a, I'm a tall guy, and I like uh, bigger hats, I would like to have what Charlie Daniels used to wear. I like his hats a lot. I uh, can't find a brand though, but like a perfect match. I also like to buy one of those, uh, you know, cowboy hats have evolved, uh, with just like any other fashion. You know, if you see some of the older movies and whenever they have like, you know, modern day cowboys, uh, like 80s and, and whatnot, they used to have a lot of feathers and this crease here wasn't as common. It was like uh, just flat here. Uh, a lot of straw and uh, big like Native Native American motifs and, and feathers and whatnot. Get one of those uh, one, of, one of these days, you know? And uh, let's make sure. And again, if I, uh, yeah. If I uh, miss on any chat, I'm, I'm, I apologize, okay? Okay. I'll look up here and there. <laughs> Not ignoring you like the, you know, drunk chick at the party. Okay, so we got two switches here. I'm aware of a few. I know about the frequency of the ladder with the water and all that. Okay, uh, 747. I, I have it written. It's, it's here. The tab is open somewhere. I know about the the traps. There's gonna be traps. Can I open two of them at the same time? Can I can I hurt hurt this lug's body? Yes. So I, I'm coming in with an open mind here with this game. I don't wanna be complaining the whole time. 
I'm, I'm going to try to reduce a tiny bit of my rage because I'm, I'm, I think I'm alive, but I have a heart attack here one of these days. Can you jump diagonal? No. It's okay. It's on the grid. Uh, let's always check the, let's check the right first. Bats, every game. Ignoble or IG Noble. Following, thank you. Welcome in. Bats. You want to know disappointment? I watched uh, The Weaker Man with uh, Nicolas Cage and the Not the Beast part was not in there. Why? This looks like a skull. It's kind of a, a bit of a survival horror element here. So, I know this game here rewards and also punishes exploration. So, you can. But I'm gonna jump on everything and, and check. I'm not in a hurry. Definitely not in a hurry. <coughs> okay. Chase? Hey there, Chase. How you doing? Check this side here. See what the fuzz is all about. I hope uh, we got a friend of the channel here. Uh, he's not here right now, but Bradio, uh, he's going for a partner too. I don't know if Yankee R. Dave is here. I hope he gets it. He's going through the same journey as uh, Junkie R. Dave. I hope he gets it. Can be, can be a bit nerve wracking from what I've seen. You know, with the waiting times and answering. I, for me, a partner is not even on my fucking radar. I'm so, I'm fucking light years away from from that. So I'm not even gonna think about it ever. Just whenever it happens, it happens. Fuck it. Or if it doesn't happen, which probably won't, to be honest. You need a lot of fucking viewers, right? I'm fine with that. Uh, okay, so a bit of a strategizing here. There we go. No! Ah! Think before you act. Holy shit, okay. Sorry about that, babe. Before I could see what was going on, the whole town was infested with zombies. Okay, I done goof there. Little goof. Little, little blunder. Little faux pas. <laughs> Bit of strategy. <laughs> she has in here. And uh, jumping in the water. No, I was aware of it. I, I, you know, sometimes it's like what goes on in your head. If you think about it, right? Why did I do that? Why would why would anyone do that? Right, I was fully aware that the water hurts you and you die, but yet I, I jumped on it. I actually, you know, my brain sent a signal, sent a signal to my, my thumb to, to hold the wrong direction. And if that wasn't enough, my brain sent another signal for me to go and touch the A button and go that way. Not to mention that the, my brain, what's left of it, sending signals uh, to my eyeballs to see that the water was in there. So all those things in conjunct conjunction, and I still jumped on the water. Sometimes it baffles me, the stupidity of the human mind. You know, but it, hey, mea culpa. <laughs> Play some Waluigi Taco Stand the other day. Must be a ROM hack. It is a ROM hack. I play that a lot. I play it. I play that with my daughter a lot. We, we are a Waluigi family here. I'm gonna tad out of sync here, folks. Uh, Handy hop. I've drunk a couple. Uh, hey Rex, is that a real stash? It's as fake as a two-dollar bill. It's a gag. It's a. It's a. It's. It's fake. It's. It's not white. Why, why would you have a mustache in this day and age? Think about it, Terrace fan. Oh, you, you may argue, why would you have a fake mustache? But I'm just following the trends, you know? Uh, it does, it, it is, uh, look, I don't have like stream subscriptions and none of that to worry about, but a recurring cost with glue, a fake mustache glue, they have been rather extravagant lately. A bit. I don't know. I don't think I can recommend the fake mustache lifestyle for it to, to anyone here. It, it might not be for you. Man, it, it's a real mustache. Okay. <laughs> I'm being sarcastic. Again, I reiterate. 
I, I wouldn't understand the point of having a fake mustache, but no, it's... Real mustache or very good glue? You know, was that rat kissing me or what is that about? Okay. It reminds me of Dr. Disrespect, but but in this chat, the Phantoms, the, he, he is wearing a fake wig, right? So, you, you look at a fake wig and then fake mustache. No, his mustache is real. <laughs> I'm marking. I know about that shit. Why? <laughs> it's so weird. Why would you want a pubic wig? They want a general to or sin. Why would you want to... I... Not, not to get your private here, but, uh, you know, I uh, maintain the things down there. Shave it. Shave it off. Well, not shave. Cream it. You're nothing. Else. Why would you want to... So there's pubic hair baldness? I, I don't get the merkin thing. Does anybody know for real? Why would you need a... Pubic wig? Hmm... Some things I know I know everything has a reason, but pubic wig is something that I've always I've heard of it, but I'm not. Is that a, like a real or is it like a joke thing? But maybe it's, it's just like a joke, like it, it doesn't really exist, does it? Trust me, glue. I've seen the bottles. He he has. It's very convincing. It's it's, it's actually a combination of glue, green green screening and an overlay mask that would attract her. I bet you have something funny about Nitro Red that made me like him a lot more. And like the AVGN a tiny bit less. And, and I know, right, is criminal. I'm going on a break already. I'm, I'm craving nicotine, so I need to smoke. So while I smoke, I'll tell you this. Uh, there's no timer here. So I was watching this special, Nitro Red, right? I don't know, was it the Star Tropics one? Well, anyways, they had a sequence. He's talking about his friends helping him, and and I noticed his hair is a bit thinning out, and there's nothing wrong with that, you know. Uh, over the years, right? He should have a luxurious. Same with Joe from Game Sack, right? So, well, anyways, it happens. It happens. My, my, I, I got my I receding hairline too, by the way. Make no mistake of it. Oh, look, there you go. So it's receding. It's not, I don't have a luxurious mane of hair here. Who, 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 who gives? I have hair on top. There's nothing missing here, but the, maybe it'll come. Who, who gives it flying shit? You know, that's the point, right? Just, just accept your fate. But uh, Nitro Red. So he, he's doing this thing. Uh, I know Call of Duty or something, he's shooting, he's climbing under the table, so it's like a skit, right? And there's a, the camera's a bird eyes view. And I'm looking at that, and the top of his head, it's, it's, it's blurry. It's like, it don't look like, it didn't look like no hair, very quick. But I, I was petty enough to, to rewind a tiny bit, and I said, he put like a fucking mask to hide his, like the bald spot. <laughs> and track him. And I say, oh no, come on, Nitro Red, what are you doing, man? But wait for it. So I was like, wow, that's kind of fucking disappointing, right? He's gonna be one of those guys, the elephant in the room. I, I'm going bald, but I'm gonna pretend, you know, hey, <laughs> I'm gonna pretend it's not happening. So he went ahead, the next scene is like, and by the way, if, I don't know if you noticed, that's him talking. By the way, I don't know if you noticed, but I'm going bald. I, you know, and he put his head down and showed his ball, ball spot, the, the guy, look what a chat, right? And he goes like, I had to use a tracker because the lights were so strong and exacerbated by my ball spot <laughs> with a haircut. And it's like, I don't give, and I didn't want to he explain why he did the thing because he didn't want that to be the focus, the main point of, because people go, ah, you going bald, you know? <laughs> so what, what a dude, you know? That's how you, sh that's how you bald. If you're going bald, just bald it and acknowledge it. Stop with the fucking toupees and the fucking creams and all that shit. <laughs> you know? The hand of time told you, look, you had a good run. No more hair for you. It's over. Just, you know, just accept it. So that guy, you know, that Nitro Rad, man. Check him out on YouTube. He's an awesome, awesome guy. Very, very real, very natural guy. I've been a fan, fan of his for a very long time. Yeah. 
green screen mustache. Not everyone can accept his fate. You have to. Whether you accept it or not is gonna is gonna go. Uh, Tara Spence said, uh, Tash is very Saxon, I think. Also Celtic, the Celtic uses she is. I, I don't know if you're doing, YouTube is weird because you have to uh, dance around the fucking words that you can or cannot say. I don't think I'll ever go bald, but if I did, I'll shave it off. You can never say you, you don't go bald. I start to have, like, Nitro Red is, in, is gonna be 30. I'm 40. For me, the, the, the receding, because I've always had a big forehead, and I'll always wear hats anyways. Uh, for me, 38, that's when I was like, definitely receding, the time to cut it short. Forget the hair, forget the hair gel, forget all that shit. Just, that's it. Done. Done. Just cut it short. Done. You're never too safe from baldness. Unless you, uh, you hair with me in somewhat, but yeah, there's people that don't. Look at George Lucas, huh? Tell me that man is fucking, tell me George Lucas's hair has thin at all. Now that's a head of hair, you know? George Lucas. Sam Elliott. There's a lot of guys. The point is, just accept who you are for who you are. That's it. You know, just, uh, just don't make yourself miserable over trivial things such as hair. It's, I think if you're a lady and you're bald, and now that'll be a fucking tough racket. Right? Or I can see you're very young. You're like uh, 18 years old going to college. I think. Um, Patrick uh, Stewart was like that. I think he bought, he started bothering in college. But look at the grace that that man has, in my opinion, you know? Patrick Stewart. Sir Patrick Stewart. Scullet. Oh, God. Uh, John Riggs. Scullet. I think he stopped. Please. Oh. Okay, there's accepting. <laughs> there's accepting involvement. But Scullet. I think that's accepting a little too too well, in my opinion. I, I'm not a fan of the skullet. <laughs> I'm not a fan of it. I, is anybody a fan of the skullet? Would any woman look at a skullet and go like, I want some of that? I Personally, I, I don't think so. Okay, did I go to right, did I go to the right here? Yapping, yapping about. Yeah, it's, it's okay to be bald, dude, or have a receding hairline, whatever you want to call. I remember one time, and you meet people like that, it's not just celebrities. I remember one guy out in the desert when I live in Nevada. We had a, I, I've had it, it was just me there. I had a neighbor, right? And um, he lied a lot, you know? It's uh, one of those guys, you know, a lot of, a lot of like blatant fucking stories or lies, you know, he'll tell me. But I, I, I roll with it, you know, he was a head of beer, so, you know, not a beer, a, he had beer, right? Beer's a rare commodity in the desert. So, uh, one day, so apparently when he was younger, so at the time I was like, uh, hmm, 20, 20 something years old, 26, and he, he must have been in his like 40s, maybe pushing 50s. And he told, so he showed me a picture of his with metal, like metal hair, like, not hair made of metal, you know what I mean, like, it's a metal head. I like metal too, but, but he had a hair and everything, the, the, the whole thing, the whole, uh, re regalia. So, but he told me, I say, oh, wow, you must have felt, it must have been hard for you when you lost your hair. And he, he got red, right? He got red and he goes like, lost my hair. I'll say, well, yeah, I mean, your, your hair here now, you're kind of bald. And he goes like, I only shave this way because it's comfortable. But he can't see the stubble, right? <laughs> and on top, it was like reflective. It was chrome. My answer was, no, oh, all right. Hey, dude, you don't have to be a dick every time. You know, I'm not going to tell the guy, look, you lying sack of shit. Now, the guy wants you to leave a delusion. Who am I to pull him out of it, you know? I was like, oh, I get it. Yeah, no, that makes sense. It's, it's good to be comfortable. <laughs> but, and then the guy goes on. Let me tell you something else about that guy. So one time he told me he lived in Thailand and he spoke Thai. But again, like I said, he, he lied a lot. So I had a, there's an episode of the family guy that Quagmire speaks Thai. And I happen to know, not because I speak Thai, I happen to know because I looked it up. I, I used to read a big fan of Family Guy. Not now, but, you know, you should be. And uh, I'm reading the dialogue, and it uh, turns out that Seth MacFarlane 
because uh, like South Park, uh, Team America, World Police, they don't do like real foreign languages, so they just go like derpy 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 derp. But um, Family Guy, they actually like to use actual language. And so I knew what Quagmire said. So I would bring my laptop from my trailer out in the desert, walk all the way to his place, very rarely, but because he had solar panels. And we, we go watch this, the Family Guy, so drinking beer and watching this Family Guy episode. And then he goes, I, I waited for the part with Quagmire to speak Thai, right? It's the one with the airport. I think Peter wants you to be a redneck, right? And, and I was like, I'm going to catch him on his lie. Just, I just want to see if he's lying. Nope, he actually spoke Thai and, <laughs> and translated it perfectly, which surprised the fuck out of me because I thought it was bullshitting because, you know, there's a guy that bullshits around, around a lot. But it's very funny. <laughs> he, he actually spoke Thai perfectly. He, he, he translated it perfectly. So he lied a lot, but going to Thailand, speaking Thai and living there, that's not one of the lies. So I was surprised. So the respect went up a bit, but there was a whole ball of stuff. So I'm trying to trying to see what I'm doing here. Edging in that inside. Well, thank you. Uh, four to five and four to six, we get to call. The task is Celtic. My surname is Celt, and that's extremely rare. I uh, I have Scottish blood, but also you could argue Saxon because Dutch blood. Um, yeah. Maybe I'd like to visit the. Later, boys in Thailand. Hey, nothing wrong with, you know, taking the tickling the pickle every now and then. <laughs> I, uh, I gotta say, I gotta say, uh, a lot of those later boys, and look, I don't know if that's a disrespectful term. Please don't call me out on it. I don't mean any harm. But uh, a lot of them are very pretty. I gotta, I gotta tell you. Not very, very pretty. They beat a lot of our women these days, to be honest with you. Uh, and they seem like, uh, from what I've seen them there, you know, I've never been to Thailand and all that, but I've seen them interact, and they seem pretty happy. You know, they seem like they're they're quite happy. But yeah, I guess a lot of guys going there for a lot of guys go to. I think I don't know why I came back here. A lot of guys go to those countries for 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 sex tourism, right? Now the lady boy stuff, there's nothing wrong with that, but uh, the the problem is when they go for children, my god, yeah, you'll hear all those scumbags on there, that's so disgusting, underage girls, it's, it's, it's very bad, I'm, I'm very happy when the Thai authorities or the people out there go on and uh, arrest the scumbags and, and give them a lot of hard, like, hard many years in, in, in prison, as it, sh as, as it should be. I'm trying to see, so, okay, gotta strategize here, this time not jump in the water. I'm thinking, does that open something up there? Follow those logs. Maybe I didn't kill all those logs. Huh? So if I jump here, that's death. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Okay. No, it's not okay, man. It's pretty motherfucking. Oh! You okay? That's a camera crapping. I need to get a second one. Yeah, but. It that guy speaking Thai that made my day. Okay, follow this log. Yeah, mild, uh, mild, back, uh, m very mild back seating as far as hints is okay today. I, I, you know what I really hate? Just very un aggressive, unsolicited back seating. That really piss, pisses me off. So on any game, unless I like, if I go like, I need back, I hold my hand, please. And then yes, because I ask, right? But uh, yeah, hints here and there is, is fine. Sounds like a smoke detector going berserk. Trying to think, uh, okay, let me, let me think here. There's no hurry. Are you in a hurry? I'm not in a hurry. It's a long, we've got a long night ahead. The night is young. So I don't know, for some reason I want to, I want to come up here, right? I think it makes sense. What I heard about this game is that the easier way is not the way. Like you explore the easier ways, but it's the hard way. That's where you want to go, right? So let me think here. And by the way, God bless this internet has been working fine. I'm still over the moon. I'm, I'll never get over that shit that the internet here is actually working out. It is fantastic. Let me see here. So, Master Price says, follow this log. Say, I might have fucked it up. Oh, the hint was not, not good. There's a reason they call it Bangkok, not Bangkok, honey. 
<laughs> That's true. I never been to Southeast Asia. It looks like uh, the first foreign food I ever eaten was uh, like going to a foreign restaurant was uh, Thai food, and uh, I was amazed by it. It blew me away. Their food was very good. I like Thai people. They they seem happy and cheery. I like them. Thai uh, Filipino people. They they're all uh, they're full of life somehow. You know, it's good. Good people. Let me see here. Because you can't jump diagonal, that's a part that I'm thinking about. That, uh, do I need to step on the foot? What is the foot thing? You got a foot fetish here? And look, man, I don't want to disappoint you with my brain power is very limited to non-existent. Okay, so you, you probably solved this in your head already, but unfortunately I ain't you. If I was, I would, uh, I would be far more successful in life. Okay, <laughs> and it's not, it's not me being fake humble, I am a big dumb animal, I really am, it's not like, you know, don't let me, don't let me fool you, and that's a, that's a true fact here, I may look like an idiot, I may talk like an idiot, but don't let me fool you, I really am an idiot, just, just keep, bear that in mind when you're watching my channel here and you're following, alright? Uh, I don't I don't see a way out of this here house thing is everyone I hear talk about Thailand and people go there to get themselves a wife I don't blame him the way things are going around here to be honest with you, you know, My wife is Asian. She's Chinese And you have some very nasty people that go like we couldn't get couldn't get yourself a white Western woman because you're a loser Oh, no, I have plenty of them. Thank you. I, I reject I, I didn't like the ones I well my last one was all right. She was a good person. She 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 got married to somebody else, but you know, uh, I don't I don't know. I don't see. I didn't see her as Asian. I saw her as we clicked, right? Uh, it was Planet Fish, and uh, we clicked, and uh, I just fell in love with her, and here we are, married. Uh, we ten years now. So, and I couldn't. Uh, it was the right decision, a hundred percent. So yeah. But some guys go there to get a wife because, you know, they get tired of the way things are here. I totally get it. But there's still good women here, too, you know. Hey, did I just uh, do this thing? <laughs> well, talking about going to Thailand to get a wife. There you go. Hey. Ho, ho. So what the fuck? So it was all that pop, 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 that simple. I told you. Took me a while to get that one, didn't it? Are you convinced that I'm an idiot yet? B, be convinced. Apparently archers are a thing with foot fetish. Yeah, I don't get the foot, foot fetish. Synth Lord is signing off now. Getting late. Have a good night, Synth Lord. The Hangover was a good movie. The nipple part. Just the guy's little winner. Oh, well, I, I like the one too. The, the guy got drunk and he had the... Uh, relations with the with the later boy and uh, he was like oh so I what is it when I uh, unload unloaded it's like unloaded I think you get a mistake mistaken with English and then she takes her clothes off and she's got a winner you know if I had I was like you fuck it you know so what so what motherfucker you know all right let's go in the explorer mold there he is you can only jump over one block no I know that one uh Nitro Red said, later on we're going to get a power for two, jumping over two blocks, blocks, right? So that's good. Okay, I, I keep forgetting we can. Okay. So we got ourselves a torch here. I got a question for British viewers. If you call a flashlight a torch, then what do you call a torch? Something else? Torch 2? Or just torch and, and that's it? I mean, granted, there's not a lot of situations. Well, that you have a torch and a flashlight? I guess at the same time, but maybe. Let's say you're in a cave and you're trying to preserve the battery on your flashlight. And you have a torch. But you're British. And you tell your, your companion, can you pass me the torch? I guess you could add the battery torch. Master Pies have fire stick. <laughs> Uh, 
typing on a gamepad, by the way. 2001. Gamepad? What is that one? You ever seen that, uh... I hope I... I, I hope I got all the stickers. You ever seen that GameCube, uh, keyboard? I regret not get, getting that. I, I bet it's fucking... It was already expensive a few years ago. I bet it's gonna be, like, horrific now. Playing the NES. I, I don't... No, I can't, can't go there this way. I can, to be honest, uh... Two torches? That's madness. I tend to still call it a Nintendo, so if you hear me say Nintendo, I mean the NES. Like... Yeah, but what's in here? I want to know all the secrets. Oh, but... I know you get punished. You get punished sometimes for... I, I, know, I know there's going to be traps. I, I, I'm inclined to say this, say this here is not the way in the hard way that we open up yonder. That's going to be the right way to go. And that's where we're headed. There we go. Uh, I wonder if they're gonna have enemies like the Dark Nuts. Fucking asshole came at an angle. Ah! Came at an angle. I hate when they do that. Hey, I can move on a grid here. Let's show some respect. I gotta get familiar with the with the HUD here, so I have half half of the hard left. So sort of like Zelda kind of bit on that. I wanted to play Nintendo to and yes and I, but I'm not having trouble with the sync through my Xtrome. Oh, what what kind of Nintendo you have, bud? You have oh shit! How do I use the? Uh, I love this here. The pause is the little guy. He holds the, the, a placard that says pause. Isn't that awesome? Uh, I need to figure out how. Oh, okay. Can I? Ah! Idiot. I thought she was gonna shoot me here. That's why I jumped. Don't, don't, don't blame it. All the way to the beginning, is that it? And I don't mind. We're, we're, we're playing the game. I'm, again, do you see motherfucking speed running on my title here? No, then shut the fuck up. I'm gonna just play as I, I, I wish here. I'll make mistakes, I'll repeat them. The game has a save feature. I tell you what, a lot of uh, Nintendo games I love, but uh, man, you wanna know what intimidates me in games? A lot, but I still play them. But I go like, it, it takes my confidence away that I'll tell you, you know, I'm going to beat this game here tonight. Um, limited continues, and this game ain't got it. Um, um, you got unlimited continues here, as far as I know. I mean, there's a save feature for crying out loud. Was there anything here? Uh, I don't think... How did you open a second one? I know the boss is in there, but... I opened something here. Okay. I want to check the uh, the other side a little bit. Maybe there's some some sort of weapon or something. Okay. Have a front loader with the TMI. Same same here. This one is not. This one is stock, but my second one is. You know, I have a second NES here. Uh, that is. Uh, let me have a, a quick smoke. Sorry. I have a uh, an NES here that is. It was a bit a bit of a disappointment to me. So I bought this RGB, what was one of the first consoles I bought, uh, and it was RGB modded NTSC, supposed to be. So the guy was out of stock, I'm not going to name the store, but I, I asked the guy, do you have, oh, do you still have NTSC uh, Nintendos? And I know where you're going to go with this, just wait a tiny bit, because you're going to say it's the same thing, no. So he said, I, I, yes, there's one left. So he sold it to me, and I was using RGB. Uh, YPBPR doing just fine, right? One day, no, I was using RGB. So one day I wanted to expand and, and, and add the YPBPR add-on to the Tim, to Tim's RGB mod. So when I opened the console, my heart sunk because I saw the three letters that I don't want to see inside, P-A-L. And then I educated myself a tiny bit on the, on the subject matter that there's no such a thing as a region modded uh, NES, you convert it to NTSC, so it's just as good as an NTSC console, but it is not, it is not, uh, and that's why I got this one, the second one, because it is all fine and dandy as long as you're using RGB component or 
composite. The RF is untouched. So I don't know what the fuck the RF turns you. See, and I'm playing RF here. So I, I this CV is America only. It's American standard, does not accept any other, you know, NTSCJ, none of that. It'll be a different frequency. Yeah, can adjust pots and all that. But yeah, so I actually don't know what the fuck is, it, is up with that one now because it's gonna be a different frequency. It's gonna be PAL 60, PAL frequency. Can I adjust that to, to match NTSC? I don't know what goes on. Pal sucks, yes it does. 50 hertz guy cannot say a thing. No, I can't stand it. I'll always be very direct here, because in my opinion. I, I can't stand Pal 50. I despise it. Unless it's Pal 50 stuff, like ZX Spectrum. Uh, even a Master System. Okay, so this is... This is Sun. There you go. I should have gone here first. I was having a talk with a guy the other day about the uh, Master System European exclusives, and a uh, fellow was playing Sonic. I didn't, of course I'm not going to be saying a bunch of shit on a guy's chat and shitting on his 50 hertz stuff. Arcus! There's that guy. My most, my more successful twin brother. <laughs> my brother from another mother. How you doing, Arcus? All right, man, dress the Raiders here. Good shit, Arcus. Uh, outstanding. You know that clip? that you had a little guy in the mansion. I, I downloaded it, I saved it. I need to have that. So not only uh, Arcus came here the other day uh, via Christine's friend, I was at Christine's uh, stream the other day. Welcome in Raiders. Uh, Arcus has been great to me, it's, it's been good. And I'm, I'm very happy I met him. Uh, well, here, you know, I haven't met him in person. But uh, Princess Retro follows. And uh, welcome in y'all, Arcus part two. It's a very low budget one. It's a very low budget part two. Is that is that we did very bad at the box office and this is all we got left for this next movie, but by God I'm gonna push it through sort of arc as part two. If I'm being honest here, CJ the streamer. Uh thank you for following Brian E42. I think I missed another one here. Hi CRT Rex and CRT is Rex mustache. Hi. Harder. And I got a, a black screen. Thank you, Agato, for that disruption. Uh, Blocky Games st Studio, thank you for following. We get <laughs> working 1984, Art Desk, Desk, Shin Pig, Shin Dip Pig. Uh, staying for a while. Good to hear. All welcome here, and I hope you enjoy your stay. Um, my goodness, Maximum red Headroom, the Maximum Headroom, I'm kidding, that guy got away with it. Uh, Shindig dig Pig, Maximum Headroom, uh, thank you everyone for following, work in 19, 1984, welcome in and thank you uh, very much for the uh, the raid Arcus, uh, I, I mean it's kind of redundant, but you, you can give Arcus a shout out, I think everybody knows who Arcus is by now, right? If you don't, where, where the fuck you been, you know? This is highly entertaining for the last half hour. Well, thank you. Uh, none of it is overlaid. Just show it real quick here, y'all. Zell Dirt follows. Thank you. Uh, there you go. It's all real stuff. All, no, no nothing here. No, no crazy trickery. No motherfucking green screen. None, none of that shit. Uh, I'm not a PG-13 guy. Uh, <laughs> you find somebody made a joke once calling me darkest because I'm, I'm chill right now but sometimes I rage a bit you know just a heads up uh, I'm not a perfect man <laughs> and I mean rage not like I'm like uh, all right because I go God bless her because I, I wish I had the patience that that man has and the talent but I don't so I got to make do with what I have here <laughs> all right uh, Thank you for the shout out to Arcus and uh, yeah, uh, thank you for the compliments. Uh, a lot of yeah, I do CRTs here. Um, I don't always, I don't always, always, I don't always play the NES. Uh, it's my favorite console. I play a, a variety of stuff. Sometimes I play modern. Sometimes I play kind of modern, kind of retro, beyond retro. Uh, but everything is sort of like this on a CRT, and I try my best to match the CRT 
for the most part with a console and kind of, you know. And that's it. And uh, if you're wondering what the webcam is also row, it's an actual camcorder. I usually have it in the frame here, but not today. I'm going to keep it time to be cleaner. And that's it. People that don't get mad at video games are normal. They're lizard people. That's that's Ark is right there. The conspiracy is real. Thank you for following SSKFBSTS. And uh, love a man who appreciates an old solid old scoop tube. I have I have a few of them. I have a couple of CRTs here. Yeah. Zell Dirk. All right. I'll give you all some gameplay uh, while you're here. And uh, once again, welcome everyone in. Um, here you're more than welcome and i appreciate all the follows and the lurkers and and arcas god bless you man and uh keep up the good work big fan of his i've always said that here uh the volume is high that's not a problem very easy to adjust uh we're at 6.8 let's go down to 8.6 how's that for for a change does that sound a little time to be better if it's still high it's high for me here but let me know so we're playing Star Tropics here today for the first time. I'm a bit confused here because uh, the other side is where the snake boss is. So I'm going to see what, what's up with this here. So first time playing it. And we'll see how we do here. I think I think I know where this is headed because I watched Nitro Red's video. And this is a tale of men's greed. Because I think when you open the... Uh, I'm, look, I'm going to take the bait. I, I kind of need to know. I'm aware that one of them here is going to be a fake ass exit, and when I go through it, I'm going to die. And I think it's this one here right now. But I, uh, for science, right? Now, you come here the first time. Yeah, I'm not going to shit on the game, man, but it, it's kind of funny. You, you come here the first time and I, oh, I got a, I got an upgrade. Whoa, I got a second one. Can I go for a third one? No, bastard. You're going to die and you're going to die right the fuck now. And you're going to join the, the great pantheon of other dissolved skeletons in that rotten, putrid lake. And that's it. But I wanted to know, you know, the whole thing, it should be, you know, I don't, and I, I lost track, to be honest. Princess Retro cheered 100. So I don't mind repeating the level to show you this because I was semi aware, semi semi aware of it from watching Nitro Red's uh, videos, Nitro Red's video. Uh, so yeah. Wait, Rex, is it? You were a few days ago at Arcus stream, correct? Yeah, I was. I, I like Arcus and I watch him um, here and there. To be honest, I watch him before, but I, I tend to stay quiet on other people's chat. Uh, but because he had come here, he talked here, I said, yeah, I might as well talk there. And uh, So that was me. Yeah, that was me. Me out there. Prince of Retro, I love your accent. Thank you. Fan gurgling so hard right now. Need to shut. No, y'all can talk as much as you want. Is this game wrapped in the Southern Baptist Convention? Oh, there's a Southern Cross. So maybe that's a hint to things to come. One before, bro, I was here when this channel was getting two views. Yeah, I started here. I had nobody. I uh, I keep my views off. I don't want to know how many. So I have no idea, and I just keep it that way. So I don't get nervous. I don't get... Uh, I'm a talkative person, and I'm, I, I do have social skills. I, I can't talk, and I, I got no... Trust me, I got no problem talking to folks. But deep inside, I'm a, sort of a lone wolf, but... Uh, as for views and stuff, my deal here with Twitch was to come here and just play play games. Max Gibson follows, thank you. Just play games and uh, whatever happens out of it happens, you know. What are you going to do, man? I, I got no power over it. Um, and do do my thing, you know, just do my type of content and just be me here. Be a little old me, you know, and, and see where that, where that goes. And I don't want to do direct capture. I don't want to play the games that are popular. I don't want to play the games that... It'll get me the views and, and none of that. I don't want to. I don't want to. I don't want to chase numbers. I never wanted to. So it took me a while to get here and have stable internet. Before that, I couldn't even stream. I had to do like a, I wanted to stream from the get go, but I had to do like YouTube videos first because I didn't have the right um, amount of internet. And up until recently, I've been kind of kind of screwed here with the internet. Many times I have to kill the stream. 
Princess Retro, thank you for the cheering once again. Very kind of you. Yeah, and it, it took a friend of mine from Scotland to tell me what was wrong with the internet, and it's been a dream ever since, is recently that the internet has been sorted, so uh, um, I can stream now in a, in a time. So right now, what I'm working to do here is a, a bit of, come on, a bit of consistency and a bit of, um, a bit of, uh, uh, working on towards a schedule, so uh, a starting schedule and a schedule. No, sometimes I stream for 11 hours, uh, 12 hours is my limit. Uh, I'll say an average six, six to seven hours, eight hours, nine hours. Sometimes I go it depends, I, whatever you know. Uh, no Fortnite, no, I can't stand that game. I don't like Fortnite. I don't like turn-based RPGs. Uh, I don't like a lot of things. I'm a hateful old man sometimes. But uh, you know what I like? I really like, and I like. I like to give things a chance, but some things are just not for me. Now, I played uh, I played the PS5 here. Did I open that thing? Did I? I did. I, I think so. I played uh, Astro Bot Bot's Playroom recently here on a, on a GDM FW900. Uh, I play a weird-ass game on, on Steam on a CRT, a high-resolution CRT. Uh, so I play a variety of stuff, but unfortunately Fortnite, I can't say, look, modern games, I think, I think of those popular games, uh, Fall Guys looks like is a lot of fun. I want to play Man Hunter, sorry, Man Eater is the shark one. I want to play Dead Island 2 at some point. Uh, I want to play, oh, here's what I bought recently. Uh, I have a friend of mine here, Chase, who sent me some, um, some games, some Dark Souls games. Yeah, I'm going to get into it, but look what I bought here just now. So this is liable to happen at some point, and uh, I don't know, I think from what I understand, if you like rage and uh, the cussing and the hollering, you're going to love it. And you can go like, wow, we're going to play that game for a week? You viewers are going to tank. You're going to scare away the retro folks. I'm just a guy, man. If you just like retro and I'm playing modern, <clears throat> don't get your panties in a bunch. I'm going to go back to retro. you will always be retro here, but not just exclusively all the time and just like I'm locked up to retro and that's it. I never envy sometimes some... Some people are happy doing the same thing and bless their hearts. They're they're doing fine and they, they don't need my, my advice. Who the fuck am I, right? But some people I notice on YouTube, they get, I won't follow. You can't always unfollow. You can come back. I know you're kidding, but that's fine. Unfollowing is fine too. Look, some people come here, they see the CRTs, they click on it. They, oh my goodness, this is so good. I'm going to follow this guy forever because uh, the CRTs. And then, my, and then they see my personality and they go like, this guy has... I don't know, this guy's as interesting as a, as a wet carrot. And this guy's raging here, he cussed. He, he cussed strong words, I cuss. Uh, not all the time, I don't force cussing. I, well, if I wanna cuss, I just cuss. If I'm, if I'm angry, I'm angry. If I'm not angry, I'm not gonna be angry. I'm never gonna like come here and fake and... I don't wanna, what do you call, flanderization of your character, right? So, I really like the rage, Rex. And then I start just raging for no reason. And then it's so fucking transparent, it's, it's, it's laughable, right? I don't wanna be that type of person. So I'm, I'm literally, the point of my stream should be as natural as possible. If you meet me in person, I'm the same guy. For better or worse, you know? So, Princess Raptor said, thank you, super cool, no matter what. We you playing? Well, thank you. I appreciate it. It's a variety of console in its purest form around here, definitely. I, I, I even went back to um, changing. So last, last stream was a... Uh, VGA monitor and it was a Dreamcast. So now we're here with a, a 1980s RF only set and we're playing the Nin um, an unmodded Nintendo. Yes, I love RGB. I have PVMs and this and that and whatnot. But uh, by God, I grew up with RF and I'm here to tell you that RF is, is just fine. It, it looks great. Look, maybe not as much for you at home there because I got to go out of focus here with the shit ass camera I have right now. I'm, I'm gonna be improving equipment here as time goes by, but for now this will do, you know? Uh, and it looks fantastic here in person. It looks amazing. You have the Dreamcast VGA adapter. You know, it's funny you mention that. I just got like a, what's it called? A, a VGA cable. I, I know about the, the what, do, what do you call that? El Toro, the boxes. Did I go to the other side? I don't think I did yet, did I? Sometimes I'm, I'm also senile, and sometimes I don't know where where I've been or 
<laughs> what happened, huh? What just happened? A lot of times I forget the brake overlay. So I, I think you're done being here. You just goofing around. Holy dog shit. And I'm streaming. I used to stream out of a shed, and I'm streaming out of a trailer now, which is where I live. I, I live in a trailer. I, I didn't go to college. What do you want from me, you know? It's fine. It, it, it's a box. We live inside it, and it does the job. So let me see here. Uh, catch up with the chat. Uh, again, I'm terribly sorry if I don't. Uh, the soul stream won't be PG. Princess Retro, thank you for the cheering. I appreciate it. And I'm terribly sorry. Thank you very much for your kindness, man. Uh, I tell you what, uh, I'm sorry if I don't, uh, I don't, I don't read all the chat. I try my best here to, to do that. I, I'm, I'm sort of kind of new with this and kind of dumb. You look like somebody that appears on a meme, a cowboy man at the airport. Well, if I'm out there uh, on a meme, I, I wouldn't be, I know memes, but I wouldn't be aware of it. I hope it's a good meme now. I don't think so. But you, who, who knows, right? You could be. Any of us could be in a meme and you, you just might not know about it. I was reading about, about a guy who was on OnlyFans and he, he wasn't aware of it. So, <laughs> you know, it's kind of crazy. Uh, so CJ says I have some questions. So the, the meme thing, is, send it to me. Have you ever competed in a big 20? I don't have, um, I don't have any special ability to, to compete on anything. Uh, I was a bull rider when I was young. That I competed in that, but I, I got nowhere with it after two years. But I did ride bulls when I was young. Uh, that's, I think that's a, I'm thinking here, I think that's as far as I went as far as competition, competing on anything. Uh, as far as video games, I don't have talent on any video game to compete with anyone, to be honest, if I'm being honest here. Okay. But if you like competing, you might, here's how you would lose everyone. Look. So if you like competing, you're competing, you say, uh, there's this new game called Raid Shadow Legends, and after you get the hail, uh, you, what is it called? Hello Fresh order? Uh, please enter the code SELLOUT, uh, upon checkout on, uh, on Raid Shadow Legends to, to get, I don't know what they do in there, uh, get a wizard? I, I don't know. You get something, I tell you what you won't, <laughs> you lose the respect for me, but you get something out there. <laughs> yeah, and of course I don't have a um, Raid Shadow Legends sponsorship, and I never will. Uh, Raid Shadow Legends will never be part of my content. It's just, it has to be something I believe in. Like our next, next sponsor, G Fuel. I would do G Fuel. I never drunk G Fuel, but it is a drink. You know, what, what of it? <laughs> we only fans only. That's, it's a secret to everyone. Okay, we head on up here. We head on up here. So now we know two screens there, and if you if you go any further, you're gonna you're gonna die, and you're gonna die horribly. This, that that water probably stinks. Good luck with Star Tropics, Echo Runner. Thank you. Get a beer, me. Thank you, Princess. I appreciate it. Hobo Anderson, lovely to see you. Thank you for streaming. Thank you kindly. You don't have to call him sir. I'm, I'm terribly with the names, and I there's a guy here, friend of ours, it, and Kiwi Bird 22 follows. Thank you. There's a guy here. His name is Mr. Liffer, and he's been here pretty much since the beginning. But he told me Liffer is just fine. But I, to this day, I still I still call him Mr. Liffer. It just kind of stuck. I am terrible with with name uh, memorizing, to be honest. <laughs> or, or, you know, I'm just just a terrible memory overall. I, this is kind of, is that, do I go up there? What just happened? Uh, CJ chatting too much, there's no such thing here. Also, another thing about my stream, with everyone here, uh, you have complete freedom of speech, you're allowed to cuss, you're allowed to do anything, obviously, like racial slurs and stuff like that. Uh, talking about any topics, if something is off limbs, I'm, I'm very direct. Some people might mistake it for rudeness. I vape sometimes, too, so am I here vaping? Uh, CJ is good. Uh, so you're good talking about anything you won't hear. There's nothing off limits. I'm a very thick-skinned person. If somebody's out of line, I'll just tell them like backseaters or something like that. I'm very blunt and direct. I I, I, I take pride in it. That's the way I, I that's the way I was raised. So some people don't like it, and that's I don't give two shits about it. So I tend to be uh, I try to be polite, but I, I'm very direct. So anything you can talk about anything here. A B generation. There's nothing off limits. If there is, I'll just tell you. 
I put the chat rules. That's pretty much the chat rules. Just I avoid politics. I don't want to touch politics with a ten foot pole. Uh, that's it. Right, center, left. I don't care. Get me out of it. Uh, and that's all. Uh, and I do. I don't like backseating. Aggressive backseating. Uh, besides that, I don't know. I don't. I don't think there's any, anything else in there. A rush me. People sometimes. Some people get rush. Rush me. Are you talking to the chat too much? You're not playing the game. I'm like, well, I'm not a speedrunner. I'm not doing a challenge, and it's my goddamn stream. So you know, I don't know what to tell you. Your politics are probably wrong anyway. Yeah, either way. Oh, half the people get pissed off. It's, it's a no-win situation. All I can say besides speaking English, I speak Spanish. Well, CJ, yo hablo un poquito español también, pero no mucho. Pero comprendo más lo que hablo. So you never know what you're going to get here with me. All right. Give me a second. And I, look, I'm, I hope I caught everyone here. Okay, 8-bit generation. Uh, well, thank you. Thank you for following. You're from Texas? I live there. I'm not from there. I'm from Mississippi originally, but I live in Louisiana as a kid, and I live, I've, been, I've been actually overseas for a very long time. Uh, thank you for following East Books. You're from Houston. I have Ken in, I think it's Dallas, Middle Uh and I live near College Station. I think it's somewhere around Bryan, somewhere around there. It wasn't a farm, though. It was nowhere near town. Uh, been through there, man. man it's a Texas awesome. Yeah, we have we have Texan friends here, and is uh, it's excellent. Master Pycelle, you also speak Thai. That's impressive. Tabernet next studio says polite and vulgar. I am vulgar. I'm not well educated. I am pretty much trailer trash. Make peace with it. Sorry. Um, I, sometimes, yeah. Sometimes I'm not uh, not highbrow here. I say, uh, I cuss sometimes. It's just, uh, you know, it's just the way I was built. To be honest, not in person. If I, in person. Well, in person, yeah. In private. If I go... Okay, is the... Wait a minute. Did, is that the snake boss? No. No, okay. Uh, I don't... Uh, in public, no. I don't, I don't cuss in public. I think that's very ugly, to be honest with you. Uh... So you you probably probably if you met me in a public place you'll be you, you're liable to get surprised, you know, uh, on how I conduct myself at home. Yeah, I don't even shield my kids from from uh, cussing. To be honest, it's, it's kind of I don't want to shield them from a lot of things. So I have three youngins here: one year old, uh, uh, three year old, and a now eight year old, and they uh, they're unique. They're, they're very good. They're very good kids. I tend not to shield them from, from from cussing. Of course, I'm going to shield them from nudity and gore and shit like that. Derp, derp you know. But uh, yeah, I try to I try to teach them how the real world is out there. You know, and, and, you know. Imagine I teach them you can't cuss, and then they go work in a construction site, and then you know, da daddy was wrong. It's okay. Uh, the the get get the the they they get sorry man <laughs> I beat this game when I was nine or ten I felt like I, I really achieved and you did it, 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 look a lot of people that beat NES games when they're kids it's a hell of an achievement don't ever don't let don't ever let them take that away from you because the games on the Nintendo are hard they're not easy CJ says you're leaving Texas I lived there before not now I actually uh. Have been overseas for quite some time. There are enough Karens in public cussing, so it's fine not to cuss. Yeah, I, I don't know. Is it? I'm weirded out by cussing. Did, did you did you know that in the great state of great great state of Mississippi, and this is no joke, cussing in public is technically illegal. Uh, you can you can be fined or in or arrested. It's not enforced for the most part, but the law is there. Look it up. I'm not I'm not shitting you. Cussing is illegal, Mississippi. Uh, but I tell you that much. If you if you cuss in public, Mississippi people don't like it. Even even like saying "God damn," you know. Uh, I, I think we stopped at you, right? That's we established that. Thank you, but no thanks. So we, we we got that one. We're not we're not doing the trap thing again, right? We've done it one time. I try not to cuss. Princess Retro and I we. 
I, I cuss a lot, so be part of me in, in advance. And I, I, I'm talking like, okay, well, well, might as well. Okay, let's see. I don't. I, t I can't remember the fuck. Okay, we'll, 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 the cussing will come so at some point. Uh, some, I don't go out of my way too. It's just a, a natural thing, you know. So, because I know if people are used to PG content, uh, this is not for me. Like, because I know y'all, a lot of y'all come from Arcus. I'm an Arcus, and uh, he's a very clean guy, and and that's good. Uh, but unfortunately, I, I'm not really. So please don't. <laughs> part of my indiscretions in 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 advance, okay? Uh, but you know, I'm a grown-ass woman. I can take it, yeah. Cause I say I say stuff here sometimes, you know. N never to my chat, just out of frustration. And I yell and I holler. I get red. It's just, you know. But I I try not to. I, I, I'll be on it's a bit of an anger problem sometimes. But I I try I try my best. I, I try my best not to be too angry. Cause I, I think I swear one of these days I'm gonna have a heart attack here on stream. So I try to take it easy because I get very angry sometimes. Okay, uh, so the, we establish it. So can I, can I uh, use the thing? How do I? Okay, can can I use this? So the snake don't shoot this way, right? Okay, is are you dry heaving? What's it? <laughs> can I get greedy? Ah! Damn it. Come on. Open what? Here it comes. Okay. I was touch and go there for a while, but. Yay. The angry plus the nicotine, yeah, that ain't help. Without the nicotine, I'll be a ten, a, a tenfold angrier. R rated around here, so sensitive folks, cover your ears. I is R rated. I even put on YouTube, I put the viewer discretion. All my streams start with the viewer discretion is advised. So, viewer, and like I try to make that as clear as possible so people don't mind. Look, sometimes I try to avoid rating some folks because uh, they play clips and I'm very embarrassed about the clips and so on there because it's me, it's me yelling and saying, you know, horrible things. So, <laughs> you know, I feel sorry for them. They have to, to deal with it. So, I'm even hazard and I'm. Look, I don't want to bother anyone, you know. But like on my stream is my thing, you know. I've always, it's it's the way I've, I've always been. Not gonna lie, it would be amazing if you jump in the water after killing the snake. Oh god, that'd be a fucking nightmare. Huh? Is it legal to cuss my city? Yeah, technical. There's a there's a law. Uh, I looked it up because uh, you know you can't people tell you stuff and then you go look it up and it's like that's a bunch of shit. Uh, nope, it's in there. I never knew about it, uh, but it, it's in there. But in Mississippi, let's. Well, that's where I'm from. It's, it's really frowned upon to, to cuss in public. I remember one time I was in a hospital, and that was me all fucked up, right? Some folks beat me up. That's a long story. It's water under the bridge. But anyways, and I said, because the goddamn, and the, the lady was like, watch your mouth, young man. I was like, I'm sorry, man. I didn't mean to, to go off that way. Goddamn, that's it. That's all I said. Imagine if you watch my stream, she'll have a heart attack for sure. Yeah, the raid fe feels wholesome. See, and the clip comes in and you're screaming. That's right. So I, you know, I when I raid here, it's it's a it's a I don't have a lot of numbers, so it's a gesture of, of goodwill the way I see it. And um, but yeah, if it's a guy with a very soft spoken voice and it's PG and has the automatic. And, and then I go there screaming obscenities, you know. Is there more secrets here? I, I don't think so, right? No, just, yeah, I don't want to die here. Wow, you've done it! Get her done! The lady almost died from what, what you said. Yeah, let me see here. Anybody on YouTube? Nope, nothing new there. It depends on the game. It, yeah, it depends on the, the anger pleasant. Okay? Yeah, no, I read that one. Hey, Sage Masters here. Watch me play F Zero. You hear me curse. That game can be hard. I haven't, I haven't done it like a deep dive on it here. I played with a friend of mine, Shiro, who came here. He brought the monitor for me, and we played F Zero. And uh, yeah, it gets, uh, gets stuff out there. Americola, fuck yeah. <laughs> I love it. 
now he yells and screams like you. Oh, thank you. Yeah, you get the issue of me here or not. Look, my content content is not for everyone, so. But uh, it's for some people, you know. And uh, either way, y'all welcome in here, and I appreciate y'all being here. The vaping has been godsend to me because I used to smoke Marlboro Reds, and they ain't cheap, special around here. And, uh, you know, they stink up everything, stain everything, so the, the vape just helped me out tremendously. I've been va vaping since the cig like days, you know, when they had a vape that looked like a cigarette and normal smoke. So, yeah. Don TV says, what a beauty of a CRT set. So, class, I'll show you around here. Time to meet again. Open here. Do some fine tuning. All kinds of things. Is <laughs> our F on it. It does the... You, you ready for the volume? I'll mute the vo the volume here, and you can hear the TV. It sounds better. <laughs> My kids are asleep. Is that awesome? <laughs> All right. <laughs> There you go. It's uh, no, down here. You got V hold, hue, color, brightness, picture. You got two your fine, and this here is pristine. It is pristine. Uh, not a fucking scratch. Well, there's one. There's a scratch here. Where are you? Somewhere around here. I seen you. Uh, let me put him so I can. Oh God damn it! With the shitty ass short cables. Why is everything short? I'm trying to. Sorry, you're gonna be dizzy a bit. I'm trying to. Get on top here. It's all like shiny wood, and you didn't even. God damn. Sorry about the shaking, as I know you're getting sick. There you go. That's more like it. What are you doing? Just show you around it. It's one of them woodies, you know? Rabbit ears antenna, of course. And there's a thing. Come on. Yeah, and there's the, uh, you know, the PVM, and there's a good old Nintendo, and there's a, a mess of cables back there. You don't want to, you don't want to look at that. But yeah, I love this set. I, I really, really, really do. There we go. Hope they gave you a little bit of a close up view to that. Thank you, princess. I love the. It just sounds so good, man. I wish I could play it here, but they... It just... It really pops, you know? It pops more than the microphone, the earphones. Thank you, Balloon Not Snipper. <laughs> Found footage or video. It makes it feel, makes it feel more authentic. I'm on the YouTube, figure it out, and fix it. But, oh, have you heard a thing about the overworld melody as a bug? No, I, I don't know much about this game, to be honest. Uh, first time playing it, I like it all together. Oh, shit, did I miss uh, some dialogue here? No, I didn't. It's fine. You survive. You're a survivor. So we're walk, walking around here, Sea Island. But boo. Dr. J's assistant. Mike, you know, Dr. J has a submarine. It's called Subsea. The ID code to the start of the engine of the Subsea is... is me... is me looking around for a pen. Oh, God damn it. You doing with the pens here, you doofus? I ain't got no pen. Where's my writing pen? Well, shit. Now you've done it. What in the hell? All right, do the digital way. No, fuck that. Man, I'm getting a pen. Sorry. Break time. I'm going to get a pen. Give me a second here. Enjoy the music. You know what? Let's do something unique. I'll, I'll turn this off. Enjoy the actual music from the the speakers while I go get a pen in the kitchen. Just, just, a, just a tiny bit. It needs to be written, Master by Cell. It needs to be written. I don't want to do digital shit. But give me a second. 
I'll be right back. I gotta take a leak anyways, so just give me a second. Might as well. Give me a second, y'all. I'll be right back. Hey! hey. It's my jam. All right, I'll be right back. Thank you, Princess. I appreciate it. All right, I'm, I'll be just nothing but a hot second. Sounds good. Sounds good right here. Maybe a bit, a bit kind of bit too loud. I'm, I'm hitting the keyboard. This is a tiny ass room, let me tell you. Here we are. I made it. We got ourselves a pen here, so we, we can write it down. I don't want to do. I don't have a smartphone in it. Oh, by the way, the smartphone is gone. It, it's dead. So I told y'all, get a goddamn shit ass smartphone, and the damn thing died on me already. It's dead. It won't charge. I'm back to the Nokia. It's not even a Nokia. Tiny ass, you know, shitty ass phone. I'm buying another, another uh, smartphone. I'm done with it. I'm, I'm, I don't want it. I don't want to do it. Where's the jitterbug? Okay, let's write. Let's write it down here. Just give me a second, y'all. Um, so Star Tropics. Ba, ba, ba. And what is this here about? Sub C, Sub C engine, and that's going to be fourteen ninety two. Reminding me of uh, Resident Evil, you know, doing all the codes and whatnot. Hmm. Workers here this time. Also, the security here on the side. Wait a minute, just give me a second. I'm no, I'm sorry. It's too, it, it's late here. I, I need, I need a. Chris and Grantor, thank you for the, the cheers. I just see who, who's out there. Oh, y'all have a good night now. There's a worker here. Oh, it's kind of late, so I gotta check, you know, who, who is out there. <clears throat> yeah, no, it's fine as a worker. So, you know, I keep an eye on the place here. I'm old man Lily. <laughs> Goddamn, it stinks out there. There's, there's a pig farm down the road. In holy dog shit, is it is it acting up today and is blowing down wind? It's horrific. It is horrific. Mm. That was pretty rough. Style of pen we had a nineteen eighty seven. Yeah, my daughter she loves those. Uh, those pen. I, I used to have one, but it was just black. What was black, blue, red, and green? I remember those. I, I used to love them. 
I don't know how to operate. How do I how do I put the thing back? I usually know this thing. Is it gonna halfway? There you go. Still got it. What's where's Tesla Matt? I thought for sure I'll see him. I'll see if the Emperor the Ark is right. Tesla Matt? Feller? Uh, thank you for following Fox Fox. Thank you. Let me see here from Yeah, this is a good pen. I love this pen. Don't need it without start. No, no need no star link here. I need to stop in and lurk in the stream more, to be honest. I'll, I'll thank you. Gonna go eat. I'll, bon apple tea. <laughs> All right, let's head, head back into the world of the survivor horror of Sea Island. The sea virus. It just is the incident. Okay, there you go. And once again, I appreciate y'all being here. Uh, thank you, and thank you, Arcus, and thank you, everyone here. Uh, uh, thank you kindly. The ID code, we, we got that. Memorize the ID code, and you just wrote that for nothing, you big doofus, right? <laughs> well, I, my crystal ball must have malfunctioned somehow, I think. I wish I could tell you more, but I'm afraid of... Afraid of who? Who's trying to silence you? So I did all that writing for nothing. I wrote over two words here. That's a lot of words, mister. Do that again. You are in chapter one. Oh, there we go. Any, what, what happens? Oh, okay. Just checking here. Remember, first time I'm playing this game. Leave my boot alone. He's, uh, he's hiding things. So we, we arrived here. Oh, that's a submarine. In the cockpit of Sub C. Welcome on board. I'm the na navigational computer of Sub C. Call me Navcom. I will call you Rob the Robot. How about it? A little bit of advertising. There's a purple one. There's a GameCube one. And put the ID code now. The code, ID code 1492. So all that bullshit about writing, that's just me on Resident Evil mode. Didn't need, didn't need no writing. I never played a game, so how the fuck would I know, huh? <laughs> so we're going on, on a trip here, across the seven seas. Saving your data, refrain from turning, or resetting. Dolphins, after a few hours, I mean, I love this music. Uh, oh, I'm free, I'm free to navigate. If you hit a rock, will you die? No. It's a, uh, I don't know for some reason too. I tried to do the best that I could with the collar. Uh, the collar is a lot my, more a lot more vibrant in person here than it is. What are y'all getting here? This on my LCD screen here. It don't look the same. Oh my goodness. Oh, I thought it was I thought it was a torpedo or something. The same some stuff here. Nav come here, Captain. She's a female dolphin. Begin translation. <clears throat> Please find my son it has disappeared. <coughs> May I promise her to find her boy dolphin? Well, that's a. I hope you, you fulfill your promise. Aye, aye, Captain. Thank you. Find my son. We'll, we'll get you it immediately. Thank you. On the Discord, I'm not there all the time. I'm not a big tech guy, but uh, it runs itself. It's uh, that there's mods in there and they know what they're doing a lot more than I am. I'm not a, you know, a big social media person like using social media. I appreciate the Princess Retro, but it's in there. I put my announcements here if you want to know what I'm up to as far as like, oh, why is it not streaming today? Well, we go to uh, my About Me on Twitch and I have the uh, a panel and I just put uh, updates in there. I try to keep up with it, you know, as best as I can. What happens if you go... Beyond, you can't. All right. 
Can we? Oh, there we go. <clears throat> I remember this part here from Nitro Rad's video. There's a, like a, these are the, like deeper parts. Should we dock? Yeah. 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 Mm-hmm. Hello, I maintain the lighthouse. So if, if you're looking for a boy, dolphin, sorry, but I have not seen him. Please visit my wife at a south house. She enjoys company. Oh, how come you in there then? Oh, you gotta work, I guess. You gotta put, somebody's gotta put, bring, bring home the bacon. Making sure I'm on top of the chat here. Okay, there's a rock block in my way. How about this here tree? Um, hmm. The plot thickens. So he said south, so I guess. Oh, game over. It's been a great stream. No, I'm, I'm, I'm joking. Uh, we'll probably have to do something with the... Okay, we did say that we'll find a dolphin, right? Can you go on? Oh! Oh, shit. Huh. Okay, there's something about... There's something about Mary. You ever seen that movie? I like that movie. Ben Stiller. The 49ers. Okay, there's a hut here. Oh. Oh, sorry. Here. Okay, this is Fowler's wife. I, I reckon uh, it's so sad when my husband and I get visitors. <clears throat> so, are you looking for a boy dolphin? Sorry, but I have not seen him. But early this morning, I saw a bottle on the beach. Wonder if it's a clue to the lost dolphin. Bottle on the beach. Well, let's look it up. Maybe some uh, Gene Beam in there. I ran out of sauce here a long time ago. I don't know. I'm not feeling. I'm not. I don't want to drink right now, so I haven't been drinking. And I ran out of beer too. It's all gone. I'm all dried up in here. Closest thing I have to it is a uh, cough drops. I, you know. Uh, all right. So how would I? I think it's submerged here. Didn't you? Did, didn't you? Tell me something about submerging. This is. Now how, and part of me, if you hear trucks outside, is the workers coming back. Cheers. Yeah, I used to drink on stream, but I, I don't know. I, 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 can, I can, I can, you know, I can hold my liquor, but that doesn't mean my, my liver can, so I kind of use that on it. <clears throat> okay, maybe. How would I? Just thinking out loud here. How would I, how would I go to the other side? teleport like Shane Tsung here. Okay. So I need to get... Oh, that's easy. Right? Can I... Can I dock anywhere? Let's head on back here. I, I thought those things were... You could submerge, but I reckon you can't. Can I... Okay, let's, let's go this way here. That's it? No, that's not it. Okay, can go to go, go up north. <clears throat> I enjoy it. Two fingers of Jack with a splash of Cove right now. Oh, that's good. Job distress was nice. Bourbon takes the edge off. I, I I think it's a nice reward. I, I can go too you know too long without whiskey because it's it's nice to have it. I I like mine neat though. But uh, you know people have it different ways. It's fine. Um, it's funny. I like Coke. I like Jack Daniels. I don't like a mix. I don't like anything in my whiskey, to be honest. But people, you know, they're creative, and they, they have a lot of stuff they like, and uh, that's awesome. I thought I was going to be able to get here with a submarine. That's not possible. After a hard day, or I don't know, sometimes I have aches, and it's good to have a whiskey. It's rewarding. It's all about, it's all about moderation, right? That's all. I'm thinking, what's the, what's the mystery here? I know. I thought it could. I thought it could submerge in those darker areas here. But am I misremembering stuff? 
Hmm. Like, you need to do something. Something's, something's about to happen here. That, that, that much is certain. <laughs> Certainly keep in moderation. Yeah, I, uh, I put it down too quick. I don't get, like, mess up drunk most of the time. Uh, but it just goes too quick and I can't keep up with it money-wise and I, I think health. I don't feel anything bad, but I'm sure that internal, you know, if you keep at it, it's gonna, it's gonna take a stow. Uh, whiskey's good. Whiskey's great. You know, I've been to the doctor a few times and when, when you got pain, some serious pain, and they wanna, they wanna paddle those goddamn painkillers, all that shit, and I, I know. I, I told I told a nurse one time I used oh you got because I, I was shot when I was young uh, and I said and well she said you use a use this painkiller and this and start giving names I'm like honey no I, I don't want to uh, I got whiskey whenever it's acting up uh, in my old battle scars I'll just uh, drink a bit of whiskey here and I'm good to go good old gambling CRT racks man again you know. And it works fine as a muscle relaxer, right? So, yeah. I'm a trauma nurse. I've seen a fair share of old used up alcoholics come through. It was a bad thing to see, yeah. Trying to save my family if we had any. Master Picel says, would you like a nitty bitty hint? And thank you for your politeness. And yes, definitely. You can give me a hint here. That's the right way to do any back seating. You just ask the fella, hey, do you, are you okay? Do you need a hint? And if the person says no, I would like to find it for myself, that's fine. And you move on. And if the person needs a hint, they'll just tell you, yeah. I, I, and I would like to have a hint here. I'm a, bit, I'm a bit confused here, so a little hint wouldn't hurt, right? It's okay. We're among friends here. So, yeah, I'll, uh, a trauma nurse, and that's got to be a, a, a no, Jesus Christ, no wonder. It's, uh, it's a stressful job. That would be. Feller, he said feller. I say feller a lot. I think that, not, I think it's mostly say f fellow. I can't say feller, fellow, fellow. <laughs> it's like, it's like saying oil. I can't, it's all. I just, I can't, I can't wrap my, my head around it. Now, now living outside for such a long time in no contact with the folks that do struggle to maintain my southernness, it's tough. It's a constant battle over the years, but I don't want to lose who I am, you know. And I'm not gonna say all oh, oil because it's not natural to me. Another thing I say to people is ma they made fun of me before saying alcohol instead of al alcohol. But it's uh, the way I've always said it, the way I heard, you know, back in the day. Stay on foot. Not all paths are visible. Stress was I get out, but I love my work. Well, there you go. If you love, they say if you love your work, you never work another day in your life. They ain't wrong. They ain't wrong. Well, that's good. I bet it. I bet you see some some fucked up shit out there at all. <laughs> Trauma center. I got some some nasty ass stuff. Sometimes that people hurt horribly. You gotta have strong strong stomach. So stay on foot. Oh, you say all in Texas too. Oh, there you go. Oh, here's another thing too that comes up sometimes. I don't have it here. So this here for me, right? This here's Coke. This here is Tropical Crush Coke. And people go like, you mean, you like Pepsi, Coke? And I'm aware, but Coke is just in my neck of the woods, a generic word for soda, soda pop, pop, soft drink, whatever. And I ain't alone. Plenty of people say say Coke. Everything's Coke. Yeah. There you go, folks. <laughs> so a lot of people are like, what the hell are you on about? Orange Coke. <laughs> Coke, Sprite, it's, co it's just Coke, right? If I want to say Coca-Cola, it's Coca-Cola. You know, I'll say the whole thing is there. I'm super, super Coca-Cola man today. I have it here because this room can't, is liable to get hot, uh, hot with the CRTs. Now I can fucking close the damn button here, can I? 
You know what I miss? Those snap on buttons, the, those snap things. I prefer, and now I put the fucking headphones on, oh my goodness, what are you doing, old man? Hmm. Now let's not unbutton this again, unless you're sure. I'm, I'm gonna drink some coke here, if you don't mind. Yeah, if I want to see a black one, like the black Cokes, now say cola. If I don't want to mention a, like a brand, like Pepsi, it's like, it's with cola, right? So specifically, well, I tell my wife here sometimes when I'm buying our Coke here for the month, which is a lot of it, I drink a lot of Coke, copious amounts of Coke. And I tell her, uh, would you, uh, if you could, my dear, try to get some more of the black ones, the, the, uh, no, say cola, and she go like, oh, which, which type, but like, like the black ones, right? Yeah, focus on that a, a bit more, but I, I like the other ones too. So let me see the hint was stay on foot. All pets are visible. Shit a hint. All pets stay on foot. All pets are visible. Say that I was close here. So stay on foot. That's a good hint. So it means I got. I'm sorry here if you if you're familiar with this game and you're watching this and you're pulling your hair out. Um. Can I? Can I? Can I jump here? Is it? No, this is a wall. Is it? It's a cliff wall. <clears throat> is this a section? This is the right section? A restaurant, I'll ask what kinds of Coke you have. There you go. Yank has never understood when I call Dr. Pepper Coke. And that's as taxes as, as taxing as it gets, Dr. Pepper. It's from Plano, Texas. And at some point, you know what I, I really like? I live in North Carolina for a while, and they have cheer wine, and I never get over it that we, we don't have it anywhere else. I heard... I heard there's a South Carolina. Tennessee has sun drop. The South is the land of Cokes. There's all kinds of different stuff that some folks are not aware of. I really love cheer wine. I wish I could get, get me some. I can't get it. I love that thing. I should have just stayed in North Carolina just, just for the cheer wine alone, you know. Cheer wine is so great. There's something I've never seen. Your wine is awesome, yeah. To be honest, really fun watching play. I got stuck here as a kid too. Yeah, I'm th trying to see how. And I just remember Tabernacle Studio on YouTube. He's the first screen guy. He came here one time, and I'm halfway the game, and I was like, "That's a half. That's a first screen." I'm like, no, it's not that. Fucking goddamn first screen, what are you on about? Princess Retro, uh, I'm, I'm 40. I'm 40 years old. Born in 83. Personally, I don't know the other folks in the chat here. Probably a bunch of kids wearing diapers, ain't you? Little babies. This is men, this is brought to you by Men Baby Ga Gaming Incorporated. As in Mike McKay, he's he does he brings a big paychecks, but I'm I'm a small time employee of Man Baby Gaming. I don't look for it. Oh, thank you. It's, it's kind of it's, <laughs> it's probably the CRT with that <laughs> with that what did, what did I say the softening. Some folks say I look young. Some folks say I don't look young. Personally, I'm not really a vain person. As long as I have my mustache, I'm fine with anything else. I don't like my hats. Um, Chase is around here. Chase is 32. 34. Everybody's spilling the beans here on their on their age. Woogie boogie. Four you older than me, woogie boogie. You old son of a bitch. 43, 37, 34, 25, 32. Smasher Josh. RF. Witness the power of RF. Smasher Josh. It ate your RGB for lunch and, and shut out component. And here it is. Witness the power of the OGs. And look, kind of blurry here. You would not believe how sharp it looks here. It looks sharp. It looks good. God damn, can I? This camera sucked, the webcam with a short ass, the shortest fucking USB cable ever made. The... No, it's fucking blurry. 
I'll try to get it static here. So this is the webcam, so part of me is not great. No, it looks sharper. This is blurry. It's blurry shit. Do I need to focus it? All right, get the hell out of my side before I demolish you. Turn this off, you're making folks dizzy. Come on, you on about. Okay, and now I tangle, I appear to tangle the cables here. Jesus Christ, what are you doing? I've been distracted here for like 30 minutes. I gotta, I gotta go be a real boy. Right on, man. It looks very nice here. It looks very beautiful. It, uh, trust me, it does. I don't. If it if it didn't look good, I'd say yeah, it doesn't look as good. I have some uh, one or two CRTs that the tube is about is a bit tired. Uh, some of the trained trons, the older ones, they uh, they need a wind eyes adjustment, so they're looking washed out. And I, I I don't. I'm not gonna say just because the CRT looks good, but this one here, my goodness, it looks great. I have an even older set that I'm going to use here in the future with the Famicom. Uh, it's a 1970 Strenatron. If you go on my YouTube channel and you see the Super Mario Bros on the Famicom, you see what I'm talking about. It's a 1970 Strenatron I imported from Japan and it's, uh, the quality is not as good, but by, by God, you know, it's from the 1970s and it's still working, still work, 100% usable. Okay, I, I think I might need a, a stronger hint here because I'm kind of... <laughs> Chase is out here bringing the ground beef. Thank you, Glitch Blob TV, and I hope you have a good rest of the day. Yeah, but I ar archive everything on YouTube. Uh, archive everything on YouTube is very important to me. Uh, we're simulcasting there, but most of the reason I'm simulcast is just easier for me to get everything archived there. I don't care. I think I put on the about me that I, I don't really care how it does there. I mean, I appreciate the folks you, you're watching this on YouTube. I appreciate y'all, but I'm not looking for cloud out there. I'm not looking for the channel performance, and I'm not, I'm not going to ask you to like, subscribe, do this or that. I, I don't really, you know. At this point, I'm out of diamonds. So it is, you let the chips fall where they may. I don't, I don't really care about that stuff. To an extent, you know, it's nice to see the channel grow, but if it doesn't, sometimes I get no views. I don't, I don't care. Just the show must continue. I ain't got, I ain't got no time to, I got time to think about those things. Uh, yeah, I'm a bit stuck here. Oh yeah, I was telling the folks here earlier, uh, especially on a dark, dark screen. See the hands, and it, when it's dark, a dark place, my hands will be reflecting all over the place. Uh, but I, I, I use them before I stream because I like to keep my hardware clean. I'm a bit of a clean freak when it comes to my hardware for, for mo the most part. And then by, by now, I sort of got used to it. But they help with the blisters as well. I remember having to have blisters. I remember playing Super Street Fighter back in the, the 90s in Mortal Kombat and wrapping the end. It's a trick I should do. Yeah, I should wrap the end of my T-shirt around my thumb, and to be able to slide, cause my my thumb was getting all fucked up. Uh, so it does. You're not gonna have that here. That's true. And, and thank you for the compliment. Uh, yeah, a lot of people ask about the gloves. Some people get upset about the gloves. It's a whole mic the situation thing. Okay. I'm, I'm gonna get out of this part. I don't think it's here, right? I, I do. I need to do some sort of interaction. I'm, I'm gonna. I'm gonna go ahead and take off. I'm gonna try the other place. This is. This is. We stay there long enough. Let me see here. <clears throat> Talk to this guy here. I talked to his wife, so maybe I have something else to say. Secret tunnel, start searching for them. I done it already. Secret tunnels, huh? This is from the A to Z, Master Josh, a hundred percent. Yeah, you can just look at this. Like you don't need it. Like if you're in a lot of CRTs, you can look. If you're really into CRTs, you would look at this model here. Uh, 
uh, and please don't mistake that with me chastising you for asking that. Far from me to ever do that. This is a very niche fucking little bullshit knowledge that I have that's good for nothing. Let's get through that in one piece here. So, but as I've been collecting CRTs, I can look at a set and kind of, hey, Princess Retro said, thank you kindly, ma'am. I appreciate it. And welcome in to La Familia Rex. This is a lame thing to say, but it's been said, so there you go. <laughs> Thank you. You're a gentleman and a scholar. I, l I love that saying. I love that meme. I, l I like saying that sometimes. The bottom bitch where you were is correct. Okay, so let's head on back there then. He mentioned something about secret tunnels. I think, I think something's, something's gonna happen here. Is this... RF only as well. This here is RF only and it's glorious. This TV don't need nothing else. This TV looks at composite it and go, Let's trash out of here. We don't need it. Beautiful, beautiful RF. I wish you were here in person though to see it. You'll, you'll be impressed because I've seen people get so caught up and I was guilty of that, of that too. You get so caught up on the RGB stuff, they do think like, ooh, a composite, gross. And okay, a lot of people don't like composite, but I think that sometimes it's a bit more, aha! Big brain time. I think that composite and the RF don't even get me started. I mean, if composite is demonized, I mean, I myself, the first time that I hadn't played RF in a long time and I went up, plugged in RF, I was like, wow, this looks. I thought it was going to be garbage, because if you live in a place full of static, like uh, crap everywhere, like New York City or something, right? Hey, hey! There you go. You're going to get a lot of static and stuff. I remember the only time it was an issue for me as a kid, I brought my Super Nintendo to a, a Nance house. She lived in a big old city, and it looked like crap, and I remember looking like crap. Uh, and that's because she lived near an airport. It, it was a mess, a building, so yeah. But uh, when I went back to my neck of the woods, it's beautiful as it always was. So this is the only time that I remember back as a kid complaining about the image quality and the thing. Because when you're a kid, you're a lot more tolerable about those things. And there's nothing wrong with chasing our RGB and combining all that. I have it. I do here playing on the channel. But you got to understand that RF works just fine. And once you're into the game, you forget all about it very quickly. And there's nothing to forget here for me because it just looks good and genuinely looks good. And you bet your ass is nostalgic as hell for me. It's, it look, it looks good. I love RF. It, it, it does look good. I, look, before I, and I went out of my, my way to get RF on the TVs. And I went out of my way to get, most people out there, right, get, get this PBM, but I already had the PBM. So I'm like, I found this Japanese 1970s Trinitron RF only. And I, God, I was like, I want her. And I talked to the guy, I had I had just about the right amount of money, but a tiny bit short. And I asked the guy, in Japanese, they don't like bargaining, because that's what I heard. And I don't, I'm not a haggler either. I don't like doing it, no. But I said, dude, I've been waiting a long time to get a TV like that on eBay. They, they don't pop up on eBay often because it's from Japan. Y'all sell it out there, right? Would you consider, and feel free to say no, I know it's within your culture of your country that you're not like haggling. But would you consider accepting this price? I'll pay you right now. And I thought he wasn't even going to reply to me. He did and accepted. And I bought a TV and he packed it masterfully, sent it here. Arrived here within three freaking days, man. And uh, it's awesome. It's not as good as this one here, damage quality, but it's 100% uh, serviceable. I love it. Real fucker. Real motherfuckers. Fuck yeah. I love our. <laughs> I love that one, real fucker. That's I'm gonna use that from now on. Green RF? Yeah, I'm a real fucker. Deal with it. I poop on your RGB. No, I have RGB here too. I'm not an elitist of anything, or a fanboy of anything. That's a, a, the core of my personality. Should not be a fanboy of things. So everything's good, man. You know, people enjoy different stuff, and the way it is, but I love RF. I have a thing for it. There's a note in, in the bottle. You read it? Help! Captured by evil aliens. Tell my nephew to use the code. And you think, well, the code was the code was written next time. It was saved to your inventory. Are you are you gonna so you don't need to save it? 
Do you think I trust a video game? This game here... This game here sent me to a, 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 a joke cave and it killed me without me knowing. I'm gonna trust this. What if I if I go like, well, it's liable to go to my inventory, but what if it doesn't? You could you could look you could look uh, look it up online. Sorry, I don't have internet. But you're streaming. I don't know. Am I? Is this what that is? That, that's what's going on here. <laughs> there you go. I still write it down. You want to read it again? Yeah, why not? Give it a good read. <laughs> 1776. How did I... Well... I want that heart. It's a secret... It's a secret thing, right? Let me make sure before I leave this place here that there's no funny business. Thank you, Princess. Yeah, I'll, I'll be playing that TV here soon, play some Famicom. I'll be in the latest when it comes to my own stuff, I'll let others do whatever they want. Well, that's the attitude. But how are you elitist when it comes to your own, your own stuff, out of curiosity? My brother's new CRT has a 16 by 9 enhanced mode. I saw on, I saw on a Discord. Because you asked there if, <clears throat> I think it's JP closing the gate. It's fine. If y'all didn't hear nothing, there's a, the gate is being closed outside. It's very loud. Yeah. Yeah, man. I know. <laughs> okay, we use the code. Nav come here, Captain. And put the ID code. Yeah, sometimes the 16 by 9 is not an enhancement. It reduces my BVM D14H5 uh, <coughs> BVM set. Uh, is 800 TVL on 4x3, but when you, when you swap it to 16x9, it's 600 TVL. But it's good to have the option, and why not have the option? It's good. And I use 16x9 mode a lot, too, because six, 600 TVL is fine. Aye, aye, Captain. Submergible system ready. Please press B button when you want to submerge. Okay, so now I get it now. Now I'm going to be able to go right here. Boom. There you go. And that's the way the cookie crumbles. Isn't that beautiful? Isn't she a beaut? Sonny made a, a Vega Trinitron 16 by 9 ratio 480 progressive scan TV in like 2003, right before the HTV boom. And I love to get my hands on a super rare, very expensive. It's my dream. Such a nice display for retro stuff. Now, I learned a thing or two about those things. I have here a Panasonic EDTV. And now some folks go like, eh, actually, it's not an EDTV because it doesn't have a digital tuner. Who gives you shits? Okay, technicalities, right? Semantics. It does 480p, that's what we're after. Analog 480p, none of that HD CRT shit with a 4, 540, 1080 and all that. However, so I have three of them and it's glorious. Widescreen, 36 inch set, CRT 480p. Um, it's awesome. <clears throat> now, I have an HD CRT with HDMI too, but it's terrible because it, 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 if you feed it 1080i, it's great. Anything else, or 540p if you can get it. I, I think Retro Tank 5X, I don't have one, but I know they have a 540p mode. That would be awesome. I don't feed exactly what the TV wants. Little bro follows, thank you. Uh, but I was talking to a guy, so I had this not good, um, how would you say, I judged and misjudged HD CRTs all in general. There are some CR HD CRTs in America that have dual frequencies. So they go from the, from the 33.75 kilohertz, that is what you need for 1080i and 540, and it's, it's locked to that. Most of them are. However, some sets they do also uh, have dual frequency and go to 31 kilohertz and give you a uh, proper 480p instead of stretching the raster to 540p, like all of them do, which can, you know, it can be processed, it can be lagged. Yeah, the, the CRT can have lag. So, so I don't, yeah, I don't blame it for one of that, because 480p on a set, however, it's like, the appeal to me is the widescreen stuff. Yeah, post pictures there, Princess Retro. We'll look forward to it. 
Uh, I saw an HDCRT that does laglas. Well, we do, you do, they all are laglas. People mix up, here's another thing too, and I put the brake overlay, cause you bet your ass I like talking about CRTs. If you're in a rush for the game, you're out of luck, I'm sorry. Uh, I wanna talk here and, uh, and ingest some drugs, nicotine. I don't do illegal drugs, neither should you. And I'm sorry, I, I'm not gonna tell you what you do. You do whatever you want, I don't care. I don't even know you, you know? Who am I here? But listen, back to the brass tacks here. CRT, HD CRTs are not laggy. Pe people go like, well, they are, but, you know, I'll tell you. And look, my, my knowledge is limited. Don't, don't take, take everything with a grain of salt here. If you feed it, an HD CRT, wants you to be fed 1080i, most of them, except the dual frequencies, you can also do 480p. So if you're gonna put your 40p there, you're gonna get fucked because it's not gonna fucking work. It's gonna be laggy. It's gonna be, look like shit. It's gonna be the same thing as a flat panel. So now 1080i has a, a very bad rap, and understandably so because of flat panels. Flat panels don't do I anything. They don't interlace. So they have to the interlace, and that's processing, and that's where you get your lag. However, if you get yourself an HD CRT, I feel like they get a bad rap. And you feed it 1080i, and you have a scaler, let's say, downgrade your firmware on your RetroTank 5X, get the 540p mode, you're not gonna have any motherfucking lag on it. There's no processing, right? So so they have CRTs that don't have lag. Uh, not, not, none of them, if you feed them what they want, it's like a VGA, you have, that's why I have so many CRTs, CRT, there's a CRT for the job. If you wanna get a CRT, for a VGA PC monitor for your NES, you're, you're shit out of luck because it doesn't accept you 40p. However, you can get yourself an OSSC line double, add some fake scan lines. Now we have a, a, a monitor as, as good as a quality as a, a high TVL PVM or BVM even. It looks fantastic. Bob from Retro RGB has a retro gaming on VGA monitors, which I have a few of them here, and they're awesome. But that monitor, what you're looking for when you get one of those is 540, sorry, 480 and 720 4x3 and FW900. I'll show you here because it is my pride and joy. Right here, Tiro, this here is an FW900. This here, there are many like it, but this is this one is mine. And this one does 1440p. And I have another train that runs does 1440p. So HD, all the full HD, that exists way before the fucking flat panels. And then I'll actually, actually flat panels were Technically invented in 1960, I know that, but they didn't take off. Military use only, doesn't count. So yeah. Damn, you know your shit? Ah, very tiny bit, very tiny. My, my knowledge is superficial at best. But thank you kindly for the compliment. I, I'll take it. Total follow him, sounds like my dad. Really does? Oh, thank you. I thought my dad was the only one. It, Grandpa said, <laughs> you're hey. Them youngins, <laughs> I'm talking about my HD CRTs here. <laughs> Is that your F? Pop, oh, you, uh, get, Master Pussel always gets the references right away. Right away. Blu-rays out. 1080p CRTs, right here. It's Master Josh. When I played, right, 10, I just, I just told you. Keep up, keep up, Josh. 1440p, my friend, uh, but 1080p. When I used it here on the channel, like what? A couple of weeks ago? It was all 1080p. Full 1080p. Yeah. Yeah, computer monitors are all HD. The one I used here earlier was uh, 768, but I used for 480p, the, the previous stream, Rayman. I'm gonna amp up the amps, the ohms. The wattage. Outside of FW900, yep, I have another one here. Plenty of Trinitrons that do 1440p, 1500. It's even higher than this. It's not even the highest one. But they're four by three though. If you're looking for widescreen, you are you might be out of luck. There's only a couple of them. Uh, CRT 4K here has the, uh, the Carmack monitor. That's 1080p, but you're not gonna find a Carmack monitor. There's more chances of me materializing here right before your eyes into a beautiful e-girl and gives you a sub then you'll find a uh, Carmack monitor that's a reality like the actual reality uh, I think that's about it and there's a precursor to that one that is curved right 
So the problem is they do it, but they're all four by three. I know they're not, they're not uh, widescreen. Uh, you struggle actually to find nowadays on eBay. If you're looking for a VGA monitor, you struggle to find anything uh, that does below 768p. Uh, they do, do have some older ones. Let's go inside this here. Break is over. Now saving your data. Thank you. There you go, CRT in 4K. Uh, one of them, uh, I don't know, are you, are you still gonna do stuff, CRT in 4K? I wonder. Uh, with the Twitch stuff and no judging, I don't have to answer to you. You can always tell me in private. I'm asking because directly here, I'm asking because I will give a shout out, but if, you, if you're not gonna make more content, then you know, what's the point? He has an amazing, CRT in 4K here. Uh, he has an amazing collection, a double what I have, more than double, and he has some incredible uh, monitors, one of them being a Carmack. And he has an FW900 as well. So. Oh, I remember this part here from, uh, why do I have like a halo effect? Like, it's kind of weird, right? Next to me here. Punkle follows, thank you. I'm gonna stream the night, here I go. All right, thank you for the shout out for CRT 4K. So CRT 4K does what I do here, but even more beautifully. Like serious, serious, serious stuff. Uh, and yeah. <coughs> CRT 4K, consider that Windows. We need a hero. We need a man that can do Windows hero. Ah! What's my throat is ticklish here? What were you even talking about? Oh yeah, as Master, as Master Josh was talking about 1080. Yeah, Planet, Planet Monitors at 1080p. Oh, many of them. Common, commonly found on eBay, 1200p, 1024p. I know it's not 1080, but 1200 is common. I have three VGA monitors here that do 1200. In fact, I should go out of my way to get the 1200 ones. Now, I'll tell you one thing. If you go like, well, I get a... F no! Idiot! Yeah, I done goof now, didn't I? Okay. What I was gonna say? Something not stupid. Check out that water reflection. That's a reflection. That's what it is. Thought, thought it was something around my TV here. <laughs> yeah, Princess Raptor here. She is the sweetest, and you're, you'll be happy to have her around. Right now, I can tell you. I love people like her, you know. Thank you kindly. Can you swim? P.S. Americola. I tell my dad is not even American, and he's sort of a pussy. It's kind of fucked up. Just monitors that do 1080p. What about consumer set? Consumer? No, no consumer sets. 1080i. 1080i only, maximum. Well, if you're talking about refresh rate, not even 720p. They don't do 720p. But CRT Rex, CRT Rex, you're full of shit. I plugged in my Xbox 360. I set it to 720, and I got an image. Look at that image. Does that look? Does that really look 720 to you? Because it's not. Everything you feed in that that set is going to be converted to it's, it's 540p. You're look, that's why it looks softer. It's not the fucking CRT phosphorus. It's just not 720p. They don't do it. 720p requires 4 to 5 kilohertz, and they don't go up to 4 to 5 kilohertz as far as I, all the models that I know. So 1080p, no fucking way. Even my BVM D14, it does. It's 1080i, but it does 720. See the D14 and the D32 and D24, they would do 720 because they go up to 4 to 5 kilohertz. It's all about the refresh rate. God damn it. So what's going on in here? What's this ball baggery? Okay, got a time and art. You know what this reminds me of? Uh, Congo Bongo on the SG-1000. I, I guess Arcade 2. Ah! Rascals! Arcade 2. The snake, because they have snakes as soon as they see you, they charge you in a straight line. Oh. Yeah, I don't know my dad much. Was, I tried, you know. We didn't grow up together. And, what are you gonna do, you know? Ha! 
Oh, to be continued. Is that also time? What is that sound I'm hearing about the uh, this alarm here? Is that because my health is low? Watching RF, and yes, it reminds me of VHS and some old shows on tape. That's another thing I'm passionate about. I got about a thousand tapes here. There's a lot of crap, but there's some good stuff here and there. I love me some VHS tapes. Are they better, like vinyl? Are you, are you telling me that they have some kind of magic that looks better than a Blu-ray? Fuck no. A lot of them look down right terrible. Not as terrible as you would, as it gets when you connecting that shit to a flat pin will come off it. <laughs> it looks acceptable on the CRT. Uh, it's purely nostalgia and the whole ritual of having a VHS in. It takes me back to the past to play the shitty games of suck ass. Okay. It's about to get tricky here, isn't it? Come. Take your fucking medicine. All right. Danny boy. Gotcha. And it opened a thing. No! Oh my god. Why? Mr. Free Spirit here. My dad tried to kill my brother exactly 17 years ago. Well, my dad is not not that bad, you know? Holy <laughs> dog shit. Well, tried, uh, so at least your brother got away with it, looks like. A low health warning, all right. Your dad is Japanese. Oh, that's fucking awesome. Met my mom working for NASA, so I'm a half Japanese. So are my kids. My kids are, uh, my, my wife is Chinese. Well, they're not Japanese. I mean, I do know the difference, but I'm saying that they're with the with the half stuff. Uh, love Japan. It's, what is? Who doesn't? You know, who doesn't? That's that's something to be very proud of. Uh, Japan is awesome. Yeah, and no, I don't even watch anime because uh, I don't like anime. I don't care for it. But because uh, a lot of people like Japan anime, but and that's fine. There's a valid reason to like Japan, but I I, I like it for different reasons. I like. I like the cleanliness of Japan. I like the, their their sense of honor. I like. I'm aware. Of this. Yeah, there's, yeah. I've been to Japan. There's problems. There's problems everywhere. Right? The workload is horrible in there. You're gonna work many hours. It's kind of fucked. Uh, but look, man. And this this stuff. Look at the stuff that I mean. This this here. This is here. As far as I'm concerned, this is a Japanese game made for Westerners. That's what it was. It wasn't released in Japan, as far as I know. So they make a lot of good stuff that I care for, and I wish they were still on top as far as making stuff like they used to, you know. Live in Kyoto from one to six years old, that's amazing. That's where uh, Nintendo headquarters out there. I live in Houston since I was six, so I consider myself a thing, and you are. Because, yeah, uh, what do they say? A, a dog raising a stable and a horse, you know. That's how it goes. Yeah, I'm going to click on everything here. So look, we got ourselves a baseball bat, right? Things have changed. That's a shame, but they're, you know, Japan is doing just fine. I was just watching. I, I like to watch stuff about that place. Uh, I was watching. There's a British guy that lives there. He makes videos sometimes, and it's a shame. Now, it, that's the thing that I like about Japan. They're so polite. It's such a good society, you know? No wonder PewDiePie moved, moved out there. Uh, they had to block a few parts of Kyoto, wouldn't you know? Where were you from? Where you lived? Uh, from foreigners because they're acting like jackasses in there and touching the, the geisha girls and, and it's terrible and it's embarrassing, right? I feel embarrassed. Japan is a sort of place that I will look, I, I'm a fan of, and but I don't belong there, so I wouldn't, I wouldn't live there. It's, it's not for me in a sense that it's too good for me, you know? So I, I, it's like Switzerland, it's a beautiful place, but it's, it's kind of fancy, it's expansive. My, my fucking hillbilly ass, I'm, I'm alone in there. Uh, but I like, so, you know, but when I see those people going in there and doing those things, I feel embarrassed. Like Jake Paul, was it Jake Paul went there and, and did a horrible things, you know? I don't know, the Japanese, they just, uh, they instigate a sense of respect from people and people are sympathetic to them. And that John Samali guy and all that crap, my God, fucking terrible. 
Yeah, they're in a recession. Yeah, things are tough everywhere. It's, uh, you know, it's a shame, but... But still, you know, every time I look a video about that place and all that, it looks, it looks amazing. A lot of people, though, they see things with a roast, roast in the glass. Holy shit, what the fuck? I don't think it was a wise, wise thing for me to not use a yo-yo there. There was no reason for me to use a baseball bat, and I got fucked big time. Let's face it. <laughs> what happens when a life go to zero? Well, I got my answer now. Did I fuck up there? Don't despair under the sudden cross and the things possible. Yeah. How far back we have sent here? That's not too bad. Acceptable. I think my mistake was using the baseball bat. I don't even know what it does. One thing I find it funny that you have 30 baseball bats. It has like a health thing. <laughs> it's because of retro janky game. How about the knife breaks in Resident Evil 2 Remake, doesn't it? So it's the same thing here. Don't judge me. Yeah, a lot of a lot of people they have uh yeah, they have a uh, look, I've said it here several times. If you want to be happier in life, truly really happy. Lower your expectations a tiny bit about what you're going to get out of this whole mess that we're in. And this fucking third rock from the sun here spinning around the space and the whole madness of it all. You're, you're going to be a lot happier if you just understand that not everything is going to go your way all the time. And life can be and will be miserable at times. And you're going to be disappointed and you're going to have to accept compromises. And that's just the way it is. Ain't nothing you can do about that, and the sooner you make peace with it, the sooner you're going to be happier about things. So lower, don't go to Japan thinking there's going to be an enemy land, uh, and you're going to be, you know, the women are going to fall all over your, your, you know, acne field ass, and that, uh, you know, you're going to be treated like a king, you're going to learn the language in three days, and forget all that shit. None of those things are happening, all right? Uh, but if you understand that before you go, then maybe you you give you'll be more realistic. You give the place more of a chance and and appreciate what the place has to offer. No place is gonna, you know. People, some people go on to say the rich people are unhappy and miserable. Oh look, they they commit suicide and majority of them are quite happy. I, I, let me tell you, it's just there's some people that it don't matter if they're rich or poor. Are you gonna tell me there's no poor, miserable poor people? Of course there are. I'm one of them. No, I'm kidding. I'm quite happy. Thank you. But I'm just saying, miserable people, no matter the amount of money, like, I don't want to win the lottery because, uh, because I've seen this, this fella here with his wife and they had trouble and they divorced and he lost his fucking guitar store and, and this and that. But you never heard of the people who were quite happy with the lottery they won and they, they chose to be anonymous, which is the right thing that you should have done to begin with instead of chasing cloud because you won the fucking lottery. And they're quite fucking happy. I, I think I, ca I can tell you here without an ounce of a doubt that if I won the lottery, not a fucking goddamn thing in my part of my personality would change. I would fix my truck. I would buy a piece of land somewhere. And that's about it. I just want to be left to hell alone and be happy. And money... Money helps, but it doesn't bring you happiness. That's true. But don't don't be under the impression. I feel a, a lot of times a sort of pin is envy. I'm poor, so everyone who's not poor is probably miserable. That, I, I don't even need the money anyways. You can be happy and be poor. I'm, I'm a good example. I'm quite content with life. But, uh, you know, you don't need to think that every, everyone else who is, that is not poor as you is miserable. That's, that's a delusion. It's, it's crazy. Acne field acid. <laughs> have three cousins or half African, half fingers. Oh, look at that. Isn't I think I forgot his name. There's a famous guy who is you. Forgot to grab that heart back there. God damn it. Can I return? I need that heart. Can I go back? I forgot about it generally. Yeah, broke people commit suicide all the time. It's nonsense. The weebs have a crazy view of what Japan is because of anime. That's true. It's a wonderful place, but it's not going to fix all your problems. You know? <laughs> My life is miserable. Oh, I know. I'll go to Japan. 
the land of milk and honey, an enemy. Yes, there becomes a king. The new emperor. Everything worked out perfectly. Ramp the spade, food on the table. Just watch enemy. Meet actual enemy characters in real life. I don't know what you want from the place, you know? You know, a lot of people immigrate elsewhere and they think that everything is just going to be given on them and it's just not, not the way the world works, you know? Yeah, because, uh, let me tell you, a little break the news here. I'm the last person to judge anybody's look, obviously. If you're ugly in America, when you go to Japan, you're still ugly. It's just science. You're not going to go there. And people are going to be like, because you have a pasty ass. The girls there are gonna come. They, the Japanese are even scared of talking to foreigners. They like they don't like <clears throat> they don't like the English. You know, scares them out. Most of them. I, I watched Nobita from Japan. I think that's his name. He's uh, one of the unique ones that makes friendships with, with Westerners and, and all that. That they're quite reserved. Sorry to tell you, you're not gonna get there and get the uh, what does it call? Trying to keep up with the jargon here. Waifu? Is that it? And look, man, you watch anime. I'm not judging you for watching it. I personally don't like it, but I know my, my wife likes anime. And I don't go, ah, oh, you sorry ass loser. What are you doing watching this crap? No, I watch a few cartoons. We call them cartoons back in the day that it turned out to be anime. Sensei, Dragon Ball Z. I'm just not into it right now, you know. Never have been. Let me get my snooze here. I think I understood what wife is about three months ago. Something to that effect. So apparently is. An anime character, if I understood it correctly, is an anime character that you would have it as your wife, I guess. Yeah. Tarentu. And we can't have your wife. This don't expect to happen in real life when you move, if you move to Japan. You're probably going to be very lonely. You're going to work many, many hours. And over time... You get used to the place, and you come to appreciate it. And if not, you're going to be disappointed, and you move back. And there's nothing wrong with it. At least you can say you tried, right? I would say try. Yeah, go. Go for it. Just be a little bit more informed on what you expect from the place. Zaf Pine follows. Thank you. And I'm having something reflecting on the CRT here. What is this What is this about, fellas? It's a fucking webcam, wouldn't you, wouldn't you know? Husbandos. Well, that one is self-explanatory. Now that I know their life. The Welsh don't like the English. Mom had English basher go home. Yeah, but if you have vice versa, if I had that Welsh not sign, I mean, let's let's face it, England did some real nasty shit too. It's not no nobody's hand, no no country's hand is clean on anything, you know. Uh, Wales used to be a country, you know. As was, uh, aren't you from Cornwall? What? How's the Cornish language doing? Princess Retro cheered 300. Thank you very much. Yeah. I think, look, I'm, I'm going to give a, a little tale here, and I'm not laying best in English. I know many English people that are great, but I'm like, well, met this guy one time. I don't like the French, the surrender cheese-eating monkeys. I hate the, the, the Germans, the Nazi bastards. We beat them all. The Spanish, Gibraltar, and Gibraltar is ours, and fucking American colonials, and the Aust Australia shit holds hot, bugs everywhere. And the guy just went on to say half of the world he hated, and he goes like, you know, but anyways, I've been to Scotland, they, they hate the English, they mistreated me up there. <laughs> okay, well. <laughs> it's, it takes a bit of, you know, maybe self-reflection a tiny bit, right? You just listed all the countries on there pretty much that you hate, you insulted me. And then you go on to say that you misread in Scotland. I'm not advocating that people should misread the English in Scotland. Of course not. That's ludicrous. Ludicrous notion. But but you got to see the other side a tiny bit too, right? So every place there's also. That's pretty much Salamander Jack. But it's a succinctly here. You know. Sacre bleu. Uh, so yeah. Uh, saying the Welsh. Uh, there's a Welsh guy in the yard here. Uh, saying the Welsh don't like the English. Yeah, there's a lot of Welsh that don't like the English. I'm aware of it. 
but you know, there's a lot of English that don't like the Welsh, right? I mean, I mean, come to think of it, like you see some place, and again, not only best in uh, any British viewers, have m m many good British friends or acquaintances, right? Um, but you can't just say you're, you know, that a place is like Haitian and, and not the other way around. You gotta give the whole picture. None of it is right. You should never mistreat somebody because they're, they're English or Welsh or anything like that, because it's kind of idiotic. You're being a, a cunt, right? So try not to do that. But, you know, shit happens, you know? and it's everywhere. It's not, it's not unique to anything. Uh, be Japanese in China. It's not gonna, it's not gonna, it's not gonna go well. Or, or maybe even Chinese in, in Japan. They, they have issues, they have the trucks that go around, the right wingers in there, and it's their right to do so, you know, but uh, they don't like the Chinese in there, you know, there are the Koreans. It's, look, man, there's shit everywhere. I, uh, if I tell you, don't, but we even have Canadians here, if you didn't, you know, we want to feel good about, I'm kidding. Master by yourself. <laughs> so you gotta throw a little dig here. Because, you know, at least you're not Canadian. No, I'm kidding. We love Canada, it's good, good maple syrup, good folks. Uh, Matt Outstand, I met, look. I met uh, some Canadian all workers one time and they gave me a gigantic tip, massive. There was a guy who hated America and I was serving him all night, listening to his crap and fine. You know what, I'm here to serve you, not to listen to your bullshit politics, but whatever. And the Canadians, they were there drinking, and they, uh, before they left, they gave me a gigantic, massive, uh, the biggest tip I ever got. Uh, and then one time, I met a Canadian lady overseas, and she apparently had a southern boyfriend, and she didn't like it. She went to the south, she didn't like it, she was telling me about the guns and God and all that shit, and uh, just nasty, just a nasty person, she was being nasty. Oh, I was nasty back, trust me. I'm, I'm nothing but a mirror. If you treat me like, I'm, I'm no pushover. I'm never gonna sit here and tell you somebody's gonna treat me like crap. You, you're gonna see some animosity here. When the trolls come, I tell them, gargle my ball sack and get the fuck out of here. That's just that. But most of the folks are nice. You gotta understand that. So, is this a hidden passage? Ha ha! I could see a little bit of a, the green shade is a bit different. I don't get, don't get me started with the Canadians minus Quebec. Yeah, and then within Canada you have Quebec and all that too. <laughs> so it's crazy. Yeah, like the fella here the other day, you know? Oh, you're talking too much. Sir, politely, gargle my ball sack and goodbye. Don't, don't come, don't, don't go away mad, just go away. <laughs> I keep forgetting you gotta step on those things. Did, was there some green stuff here? Break over lays off. <laughs> That's my catchphrase, Princess Retro. I told you I do it cuz, but hey, it's not undeserved. No, there you go. So you gotta go on the green things here. It's the way it is. Can ban him. You know, it's just that's it. Don't don't Ooh! Exotic! What is this, chocolate starfish? All right. Big mistake, Fowler. There you go. What are the star, ah! Oh! Jesus, where's the fire? I was about to grab the star here. Now you're going to make me crave nicotine, goddamn you. Oh, the fucking heart, can I go back? I'm kind of going, am I, after I'm done with this world, would I have a um, an opportunity to go back, Master Pycelle? Let me know. So, box is extremely reclusive country. I would enjoy it. Horrific. The war culture is horrible. And it's not productive in Japan. Uh, I heard from Japanese talking about it that it's more about you work the long hours, but you're not really working per se a lot of times. You just, t the boss shows up and they go like, ooh, lots of, remember, remember the Family Guy, Family Guy special Star Wars, the Blue Harp is one of them. They're like talking around and got their feet up the henchman and then I think Darth Vader or Stu walks by and they're like ooh, ooh, ooh. oh oh lots of Empire stuff yep 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 lots of Empire stuff so I heard that Japan has a lot of that culture 
that you have to kind of not really work, but to show that you're working. You just have to be there. And I heard that some foreigners are not affected by it. And you also go have to go to the functions after and kiss some, do some brown nosing. That's what I hear. I never live there, so that's I can only hear from other people. They have to say, you know. I've been ripping on this vape. Oh, you vape too. What are you vaping out there? Oh, you're one of those I like when they drink. I, I hear you. It does make me crave more once I'm drinking alcohol. That's for sure. I don't know if it can go back after it, but it can go back now. Let's go back. Why not? Master Pie, say your line sack of shit. <laughs> I can't go back here, man. How do I go back? Gonna take you back to the past. Bam, 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 bam. I'll wait on you. No, I don't want to do any. I don't want to dig myself a bigger hole here. I'm in trouble enough here as it is. Door locked it. Now. So I missed a heart forever? Sierra King 4K said, there's a lot of formality to certain things. Yes, yeah, I, I, that tends to, I, I, I think I'll be annoyed with that very quickly. But, but it was when in Rome, you know? So is it... The duality of men. <laughs> the duality of what? So why don't you come in for the big win or I will take a giant shit on you. <laughs> so it's like at one point and one one side I will I understand it's a very different country, very different culture, and I, nobody asked me to go there, but at the other hand it's like really you can't put the chopstick this way, you can't do this, you can't do that, you can my head is it gonna explode. But I heard that uh, Sierra King 4K, they're very tolerable of foreigners, except for the not taking your shoes off, which we do here anyway. I do it in my trailer. We don't walk around with the muddy boots here all over the place. We'll take our shoes off. I'm wearing those things here. That's what I'm wearing right now. My wife gave it to me as a birthday gift. Moral combat. I love it. We don't walk around here with no muddy boots. It's muddy out there. So you don't do that in Japan. But I, from what I heard, all the other stuff, they let you, uh, they let you off the hook for the most part. Uh, I don't even smoke when I sip. I like a little nicotine. It's a nice little geek bar in California cherry. Oh, California cherry flavor. Nice little geek bar. Oh, you're in a bar right now. You're in a bar. She hits hard. I do a uh, something called Atomic Ringu. Is apparently Apple. Oh, so I'm going to move forward here, Master Pycelle. I think this is fucked, right? This is gone. This, there's nothing we can do. No, no reason crying over the spilled milk here. Oh shit, it's a boss. Okay. Do I, do I use the baseball bat? Let's try it. You know, I heard that puffer fish are not that ugly. It's just because it, they're broad from the, to the surface, because they live in a very high pressure environment under the sea. That they. S no! What is this baseball bat? I don't know what it is. It's not doing anything. What did it do? It didn't do shit. Can I go back now? Then it can go back. Can go, can go here, can go there, man. Okay. Maybe if I die here, I'd probably will die at some point, right? I mean, we're all gonna die at some point. It's a, it's a big secret here. So I can go back here in a moment. Oh, Geek Bar is a brand of vape, part of my dumbassery. I thought you out there fancy drinking a, you know, left taxes you're on the layover, enjoying some, <laughs> some vape in a California bar. Now you're home. Just be sure to none this kind of vibe tonight. I'm not going out anywhere. Oh, that's a that's a good cozy night. Shitsure Shimasu, pardon the intrusion. Uh, my friend Jack vapes. One time he dropped his vape in my toilet. Oh God, I'm scared of going to the can, the commode, and drop it inside. You know, it could happen. A couple of times I thought of it. Say, so what if the shit fell in there? Well, that wouldn't be good, would it? That would be, uh, that would be in fact terrible. I'll prop, give me the star. I don't know what it does, but I want it. They're after us. We all gonna die, Jill. What are you talking about? You see. Let's go. 
Well, 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 can go back to the main map. I'm, am I speeding around here? I am. Sometimes I speed around like a, a rabid dog. Uh, it's called swallowing, swallow your, your saliva every once in a while, old man. That's what it's called. Am I going to get old and get white crap in the corner of my mouth sometimes? It's liable to happen, eh? What, what if I raise above, above the stereotypes and I clean that shit when I get old? Like, really old? I heard you did. A family guy was like, he's telling Carter Peter Schmidt. Was it? No, his own dad is Irish dad. I'm saying, okay, I do that, and what do you want in return? You and all those people must know and acknowledge that you have white crap in a corner of your mouth. And, it, and it, <laughs> it's like, okay, I can do that. <laughs> Very funny shit. What happened to that show? You should be so funny. Gonna drink some cherry Coca-Cola just for CRT racks. I love that stuff. Oh, I love cherry. Funny thing I was mentioning here the other day, I don't like... It's not that... Come off it, what are you... Oh my God. They are crafty, they are crafty. Stop! What the hell? It's demonic. My health is gone. Blob fish. I didn't say that. What did I say? I'm wondering now what the hell is blob fish. Did I say something else? Sometimes I say shit I don't even know what the fuck I'm talking about. The, the fish that looks ugly, right? Blobfish. And I'm not, you know, I'm not trying to save face here. I do, I do make mistakes a lot. Sometimes I say stuff and, oh, you say that. And, you know. That's it? So that's not a boss. Oh my goodness. Check everything. Puffer fish. Oh, that's what I said. No, that's a different. No, I was wrong. Sorry, my apologies. I was weak. The blob fish. Yeah, that's the correct one. Check everything. Yeah, because they're leaving a. Uh, I didn't know that. I thought they were just ugly motherfuckers, you know. Ugly ass fish, and that's that. But no, it's actually a normal fish when it's down there. Apparently. gonna examine everything here. Relax, I'll be your doctor. Examine everything, leave no stone unturned. Are y'all really speaking Japanese out there, Princess Retro? Nihongo hanaseru no soretomo choto dake shitero no. There's that. I don't, I don't speak a lick of Japanese. I had a half a mind to try one time. I started trying uh, Chinese one time. I'm gonna die here, you know. Maybe avoid the whole thing. They'll settle down. Scorpion! Just, just move out of the way. I think that's the best policy. Fuck off. Get off me. You undecided? Gotcha. I see the secret already. Not going up there. Speak Japanese? I said that well. I did. No, I don't speak it. Speak Japanese at all. Um, I find it very somehow easy to pronounce. That, that was my problem with Chinese when I started out. I love the characters because uh, if you ever want to know, and this is a a fucking useless advice here, but if you ever want to see Chinese written in Japanese. You want to know the difference? Korean is easier, right? But Japanese, they have the kanji, which are Chinese Chinese characters. So my understanding is that uh, whatever. I'm gonna have a smoke. Sorry, I need a smoke. I'm an addict. Uh, that's what can I do? You know. So from what I understand, uh, Buddhist monks from China. China used to be a very advanced place back in the day. So in the fifth century, apparently they brought some. Um, 
They brought the, their language, their trade in. And they brought Buddhism to Japan. And the Japanese, of course, they have their own language, which is no way, shape, or form related to Chinese. And they, uh, but they adopted a lot of the characters, which are called kanji now, which are Chinese characters. Japanese characters are Ch some of them. That's the part I'm getting to. So, and they still mean mostly the same. My wife can look at those characters, and and the, the meaning is most of the time 100% correct. But the Japanese, they have their own, uh, what do you call, syllabary, their, their own system of syllables and things that are not, didn't exist in China. So they added their their kana, right? Which is the katakana and hiragana. Uh, so the hiragana, if I understand, is the uh, curved ones. That's their syllables. And uh, the katakana is phonetics and they're sharp. So if you see a lot of Nintendo games, they have katakana. And, uh, and yeah, but, and that's that, you know, they, they, it took us a lot of the characters. So if you see a lot of very complicated, more complicated, complex characters, and it's just that, that's liable to be Chinese. And even then, Chinese has simplified, which they changed in the 40s with the communist revolution. And they simplify the characters in a bid to improve literacy. Uh, but Taiwan and Hong Kong didn't follow suit and they keep the traditional characters, which are more complicated. But sometimes not cut and paste, cut and dry, black and white, or sometimes even the simplified characters are not, they don't make much sense they were not seem some of them got more complex somehow which is kind of crazy but uh the yeah so my wife can read some traditional but i can't so i started studying and i love the part of the characters and doing what they call my obi which is with the is an art right you you're drawing it and it's so beautiful so it's, it's nice i love getting the ink good smell and but the thing that really murder me on Chinese that you don't understand it's very hard it doesn't it, it doesn't sort of exist in Japanese is Japanese I find it easy to pronounce and memorable Chinese is a lot of repeated they is a language of towns they have four towns and no town uh, and I think Cantonese has and that's Mandarin Cantonese has six towns so what happens is imagine like you have a, some foreign language, they have a diacritic on top of a vowel, and we tend to ignore it as English speakers, but that is there for a reason, right? And it changes the sound of the vowel. Well, imagine that conundrum in every goddamn syllable there is. A, a, a tone out, so you have ma, 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 and ma. So one means mother, the other one means horse, and the other no means the other one means who knows, who knows every syllable for me a nightmare and i couldn't memorize none of it i got kind of the gist of the tongues but that's what every single syllable is. in other words for an english speaker incredible incredibly hard language to learn uh their grammar is for an english speaker makes more sense who i need is i love you and that's what that is japanese it's not. The grammar is very different. It's turn around. Like German, you have verbs at the end, you know. So, so be advised that if you, you learn it. So Japanese, I find it good to pronounce and memorable, but then the grammar, right? And yeah, then you still have the kanji. Oh, and there's a the thing too with the kanji. The Japanese have a limited formal official set of, of kanji. And Chinese, 48 fucking thousand. But they don't use most of them. But it's not set in stone. It's not like you can sit down. I'm gonna learn all this. Chinese will be a lot of ones that you'll miss. You'll never know all of them, of course. You know. So. Oh, there you go. Says so, here. Go. Sorry, I didn't look at the chat for a while. Here, here, gonna katakana and kanji. I tried the three types. My handwriting is bad. You're so fucking smart, dude. Oh, come on, Francis Rattler. Well, yeah, thank you for thank you kindly for the the, the, the compliment. Yeah, the tonations are very very, very tough. I want to have English translation of Japanese language, the English spellings of Japanese stuff alongside the katakana, hiragana, and kanji. There you go. How do you know so much shit? Do I? I know nothing. <laughs> Reminds me of Deliverance. The guy goes like, "Is it a pump killing the gas with the hillbillies out there, right?" And and he goes like. Try to be polite. Is a city guy from Atlanta, and it's like, I like your hat. And the guy takes off his hat. The old he'll be the man. Looks at it, puts the hat back on his head, and goes, "You know nothing." And the other guy is like, "Nah, beady." <laughs> yeah. I like reading. 
I know I kid around, I don't read books, and I don't, to be honest. Uh, I used to read a lot of novels. Uh, I like to fuck, fuck around Wikipedia, and I have a lot of things that I'm interested in. Linguistics is one of, one of them. Tech stuff. I read about fucking vegetables. You know one thing I found, found out that is quite amazing if you're reading a lot of stuff? A variety of topics. They come up in conversation. In unexpected places. Didn't I tell you I just read about vegetables? And uh, somebody was talking about tomatoes. And it came up, and I happened to just re read about tomatoes three days prior. So, yes, I know tomatoes are fruit. Like everybody knows. There's not a person on earth now that don't know that tomatoes are fruit gig. But officially as a vegetable because for trading. In America, it's officially it was declared a vegetable for taxing reasons and because it's, it's used as a vegetable, right? Well, there's a dolphin and a break overlay zone. Yes, son, that's going to be over soon, y'all. I'm getting me the mop little warning things to, to put here, so I have a physical thing in front of me here that says on break. Okay, it's happening. Boss man! And his... What the... F okay, what... What is a boy to do? Uh... Scramble eggs all over my face. Ah! Damn it! The baseball bat! Yes! Are you gonna get a bit? Mmm. Come on. Hover here. Bamboozle him. There you go. Ah! Ah! God damn, I thought I was doing well. Well, now we know. Now we know. Now we know. Base, uh, wait, wait on him to get near you in this uh, baseball bat. Bash his brains in. Honey! Light of my life. You, you didn't let me finish my sentence. I'm not gonna hurt you. I'm not gonna fucking hurt you. I just wanna bash your brain, brains right in. I'm not gonna bash him right a fuck in. <laughs> Stop swinging a bat, Wendy. God, I love that movie. It's about time for me to watch it again. Okay. You're losing too much fucking health here, man. Just, what are you doing? My goodness. I'm, I'm trying my best to get used to the momentum here. Okay. I wonder if up there is a trap. You know one of my favorite quotes I like saying? They used to tell me to say it at work. <clears throat> you gotta be closer to mine. Would you fuck me? No, would fuck me. No, the fuck me so hard. <laughs> there was a guy at work. You would ask me to, to say that. And then I got a bit spooked because he kept asking too much. And I was like, what, what is this guy doing with this information? And I'm at home. And then I was like, why, if he's doing something nefarious, why deprive him of the pleasure? So I just kept saying it. As long as it doesn't get weird with me here, who cares, right? He, he can do what he wants. He's a grown ass man. <laughs> you don't work. Do you worry about the flag background burning to your display? Uh, somebody asked me the other day, um, I was Chase, about the, um, the burning in, and don't worry about it. Uh, and the reason being is it takes extra months. I actually read about it. Um, it's not as quick. That's why, when you see, it's hard to get a game image, unless it's a game like Pac-Man. I heard of Pac-Man did a lot of burning in some, uh, CRTs, uh, in the, in the cabinets, because it's just there all the freaking time. Uh, this actually has burned in, um, Princess Retro, that's why I use it. I'll be honest with you, I don't think I would be able to peacefully get a, a PVM that works perfectly and it was suitable for gaming just for a webcam. I'm, I don't want to waste a PVM's life. It's like Rick and Morty with a robot that only does butter. What's, what's my purpose? Just bring the butter. Uh, I don't want to, I don't think I'll be able to get. So this here was a gift from a friend of mine, Jerome from France. And this has, you, you, you're not able to see it here, but you can see in solid background games, it says MTV. There's a bunch of MTV burning. So that's why you usually get logos and things, but... And even if you move a tiny bit, because this, this ain't no motherfucking green screen, you know? Uh, yeah, it takes many, many months. So, you know, I don't think it's liable to happen. And also, the angle is always different here. Uh, just today, I moved the... Uh, so sometimes the camera's on. So you're not, never, like, if I had a logo here the whole time, then, then I'll be worried, yes. 
but it takes a very long, it takes a lot, a, a lot longer, and I know I'm the same. I, I like to turn off the CRT, but it's more about saving, preserving the life of it. Uh, but as, as far as burning, it's not as easy as, as you think how it is, you know? I remember when I was little, I was five or six, and had found this ma all the magnets. Uh, they're out loud here in the house. Uh, and I found out when I put on the TV, made pretty collars. My dad was pissed, yeah. Well, <laughs> oh, your old man's gonna have a heart attack. You gotta purr the mouth. He puts a lotion in the skin, or else he gets a hose again. <laughs> on the purty mouth, here's another one I like. See, there's a many quotes in that movie. Boy, you listen to me. You gonna do some praying for me, and you better pray good. And the other one is that. Uh, which didn't even make any sense. It tied him up in the tree, right? And goes like, you ever had your balls cut off? You fucking ate? And then, <laughs> what? And then he, he cuts him, right? And then he's like, did he bleed? He bled. <laughs> and uh, yeah, there's so many. Oh, see, what, wait, what's this about, fellas? What, what, do you, what do you gentlemen require? What do we require? We require you to get your ass up on them damn woods. <laughs> I love that movie. It's good. You gotta purr their mouth. Uh, uh, them panties. Take them off. What's this about, fellas? <laughs> Don't say anything. Just do it. All right, I gotta... Mm, I want to go up there, but I think that'll be a... Would that be wise? You disappoint me, Kitana. Not very wise. What in the hell is that thing I just grabbed? Is that the Snorlax Pokemon? I need to watch it again in the edge. But how do you learn? You wanna, you wanna sit here. You wanna sit here and die, don't you? you wanna, should, should do it. Lay down and die, Bob. <laughs> I love that movie. Top the Edge, 1997. Anthony Hopkins, Alec Baldwin. Watch it, believe it, love it. In Sling Blade. Those are movies I really lo love. Can you can you go back here? Look, man, I wanna check this out, but I'm, I'm kinda scared. If I go up there and he's just one of them dead pools, you know? I'm gonna kill the motherfucker. I love it, that movie's so awesome, man. Uh, good memories of that movie. That house is the Silence of the Lambs theme bed and breakfast type place where the owner has everything set up, like the film plus the hole in the basement. It sort of remind, reminds me of another one that's a good movie, Gothica with uh, Halle Berry. And uh, it's kind of fucked. Her husband, well, I'm not going to spoil the movie. Gothica with Halle Berry. Halle Berry, I thought that movie was scary. The way the ghost moves and whatnot. That was a good movie, man. I like I like that movie. I, I watched that movie a few times. Damn it! You're hurting me. I'm hurting Linda. I hate you, and I hate you, a little prick. No, I don't. I look. I'm checking that fucking room. I want to know what's in there. So there's a house tour. All right, send me a link, Salamander. Checking a fucking break overlay here. Yeah, I know I'm, I'm doing poorly here. I tried to do better. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I'm not the role model you expected me to be on Star Tropics playing the first time. I know. Disgusting human being. I'm a terrible father, terrible husband, and terrible person. I will try to do better. <sighs> I was in a dark place. All right, let's go. I want to know what's up in that, in that room. I want to know. I need to know. You cheap motherfucker. All right, let's try to keep calm here. You know what? I never understood the keep calm and carry on because it uh, mean. Uh, it, I know it comes from World War World War Two electric bugaloo in. Apparently in England, they were they were fearing a German invasion during the, the war, 
And uh, so that sign was to keep people in high spirits, you know, stiff upper lip and all that. But I, I don't understand how that meme came to apply for literally everything. Any lovers of that meme here? I never, it's kind of like watching New South Park. I don't like that. I don't get the integrity stuff. I don't get what part of it is supposed to be amusing, to be honest. I really, you know, I really don't get it. W what are they on about in there? Can I talk for a tiny bit? Apparently not. Catfish coming out of the water here. And you go like you can pause, you know? There's something about streaming a game and you pause and there's complete silence. I always prefer to have the game unpaused so there's a little bit of music in the background, right? It's less awkward. Because, uh, if the music's not on, you're gonna realize that I'm boring and you're gonna leave. And then I'm gonna lose all my millions. My millions of yens. You know? So I prefer to leave the music on, but sometimes that kind of shit happens, you know? And this block here is a, You son of a bitch. He's just here to fuck with your mind, because you think he's gonna disappear, but he doesn't. Remember me? Suck a shit. Uh, the bats are bat out of hell. Jeepers Scrapers, that's another franchise I really like. Oh shit. Gotcha. Just fooling around, mister, that's all. <clears throat> you can attack me there too, which is pretty useful. Do I know that from my own amazing brain? Nope. Nitro Red told me all about it. I done told you, I don't know shit. Oh, there it is. It'll be way off, sir. This is a fun game. You know, I know it's gonna be, gonna be a lot harder than what it is now, so I'm, I gotta improve my game here kind of bit. How about we use the, uh, there you go. That's how we use that thing. The current setup makes NES looks really big. I forgot they dwarf the Famicom version. Yeah, that's the thing here. Uh, and if you've been making this type of content, you have to you have to match the CRT to the size of the console. Oh, come on. That's why for me, uh, I got that last monitor, the 480p at 14 inch size because it's just perfect with the uh, console like the Dreamcast, the 480p consoles, right? I'm thinking 480p, 4x3. So you got the dream you got the Dreamcast. I'm not gonna mention the PS2. Sorry, it's, it's a 480i. There's nothing wrong with it. 480i looks beautiful on the set, but I, I'm aware some games on the PS2 are 480p, but the majority of them are not. 480p, PS2 equals 480i standard 15 kilohertz set. Now, uh, GameCube, tiny console, Dreamcast, tiny console, Xbox, not a tiny console. Ooh, got a heart. But he had a heart. So I needed a 14-inch monitor. Not, not to mention, mention that to bring it here into this room, a 20-inch, it's, it's quite tough, actually. Damn it. Damn it, Randy. So that monitor uh, has made my life a lot easier from here on out. Yeah, it's a 480i. Uh, There's a f few 480p here and there, but... And yeah, yeah, I know you can force it with the G GSM control. Uh, good luck with that. Most of it don't work. It doesn't work as well as you think it should. Uh, quick. Come on! Urgh. Die, monster. You don't belong in this world. So he did. Not too bad. Uh, half a heart. Gone. That's it. I watched the sale with J Lo and I Max when it came out. It scared the shit out of me. The sale. Uh, I don't know about J Lo or Jennifer Lopez, right? I know that Penelope Cruz is on the Gothica. She's pretty. Any more trespassers tonight? No, it's been quiet here. Yeah, because that's the thing. If I hear anything, I gotta, I gotta come out and just make sure that the right people are in there, you know? Because you never know. I've been here seven years and no thieving has ever happened here. But there's, you know, there you go. 
So it's been, it's been okay. But I'm here all the, come on! I'm here all the time. Mm-hmm. I don't go anywhere. I don't like going anywhere. For me, for me going somewhere is a chore. I'll be honest with you, sometimes, if, like when I used to work, I used to sabotage my own friendships. Like, not sabotage, like I wouldn't, I, I didn't get your clothes. I, I, I'm, I'm at the point, I got my wife and kids and that's that's it. You know, like I, for me, like going to barbecues, I don't mind guests, but for me going to other people's homes and going to their barbecues and their functions and it's just, ah, it's just, maybe I'm just lazy. I'm not lazy when it comes to doing work, but it's just going to social functions. I'm not a social guy, though. I don't socialize that much. I like to be a hermit. I'll say, if you get, look past my married life, when I was single, the happiest time is when I, I was down on my luck in Mississippi. I call my former boss in Nevada, and I say, look, I'm about to be fucking homeless here. I kind of lost everything, uh, and I don't know what the hell I'm going to do, and I call him up. And I said, you know, can you help me? And anyway, he said, make your way. If you make your way here to Nevada, I'll put you up on the ranch. And I had lived in Nevada before. And the ranch is a trailer in the middle of the desert. I said, well, how, how am I supposed to make a living there or do anything? Well, there are traps. I'll give you a 22 single shot rifle. Lots of bullets. Go hunting. And uh, I will drop you dry supplies. And your neighbor, he's going to pick up uh, every two months or so, three months or something. You can go to town, bring the barrels, and bring back water, and just maintain them clean. And I lived out there for a very long time, alone, just me and the wind in the desert. And it was the happiest time in my life. No computers, no consoles, no nothing. And wouldn't you know, I just, I was happy there. I, I really was. Not that I'm unhappy now, I'm just saying that I really enjoy my time there. I'm an introvert, I'm, a, I'm an extrovert that can, that deep inside I'm an introvert, so I have the ability, I don't have, not dunking on anyone that does have those problems, but I don't have problems with social graces, I can go, I can keep a party alive, I can, I'm the same here, what you see here, but inside I prefer, if I have the chance, the option, I'm quite comfortable being alone, quiet, by myself. I don't know if that makes any sense, so I wouldn't say that I'm an introvert, because I read, what I read about introverts is that, they have, I think, borderline anxiety of socializing and stuff like that. I'm not, I don't have that. But if given the option to be alone, uh, and definitely not social social functions. I don't like going to barbecues, gala fucking dinners, none of that shit. Uh, even going to town, for me, I don't like it. So in that part, like deep inside, of, I'm like, you know, so I don't know. Maybe I'm a big introvert who knows how to fake it. Fake until you make it. Shake that money maker, you know? <laughs> I don't know. I'm me. That's a weirdo. Really cool, actually. I wouldn't last a week. Need my technology. Carly needs her Wi-Fi. Let me tell you something. I, when I went there, yeah, and you do miss it sometimes, but about three days in, when you're in a situation like that, you forget all about that shit somehow. I don't know how to explain it. It just kind of goes away from your mind. Humans, we're very good at adapting at everything. So it just kind of went away. Now, I did have a laptop, which was the first computer I ever had, and I still have it. It's grossly outdated by now. I would, it was a very special occasion to walk to my neighbor, which was quite a long ways, quite a lot. How much of a walk? You get blisters. That's how much of a long walk it was in, in the desert, right? And he had solar panels and had batteries. So I'll plug in the laptop and I still have had some family guy and some South Park and stuff like that that I got from town that when I lived in town and it was in a hard drive and we washed those and uh, he had beer. And that was, a, but that was a rarity. It was like prime time stuff, you know? Yeah. But you do forget it. You'll be amazed because yeah, if I think about that now, it's insane. I love my consoles. I love my CRTs. I like watching YouTube all day and shit like that, you know? But once you get into that, you're put into that type of scenario and you, you don't have much of an option, right? I mean, I, I, I could I couldn't go to, to my boss and go like, look, man, I appreciate your helping me, but I need, where, where's the internet? <laughs> you tell me to fuck off, you know? So, yeah, when you put in that situation, you kind of, I think you over, I think all y'all, 
It's, I'm not stronger than what you are. That's what I'm trying to say. You, everyone here would adapt. I will be shooting my 22 all day. It gave me a good, a lot of bullets, and uh, I'll be shooting batteries and try to get better at shooting and and uh, play musical instruments. Uh, there was a radio, so that that wasn't too bad. You know, there was a radio in there. What is this shit? I don't remember this room here. Interesting. Be right back. No problem. Thank you. Spartan Stutz says, uh, I've never lived alone. I always wonder what they'd be like. Ambivert. Well, there you go. That sounds like a term. Shooting, shooting snake. Snake Pliskin. Uh, can you play Wii Sonic Unleashed one of the, the days? I, I could, I, yeah, at some point. The amount of like, look, I'm gonna I'm gonna open up about how how I get games real quick. You will walk and talk. This is a puzzle, so I'll be looking at, at it right now. The reason why sometimes a lot of suggestions uh, they're good, and I got a, I got a, a good one the other day. But a lot of times, a lot of the games are an appeal. I still listen to them. I look at the chat, but I can't say I'll play the game because I have to look at it. You know, sort of. I tend to be a very decisive person. When I want a game, I kind of know what's gonna be. I go and do my own research. Uh, I I spend most of my time on YouTube when I watch stuff. Is definitely more than half is about video games, and more than half of that is about retro. So when I want to play games on a Wii or want to know about a game, I go to GameSack, watch this console episode. I will I'll go to lists. So it's pretty pretty easy information to find. I know I'm kind of a doofus when it comes to technology, but not that. So I tend to know a lot of games. I have a I have binders full of women here. No, I'm kidding. I have I have a lot of folders. I have a lot of folders here with a lot of games that over the years I gathered their, uh, the cover art and I know and I've seen footage of it that I know I'll play. So that's why sometimes people say is like, yeah, I could say that. Oh, definitely. I'll, look, Master Josh, we're playing that. We're, we're playing that tomorrow. First, first light. Eventually, maybe. I have to look into it. To be honest, you know. Somebody said one time, why don't you just go ahead and wipe your ass with the suggestions in? Because I was being a bit too real about, no, I'm dead. Oh, no, I'm alive. Uh, but I'd rather be, uh, maybe even come across as rude sometimes, but at least I, I'm shooting straight with you, you know? Not bullshit. I don't, I don't like bullshitting people around, you know? I'd rather tell you how it is, get it out of the way. So when it comes to game suggestions, there's a lot of them, you know. Uh, I think if I say I'll play, it's kind of an empty response. So I'll, I'll definitely look into those things in, in time. And the Wii is definitely a console I need to be playing here a, a lot more. Uh, and I will. And that's another thing. When people say, oh, when are you going to play this other console? In time. There's a lot of consoles I can't... Basically what I'm saying, if, if I listen to the chat all the time on what to play, I'll be... I'll go insane. I'll be I'll be just playing forever here. I don't think I even have time in my life, even with my size, to play everything that's being suggested so far. I don't think it's even possible. That's what I'm trying to say, you know? There's a lot of suggestions. There's sometimes like a, people spin out lists, like gigantic lists. This is how we should play. And I'm, I'm like, yeah, no, I, I hear you, but you know. I, do I have time enough? Am I gonna live that long? We PlayStation and Sonic. I'm, I'm, I think I'm being honest. With Sonic. I'm not big on Sonic uh, um, at all. I'm not gonna say I hate it. I played the first one. I'll play the second one, the third. I will be playing them, but just keep in mind that I'm not cuckoo for Sonic. It's not, I'm not a Sonic fan. You know, just never have been. Why, why would I say I am if I'm not? I didn't grow up with any Sega consoles. I don't have an attachment to Sonic. I don't think it's all that in a bag of crack, to be honest, but, uh, you know, I, I will look into them, I know, uh, I like the first one, it was good, you know, uh, yeah, and especially with the newer ones, it's not gonna, it, it's, it's, there's a small chance it'll happen before I play the 2D ones, you know, uh, to play the, to play, when I think of Wii, I don't think of going straight to Sonic, 
So that's what I'm trying to say here. And I, I got, I accomplished nothing. All right, I'm tired of y'all. That, that's it. Is that even hurting the things? Come near me, you fucks. Don't you touch me. So I reckon I gotta go up here. Is that it? Okay, I prefer the honesty. I don't think it come off as rude because it's just honest. I prefer to be honest, uh, 100%. Uh, don't be disencouraged if I shut down your request or if I say I'm not sure. It's just, it's just a reality. And I got a lot of consoles here playing to, to use, and I don't. There's a lot of stuff on the Wii. I've been dying to play Super Mario Sunshine, but I'm very distressful of my. Um, Memory cards and yes, they are official and yes, they're corrupting my saves. It has happened. Mem card pro from a <laughs> from maybe dodges eight bit mods is not in stock right now. Can't get it. Uh, I'm a little bit of a hermit in the winter. I just plow snow and hang out at home, keep the wood stove going. That sounds like a life that I would enjoy, to be honest with you. We're about to die, Jill. Mmm. I like the bat now. Stop swinging a bat, Wendy. Stop swinging a bat. There's a secret in here. I don't see any different shades of green here, to be honest with you. Super Mario Galaxy, on the, uh, when you start playing something, give it a good amount of play time. Uh, Super Mario Galaxy will happen, it has, uh, Sunshine has to happen first, then Galaxy. I'm not playing Galaxy before Sunshine. So I'll probably take a closer look at my memory cards. There's one of them that was good. My, uh, <laughs> my Resident Evil 4 saves are in there, but there's a thing called, um, memory card backup or something backup manager so it's, it's it's kind of a pain in the ass but it is it's possible to back up your saves so i'll look into it definitely uh galaxy is great i played it and uh, you'll definitely see there's a hundred percent chance you'll be played here 100 percent sunshine is the weakest link in that series people say that and i'm not seeing it love the game it's called uh controversial opinion some people like the game i like it i like sunshine didn't see anything tremendously wrong with it but i get where people says i think it's the flood and everything it is considered a weakest link yeah but i did like it oh no sunshine will be happening on the 480p now i don't know about the edtv uh, not possible i can't bring a 30 36 inch or even a 32 inch in here it's not possible that's not going to happen so, uh, Sunshine is widescreen, BBM, 4x3, four, uh, four and yes, it's possible to play widescreen, and I, I'm, I'm leaning towards playing, I'm leaning towards playing in widescreen because I hear a lot of, um, a lot of, uh, oh, with emulation, oh, with this, oh, with the Nintendo Switch release, you can play in widescreen. You can play with not widescreen with the original hardware, too. It's just a fucking code. That's all. And it works beautifully. So I like to show people that. Look, this is original hardware. This is widescreen. I think it's cool. But if I don't play in widescreen, uh, then a VGA monitor. The EDTV is not possible. It's just it's gargantuan. It's dinosauric. I can't bring it in here. It's not possible, unfortunately. Do you enjoy Silent Hill? Uh, my one of my favorite series of all time. My favorite series, Mortal Kombat, Silent Hill, Resident Evil, Mario, and something else I forgot by now. Silent Hill, I play one, two, three, and four. And no, I'm not one of those guys that say that go like only the four one. I'll play the other ones too. No, not part of the fandom, not part of the community, none of that. I don't post a gazillion posts on Reddit about it. Just love the games here privately. I used to say it was Silent Hill one, but I play Silent Hill two another time, and I got to say Silent Hill two. I found. All of them good. Silent Hill 3 is excellent. I found, found it to be more horror than the second one. Uh, 
Second one is a game that by all intents and purposes, because of the plot, I shouldn't care about it, because I always say, I care about gameplay. I like the gameplay too, but the plot on that one, dude, it's, I just like it, it's, it's amazing. And that game makes me feel something. More specific, I played here, on stream, by the way. Uh, zero, who has? Uh, zero, A-B-R-S, zero abers. Look, it's on my YouTube. It's, uh, and, but I found the scariest one to be Silent Hill 4. However, as most people, I don't care for babysitting Eileen for half the fucking game. That was fucking atrocious. I hate escorting. I, I hate it. I can't stand it. But the game is that good that I still liked it. Yeah, I like it. I thought the lore of Silent Hill 4 was absolutely incredible. And I, I really enjoyed the game. And I spent months reading about it, the wikis and all that. You know? Post circumcision meltdown on Silent Hill Wiki time. I was there, by the way, when that happened. If you don't know what I'm talking about, Wang has a video about it. I was there. It was hilarious. The, the circumcision meltdown on the Silent Hill Wiki. Alex Shepard. Try the USB loader GX frame buffer mode. They're thrown. Oh, I haven't yet. I, I need to do it. Uh, is that the thing that removes the filter stuff? Didn't mention Castle Castlevania. That's the one. Fuck me. Uh, Castlevania's up there for me, man. Castlevania. That's right. Castlevania. Good job, Boogie Boogie. I want to play the the Wii. There's a game on the Wii. Um, uh, this is bullshit here. I get touch touch me. Fuck. God damn it! It's a, it's a beginner of the game. Yeah, I, I, I think I want to check the other room now. But I kind of lost track of where it was. Damn it. Zero, which one are you going to check out? Which ones did you play? Which one is your favorite, Silent Hill? Uh, uh, Castlevania is awesome. Castlevania, my favorite, is uh, Rondo Blood. Even though I played it only once. That's the thing. I... I don't have to play a game a gazillion times, you know, is, is good. That is awesome. You know, I didn't even 100% the game yet. But what I saw, I'm going to go up here now. I want to know what's up here. I think that's what happened. I, I just came here right off. Yeah, uh, that's it. I'm just going the wrong way here. Oh, come on. Where's the baseball bat? No, I think I get the baseball bat on the other side, right? Well, conga bonga time. Mm. And what is the potion again? Come, come to think of it, what, what does that do? <laughs> I didn't read the fucking manual. Shatter Mammers, that's the one. That's the one I'll be playing on the Wii. I'll be playing that one on the Wii. It is better than the PS2 one. Graf the graphics, it is better. Hmm. I'm looking forward to it. To that one. But because I start streaming and doing content, uh, I'm going to be playing the, the Silent Hills uh, here again from the beginning. I already played the first one. I played the second one. So the next one has got to be the third one, which is awesome. I find that game kind of scary. Uh, a lot of, uh, scary as hell, to, to be honest. I do get scared with games. I do, by God. What was Congo Bongo on arcade and then SG-1000? I have an SG-1000 flashcard here. I just need the fucking console. You can play on your master system to runs, but the collars are off. And I think you can play on... They stopped doing, but you can... If you have a ColecoVision, you can get an SG-1000 card as well and play it there. Or is it... M what if, is it MSX? No, MSX, but it can play SG-1000, I think. Yeah, so they're, they're kind of similar. I think it can play, nowadays it can play MSX games on your master system as well, if you have a flash card. <clears throat> what did you expect? The Wii is more powerful than the PlayStation 2. 
That's not, and that's an incorrect assumption. I have to call you out on this one. Uh, which one? Okay, which one is more powerful, the PS2 or the Xbox? Well, we all know it's the Xbox. So, Silent Hill 2 came out on the Xbox and on the PS2. Which one is a better version? The PS2. Which one supports 480p? Does the PS2? <coughs> I need call. Does the PS2 support 480p? No. The game is tailor-made for the PlayStation 2, and there's a lot of problems going to the Xbox, despite the 480p, despite the extra content, the fog is fucked up, the FMVs are fucked up, a lot of issues. It was not a good port. It was the best that it could do, and it's playable, and it's serviceable, but uh, the PS2 is better, and, and, and same with uh, Metal Gear. Yeah? So, just because the console is more powerful, don't mean that the game is going to run better and look better in there. Because it all depends on how the, the, the people in charge, the devs develop the port, and how how do they do, how do they are acquainted with the hardware. So, yeah. So, it is possible for a game on the, on the PS2 to run worse on the Wii if the port is done like shit, right? But on that case, yeah, it is, the, the Wii has more power, no doubt. They're, you know, not even the same fucking generation, is it? But yeah, but you can get games that are, are more powerful consoles and not run as well and have issues. The world is a complicated place. Sometimes what the what it's supposed to be isn't. You know, that's what I'm saying. Uh, when I'm looking at, at games for, for the, because I have a, a number of consoles here, when I'm looking at ports of a game, I go to YouTube and I watch comparisons. Then I go to threads, I read what people have to say, uh, and then I make my judgment. And sometimes, uh, does Resident Evil 4 run better in the GameCube than the PS2? Does it look better? Yeah, 100%. It absolutely does. Will I play the PS2? Yeah. I want to play uh, the GameCube, I want to play the PS2 as well. The PS2, uh, there's a lot going for it because it, it is the console that sold the most, and it really, even though, you know, the GameCube was good enough. Uh, in terms of sales, it, it, it's really when it went to the PS2 that the sales w would have gone. And another thing, somebody came here the other day, mentioned sales. Oh, what? Okay, I'm not, I'm not gonna, I can't remember the name. I think it was OB4. We were talking here, talking about sales. Of, and sales is not a, not a good indication of anything, to be honest. So, sometimes it might be, but you can. The Thing by John Carpenter. The critics destroyed that fucking movie as far as sales. He, he didn't make a lot of money from it. He could have made a lot more. We all know the movie is awesome now. That's like universally accepted as reality. A little something I like to call reality, Frank. So, it didn't do well on sales. Plenty of things don't do well on sales and they're excellent products. Could be a number of things. Marketing, critics shitting all over your crap. Who knows? So in other words, uh, why am I not, why am I, what, where is the fucking baseball bat? I'm going, I'm going nuts here, I don't, I'm going on the, on the loop here. Am I in the loop? I gotta watch that movie about the loop thing. I think I lost my mind here. We'll play Shatter Memories Composite. Look, I, I like Composite on, um, I don't mind, but I, I find that 3D games, like more modern games, and for me, PS2 is modern, and I don't care what anybody else thinks. For me, it will always be modern. Dreamcast is modern. Even PS1 and 64 for me is kind of retro. It's 3D already, Move it, it's different. For me, it's already present stuff, moving forward. For me, it will always be, it's not gonna change. It's static, it's set in stone for me. So, uh, a lot of those games that you can do it on composite, but I, I don't know. I think composite, for me, composite RF, pixel art looks okay. I find that a lot of those, especially dark 3D games, uh, it gets kind of muddy, you know? I think probably, probably no, probably I'll go, I'll go with either SCART or uh, component. I have an American Wii for, for my component needs, and I have a, a PAL Wii, PAL games I never played on it. Uh, for my RGB needs, you know, so. Okay, I think whoever Master Picel, uh, it appears to be, it appears that I'm uh, locked up into a loop from hell here. Uh, I'm probably missing something. 
quite obvious. Uh, it looks like a... It looks like you chose a wrong party to crash. I'll wait for a hint here. I think I'm kind of fucked. Am I missing something crucial here? Earthquake happened in New York. Yeah, there was a fella here from Jersey saying there was an earthquake. That's crazy talk, isn't it? Insane. Never, never thought it would happen up there. Crazy. Uh, Resident Evil 4 PlayStation 2 had more content, but the Wii version has GameCube better graphics for PlayStation. Yeah, the Wii is the, is the one to go for. I didn't care for the motion controls uh, that a lot of people, you know, they cream their pants about it. I I went all the way to the island and then I had enough and I plugged in the GameCube controller. However, I was using a gun attachment, so maybe just use a Wii. So I'm willing to give it a, another chance in the future with the motion controls. I'm, I'm open-minded. I try to be. How do you, wait, do you rate Wii's RGB compared to Wii's component both in 480i? Uh, I told you many times RGB, RGB in component barely a difference. Anybody who says otherwise, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm going to tell you full of shit. It's, it's not. The brightness, adjust the brightness. Calibrate your monitor for component. Component, for all intents and purposes, uh, and I'll die on that hill, RGB and component are virtually the same virtually the same. RGB is technically superior. And you can't tell me, oh, because you're a fanboy. I have, I, most of my consoles are, are on RGB scars. I have component here, but uh, there's people comparing. I compared it. It's, you, you have to see it side by side. And then again, there's all the brightness stuff is brought up, but it, it, it's, it's one of those things that technically yes, but is it, does it make that much of a difference visually to you? It's like Nintendo 64 uh, without the D-Blur, Composite to RGB, mm, sorry, not a lot of difference. I didn't even bother the first time. I just kept playing on, on composite. Damn it. And, but the component, why why bother with the component? The component, I have my 480p option. That's why. I'm sorry I died here. I would die a few times. I, I was lost. I, I see you say the next room, but... I got, I got inside that room and it looks like I couldn't come out of it. Is that true? Are the rumors true? Ah! Asshole! So, I... Did I miss out picking... Did I waste my bat? Is that it? Move on, move on, move on, sir. Don't need to deal with every bat. Do I get anything from killing bats here? Oh, the cable's... Uh, uh, Here's the thing, the cables, uh, the quality of cables matter a lot more on, uh, on uh, RGB, uh, SCART. SCART, if you get cheap cables on component, you might, you might could get away with it. Uh, however, on uh, RGB SCART, no. Uh, sometimes. Uh, some people say, I have it and it's fine. But it's the old uh, frog in a ball of water, which is a myth, by the way. If you put a frog in a ball of water, they're going to jump. They're, gonna, they're, 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 not, they're not stupid. They're going to jump off. Uh, but if you don't have anything to compare with, then of course it's going to be fine. If I play here GameCube and RF, and I lost my fucking RF switcher five months ago, it pissed me off. I had a Japanese RF switcher, the little box, and it, it is fucking gone, and it really kills me every day I think of it. Uh, bastard. Look, you get used to it. Will I have less fun? I don't think so. You get past that jarring moment if you're coming from Campana. So it depends where you're coming from, right? It's like people that... I told you the first time I bought a, a, a Nintendo again to go back to the past to play the shitty games of Sarkas. I uh, played on... As it, as it follows. A shitty ass, 16 by 9 flat panel, old and outdated and terrible. Hooked up via composite. Stretch 16 to 16 by 9, 4 by 3. In other words, the worst possible setup, and I had fun. I didn't know any better. Now, when you compare it to something else, you go like, well, shit, I can't believe I did that, you know? 
That's why it, you gotta be always careful telling people like, you should get a CRT, you should get this, you should get that. Maybe the person's having fun as it is and they don't need that. A lot of people are not into it. You know, baby, you've got it. What you've got is it. Now give it to me. So yeah, a lot of people are not. You gotta, you gotta read the room sometimes. You know, I don't go, uh, people, some people come in here. I don't go on a tangent when they ask, why do you have so many tubes uh, about 480i and interlace? And, and I just tell them, they make old games look good. And they go, ah, well, thanks. Cause some people, some people, they lose track of other people not being into their hobbies. And you, you know, people are falling asleep. You're talking about fucking interlace and component and RGB. Not our case here, and most of us are into the hobby. But not everyone. Some people are here just, I don't know, they maybe just saw the video and, uh, oh, this guy's playing Star Tropics. They come here. I'm babbling on about CRTs. They leave, and that's fine. It means the content is not for you. But, you know. But, uh, majority of people in real life, they're not into the things that we, we're doing here. <laughs> for them, it's just a, a bunch of old junk, you know? Hooking 255 follows. Hi there. Welcome in. I'll be playing Road, road Rash. That's an inevitability. Zed Shift. Thank you for, for following. Hey, Princess Retro. Stay he still here. How's, uh, how's the whiskey and cola? Coming along well. Uh, so many random accessories just disappear over it. Yeah, it, it does, it does. I can't fucking find a thing, and that's been gone for like, I'm talking six months. And you know what, to add insult to injury? Uh, and thank you, um, thank you for the uh, the comment, Princess Retro. You are fantastic, thank you. And look, five or six months, I think it's been more now. And it eats me inside. That, that fucking thing. Oh, to add answer to Andrew, I have the box staring at me right there on it. You know, it's the darnest thing. I moved, I removed it from the box and I see it. And that's my fallacy a lot of times. I will take care of this. This is very important to me. I went through great lengths to get this thing. I will take care of it. And then I put it somewhere special. And then because of it, I'm an old sack of shit, I forget where the special place was. If I had left it alone on the fucking shelf, You'll still be there right now. So I actually wanted to play fucking GameCube and shit like that on RF and N64 because I grew up with N64 and RF, but the fucking thing is gone. You know, it's the same, by the way, for the GameCube and N64. Yeah. Well, love my old junk so much. Same here. I like the old stuff, man. CRT for cave RF is here. And it, it kills me because I don't know nobody here threw it away. But you know, I got a pal one. The fucking piece of shit is still here. Ah. It was an NTSCJ RF switcher. Uh, the RF box, the modulator. So it's a mo modulator that goes on the back. You don't need a switch to be this, the same thing. Right now, we're using a Casio PV1000 RF switcher. Works just fine with the Nintendo. Is it? No, it's not a Casio PV1000. It's something else. I don't know what it is. There's something else in there. It's not Nintendo related. Whiskey makes me frisky. Just kidding. But it's good though. It makes me a little bit, you know. Oh, getting frisky, are we? <laughs> you really are a fat bastard. Oh, Mr. Englishman telling me to lose weight. Love that guy. Would you, are you frisky enough to get down with fat bastard? It sounded a bit wet at the end. Okay, come on. Ain't nothing wrong with getting we all we all have desires. We all watched uh, Hellraiser. Who are you? Explorers of the Nether Realm. Angels, your son, demon shooters. Now, whiskey's awesome. I misplay stuff all the time in the tubes. Oh, God, you don't want to, you don't want to see. <clears throat> I, not, not as much now, but I used to lose my electronic cigarette uh, fucking two, three times a day. Glasses are gone. Everything's gone. I'm, God bless my wife. She's a finder here. She finds everything. 
and I get I get very angry. If you think I only get angry with video games, watch me looking for stuff. I hate looking for stuff. Where's my fucking RF modulator? Motherfuckers. Where is it? Somewhere around here. It's lurking. It's the ultimate lurk lurker. Mm, I'm gonna use this thing. Big mistake! There we go. I know you don't. Do, we, do I need to pause it? You do need to pause. No, you can press relax. Okay. So okay, Master Pascal, I'm gonna wait here. So I I I, I thank for your your advice, your humble advice here. It appears to me the last time I went up here and I get that heart container, the heart thing, the potion, the gem of marmalade, preserves, whatever this is, probably on the, the manual. And it appears to me I got locked up up there. Couldn't come back. And this is the way to do something else. Piano Artist Gaming on YouTube. Wow, this and Star Tropics 2, Zelda's Revenge was my childhood games from the 90s. Great playthrough. Thank you. It's a good choice of game, but I, I'm pretty sure the playthrough will be quite poor. It's my first time playing, and, and I, I'm not, not very good at it. Earth 200. I was going to see Rex as an excellent eye, doing doing perfectly well. I think Master Pycelle is do, away doing Canadian things. So I'm going to go ahead and... Hmm, I'm going to go ahead and... I'm going to go up. There's there's, a, there's this preserves up there. Right? I think I was just missing it. Sometimes I think, I think it's because I don't... I, I'm not quite experienced yet with a Master of... I haven't mastered yet playing games and talking at the same time too much, you know? And I'm, that's not me in any way, shape or, shape or form saying that the chat is bothering me. The chat never bothers me at all. Uh, it's a pleasure to have y'all here talking. But I, uh, no, I didn't fuck up. Look, you come back here. How do you get out of this? Right? That's what I'm talking about. So I, I got the, the jar of preserves here and then wood. What do you do after that? I can come back here. The door is locked. So is this a... Am I soft locked here? And I say, if you... If you want to risk, go up. But up where? There ain't no up. Is there something up here? I'm right, responding in on this. They're gonna kill me here. Go up where? You stay. Oh! Lack of imagination, wouldn't you know? What a doofus. I me in the beginning of the playthrough. Listen, guys, I'm gonna be stepping in all the, guys, all the green cubes here. Platforms, whatever. Yeah. Persist should not do that. My mole steak. Is my chat extremely slow? No, it's fine. I thought he was gone, though, which is fine. You're not a, obligated here to, you know, guide my blind ass. Hidden passage was the right way. Uh, yeah, but then, then he can reopen here by just doing that. Look at me being a doofus. Okay, note to self. Don't be dumb. The end. Problem solved. Do the things that he said he would do. I tell you what I'm gonna do right the fuck now. Please get out first. Kill him! Damn it. Just press select. Don't kill me. Don't kill me. Don't tase me, bro. No! Bitch ass. Uh, I'm gonna get off. It's, it's hot here. I need to get off the fucking, uh, this flannel shirt. Too much. Thank you for ending that music. You know, Woogie Boogie, the powers are within you. Just turn down the volume. But again, some some music is great. Wait until I play Atari here. Have I been wearing this? 
How, how do you explain th this here? How would a man... How? The button is inside. How, how, how did I do that? And no, the shirt is not inside out. How, glitch in the matrix? Hmm. It's fucking weird. What the hell? No, 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 you gotta love this. Twice in a row. That, that's the other one. I don't remember doing such things. It, it's inside. I, I button the butt. You know, it's kind of like when you meet the Resident Evil 4 Ganado and he, he turns around but the longer way around. And it's kind of weird, right? You know he's insane here and there. Well, watch this. You ever seen somebody but, button up shirts like this? And you, you come here and you want you want me to act normal? You think I'm normal? Mister, you got another thing coming. Okay. I hope I won't reflect as much on the, on the CRT here. We'll see how it goes. Yeah, you, you, won't, you won't believe how much uh, CRTs can warm up a room, even in the dead of night here. Okay. Masterfully buffoon <laughs> button that shirt. You see that? How the fuck did I even do that? I don't think I ever did that in my life. I never recall ever seeing me button up something like that. So I must have been out of it this, uh, you know, today. What in the hell? Gotta be smarter than the shirt. That's a, that's a problem. <laughs> Outsmarted by the shirt. I like flannel shirts that sell a JC panties. I love flannel shirts. Uh, I love that kind of tartan shirts. You know, checkered shirts. I love them. Sometimes uh, a good old t-shirt is all you need. And what in the hell is that thing? Looks like some kind of voodoo doll or something. You be the power of bag of you. No, 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 no. You're not wasting the waste. I can't believe I'm saying that, but wasting the baseball bat. So that fish went away. Fine, I'll make it back here after a series series of buffoonery events. Events of buffoonery. We're gonna help you. Okay, uh, baseball bat. Please, I'm gonna harness the power of nicotine. I want to do well. I want to kill this guy. Very cool boss, by the way. Very impressive the size of the sprites here. By the way, that's not unnoticed. And I need to do well here. I need to equip the baseball bat. And whenever he comes down here, I need to hit him in the face. That's the gist of it, right? I'm not a scholar, but that's my deduction here on how this is going to go down. Spartan Study Group, Mississippi and Louisiana. Spartan Stud in Louisiana. And elsewhere, too. Some other place. But the bulk of it was there. How about you? Where are you from? Uh... Yeah. Oh, and I went back in uh, 2007 to Louisville in Winston County. I lived in Oxipater for a while, small, tiny, small town. Very nice place. And I left there in 2009, I think, for Nevada. And that's how we went down. You're from New England. Wait a minute, you, and sorry if I don't remember the names perfectly, I remember the conversations, but are you the failure from Maine, or no? Was that somebody else? We're talking about maple syrup here the other day, and yeah, talking about Maine. Who's out there? New England, I've never been up there. I've been, I've been pretty much everywhere but there, in the Pacific Northwest, and of course Alaska. I had a chance to go to Alaska one time, should have. I think I should have gone. Salamander Jack, that's the one. All right. New England. So did. Well, New Jersey is not New England. It's Massachusetts. So Maine, Maine, New Hampshire, Vermont, Rhode Island, Connecticut, Massachusetts. That's New England, pretty much, right? Am I right or am I right? 
All right. All right, let's try the, let's try the, because I was uh, going to ask, <laughs> apparently there was a, an earthquake in New York or Jersey, somewhere up there, but that's not New England, so I'm not, you know, I'm not that, that dumb. Uh, Alaska, New York. You never been to New York? I never been up there either. Well, for you, you'd be down there. By the way, you can freeze the octopus in place. You can like the snowman power up. Well, I, it was my impression, uh, and now that you mention that, I've seen on, on, on the Nitro Red video, it was my impression here that I collected the snowman. So where would that be right now? Because I, I, I sure as fucking seen here. Is there something that I need to do? Or I'm pretty sure I jumped on it, right? And then, and it, and then what happened? What's 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 going on here? Have I been robbed? Of my innocence, I'm not understanding what's taking place here. Cause yeah, press select during the fight is not doing anything. I'm I'm gonna die. It's just I knew select select just just, just shifts here, uh, and I'm gonna get hit. No, uh, I'm sorry. I I don't know where that thing is. We're doing this live. We're doing it the hard way. There'll be no freezing here. Yeah, yeah. Get ready to get fucked. Bullshit. Damn it! Can't go too far. I'm a. We're, we're gonna die, Jill. You see? Well, that didn't go. I had the bravado, but not the. Not what it took to defeat the boss. It looked. It sounded good on paper. But I wasn't able to seal the deal. Put that coke down. Coke is for closers only. <laughs> you stupid bitch, you feel this light, I'll teach you how to fuck with me. Couldn't seal the deal, huh? The leads are weak. The, the leads are weak? Here, this guy. The leads are weak? You weak. The leads are weak. So what happened? What happened with the the snowman? Because I don't have it on my inventory here. It, am I? Might do I need to do something here? Little. What's happening? Princess Retro said, "I'm not a scholar, but I'm a hoot and a holler. I love saying hoot and a holler. I say that a lot. It's one of my favorite sayings. Whenever something's good, it says a hoot, la, a hoot and a holler. Good." Right, Macho Man ran a savage. Go back, <clears throat> get back on that horse. I'm tired of you. I'm tired of those things here. It's, I seem to have acquired something. He acquired a taste for human flesh. Now let's go up here, get the the, jam, the jar of preserves that does something. I don't know what it does, it does something. It's liable to do something. I need the stars that they do something to that you don't know. More stars that do things. It apparently does stuff on things. That's a that's a word on the street here. Every time I say, me, she didn't read the manual. I never read a fucking manual. I'm always fucking around here with fucking cables and uh, it's time to stream. I'm, in fact, today I'm a, I'm a, I was an hour late. Supposed, supposed to start an hour earlier than I did. Navarro, what's wrong, Navarro? Sucking a good dicks lately? Navarro, I think you look good with this big sausage in your mouth. What the? Ha ha ha. Come on. I'm, I'm, I'm done, I'm dead. I'm essentially.
Wow, did I get my ass whipped here by those fucking things. I'm dead. Am I able to recover the health? I don't fucking know. I got the jammer preserved already. Uh, okay. Psycho through your menu. That's okay. When, when you get this old man power up, I think you press pause and then the up arrow. Okay, so that's a missing, missing link. When you use the power up, make sure the octopus comes down close. Oh, that one I could have dedu deduced that one. That one I think I would have, I would have, I think I would have gotten that right. Because if you freeze him up there, then what good is it? You know? So there, there's this no man. So let's test the theory here. I don't fucking know, man. You gotta go up and down here. And look, I got two of them motherfuckers here. Two of them. Wow, I never fucking knew. I thought it. This, this is it. This is what it was. I mean, why the fuck would it, you feel up here? I don't know. Well, now we know. Thank you, piano artist on YouTube, for the tip. Okay. I'm pretty sure it'd be on the manual, though. I, it's my fault. I didn't read the manual. Everybody back then read the manuals. I didn't, and that's what happens. That's, that's, they made a fucking manual. Read it. Right? Okay. Okay, let's... Don't panic. Use this thing. I wonder how close I was. Can you stop? What in the hell has gotten into you? Does he know I'm... N nothing happened. So, is there a problem here? I thought it was going to get equipped and I was going to use it in the heat of the battle. I didn't know that I have to use it on the pause menu. It's not something that crossed my mind. That's why I highlighted it and I unpressed the pause button and I expected it to be equipped. I know this is going to be on the manual and I got nothing but myself to blame. But that's that. It's okay. We'll get back. And I'm not going to holler. I'm not going to go nuts here. I'm not going to say cunt 500 times. Just go back into it. I have another one left. It's not the end of the world. Count to 10. And that's it. See, I'm controlling the beast within. I'm getting there. I can always do it. But sometimes the manual is there to be read. And I didn't read it. And that's the problem. So I got two of them. It's okay. We'll get there. We'll get it done. Uh, I hope, I sincerely hope, that he won't be remaining frozen up there. That he'll come down here to meet me again. And I get a second chance at, at it. Because uh, I'm dumb and I fucked up. And I was, I was ill-informed. Okay. It's okay. Oh, my camera froze. Oh, no, 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 this is good. What a time to froze you. Look at me. Did you think I was holding my hand on that fucking monitor the whole time? Is that is that what you think? It's frozen. The footage frozen. 
it's funny when you look at it it looks I, I won't do it in a bit here is Elgato being a, an asshole but but it's it's fun to think you think I'm holding my hand there perfectly on that monitor right nope so I gotta come here and I gotta go to OBS and I gotta go to properties uh, I think and it's fun to me a lot of times when I'm very angry and I, I didn't do anything I didn't hit anything I didn't go nuts here Elgato harness the negativity and it just it shut down there you go this is the I, I'm here I, I was not like this the whole time let me try to recreate it yeah there you go nope I was here normal talking the whole time so that's the uh, Elgato uh, which is uh, apparently the greatest fucking capture card ever made uh, it's just not mine mine is not all two of them that I have here Okay, no, I was talking the whole time, and that's that's okay. It's a little bit more bullshit we got to deal with here and there. That's fine. It's a very odd time that it picked you to freeze like that. I don't know why it shows that specific frame, but it did. <laughs> okay. Okay, so now now we know. Sometimes it hey, you went a blockbuster, you didn't get the manual. You got to learn it somehow. Yeah, you learn by your mistakes here. Outstanding. That was, uh, that went exactly how I wanted it to be. That was intentional, by the way. Here's the problem, though. Uh, you die a thousand times on a goddamn starfish, and, uh, well... What is the fucking jam of preserves? The, the, the jar of preserves, the amazing jar here. Uh, ah! Annoying! See you later, bitch. Oh god, it's gonna be there when I come back, isn't it? We'll try again, but this time I know. Uh, and guess what? You get another snowman. Yeah, why not? Oh, we got, we got two of them here. Could have three, but whatever. You done goofed. Not the game. It was you. Can't believe I'm, I I'm paused the fucking thing and the. <laughs> The projectile was about to hit me anyway, so all this time I was living on borrowed time. How about I don't, I don't acknowledge you? Hmm? And look how well I did by, by doing that, because I, uh, I have full health right now. I'm going to go on a limp here and say that the jar preserves is health. Is that what, is that, what that is? Oh, shit hitting stuff here. I think the manual will be one of those Nintendo Power magazines. Yeah, we did have some. I had a few Nintendo Power magazines and others too. Okay, I'm going to try to use the jar. Living La Vida Loca. We'll, we'll try again. Still, still over the moon with the internet working perfectly. I'm not used to it at all. Not having to worry about my stream shutting down and, and all that. Okay, so now we know. Fuck you. Now we know what's up here. Remember me, bitch? And then we do this and we use that. And where's my fucking bat? You done goofed. My bat. Where's my fucking bat? I could use another one, right? Should I? Should I use another one? I'm trying to do some legit stuff here. No, I think you need that bat. Fuck you. I didn't use the other one. There you go. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> there he is. Let's go talk to that fella. Oh, he's talking up. He's doing some talking here.
You've done it. Saving your data. Yeah. All right, celebratory smoke. Uh, Francis Redder said, did you get better internet or a new provider? No, I'm, I'm kind of stuck in the middle of nowhere, and the only option here is, well, two options. Starlink, uh, which I went down that route, didn't didn't perform as excellent for using the internet, watching stuff for streaming at 1080p, even 7, maybe 720, 1080p and all. Uh, and I like an, the idiot that I am. I didn't test the 720 play before I returned. It was fine. So no, there was a guy here, a Scottish friend of mine, that came over. Oh, he gave me a call. And so the only option here is there's nothing wired. It's literally like middle of nowhere. So we got a 5G router, wireless router. Now, the computer itself is wired with Ethernet cables all the way back to the uh, delivery room where the router is. There's only one place we got some good reception here. So I would stream. The stream would stop all the time. Sometimes it'd be the whole day all fucked up, down to kilobytes, kilobits per second. Uh, and uh, I was even doubt. I even had doubts if I'd be able to be a streamer at all and continue this because it was completely fucked. It was unsustainable, right? So what happened? is that this is not a 5G area, but the the 5G signal comes here sometimes. So what would happen is the router would default to, 4, to 5G. So every time uh, 5G was not available, it would go to 4G. But every time 5G would come in, and it, many times a day, and that's when the internet was tanking, it would, look, it, would, it would disconnect and go to 5G. So we would swap. And doing those swaps and swapping all the time, that's when, when my internet was bad. And I didn't know. I thought it was a reset. I didn't know what the fuck it was. But but this guy, Yuds, a friend of mine from Scotland, he knew. Uh, well, had a had a hint, hunch that that's going to be the problem. So what it was is turn off 5G, done. 4G only. So stability came, 25 megabits per second, which is what Maximilian due to himself you should have before he did his own fiber stuff. So quite happy with it. So the problem was, say, I will get like 40 megabits for upload and then down to nothingness and then back to 20. So that's what that was the router swapping around. And every time I did, it just fucked me over. Stream bit rate is really high. 75, which is higher than most streamers. I tried. It's a very visual sort of stream. So I got the information from, from Chooks in CRT and 4K. I was doing the recommended 6,000, but apparently it can go up. They say it can go up to uh, 8,000. I think 7,500 is fine. Give it, give a little bit for the audio. So I hope it looks good. It looks okay. It, it is a shame that I have to go blurry with the camera a tiny bit. Because uh, I'm, I'm looking to upgrade the camera. I need a GH5S. Uh, and that can go sharp with a low pass filter and uh, get rid of Mari. I'll show you once again. If I dare to go sharp here, pay attention to your screen. And you see those, this obviously, this is not a real person, so not here. So look at the, the TV, everything is getting very sharp, everything looks fantastic, but look at the Moiré. Unbearable. Uh, can't do that, so what I have to do with this here camera, so the GH5S, Lumix GH5S, S, 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 it, it has a low pass filter that doesn't eliminate at all, but is a thousand percent better. So I have to go out of focus. Now look here how blurry it's gonna get, right? Now to get, get rid of it completely, I know it's still there, but if I get rid of it completely, who wants to watch that? Not me. So it's a compromise here between a bit of more rate and a bit of sharpness. That's the dance that I do here every day. Good night, Spartan Stud. Good to see you here. Once again, thank you. And thank you, Piano Artist Gaming on, on YouTube for the tips. Yeah, remove the Moiré. I'd rather deal with a tiny bit of blurriness than the full blown Moiré. That's horrible. But I'm looking forward to get that camera, and there's going to be a grand old day once I do. It's going to be a lot better. Can't wait. Can't wait. Is it the upgrade I'm, wait, I'm waiting for the most? Anticipating. My mouth is watering just thinking about it. Thank y'all for the for the help. Uh, I heard Star Trap is just as good as this game, but the controls are improved. Uh, 
the feller Nitro Red said he didn't like it because um, is what made this game unique is the way it works. So he said it's kind of like uh, kind of like a lot of AAA games. They all try to copy each other and end up looking like the same fucking thing. Too many people. To me, this guy wearing a fucking cyber futuristic armor in an exotic planet with big monsters. I don't know. They all blend into me sometimes. Right on cue, uh, at around four, I noticed at around four hours, it's last time the same four hours, 20 minutes, my stomach is, begins to ache a tiny bit for, for, for a meal. So today, I got beef, as, as always, uh, but I chopped into tiny little bits, and I'm going to make a beef sandwich in a bit. So I'll, I'll just go make the sandwich, not now, in a bit. Put the break here for the whiners. People whining about shit. Should be in the chiz chatting category. How about you go to the gargle my ball sack category? Do they have one of those going there? You you make yourself at home. Mm. Strength of vape. I do my own vape liquid. I get the vegetable glycerin, propylene glycol, nicotine. I bought a thousand dollars worth of nicotine is in the freezer i'll never i can't leave my entire life without running out of nicotine it was because they're talking about manning i got a, i was working at the time a good job okay job blue collar job for me it was better than the usual and i bought a shit ton of nicotine i say well fuck you government and they ended up not manning it uh but now i have nicotine for life so yeah i went nuts today well i, like, I buy in bulk <laughs> <laughs> it's in the freezer. No, it was before the sauce was even a thing. That's how long. You know, and that long ago, I think it's been eight years. And uh, I bought like, I don't know, ten bottles. I've been through one bottle so far. Uh, no, still some in the, in the fridge. One. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, I'm literally never going to, as long as that freezer is working and it doesn't spoil, I'm going to have nicotine for life. So, you... Believe it or not, I, I eyeball everything, just like when I'm cooking. I know it sounds dangerous, right? Well, but here I am alive talking to you, so I'm doing something right. So what I do is, um, in one of those uh, 30 ml bottles, three squeezes. That's what works for me. More or less, more is bad, gives me heartburn. Less, it's tasteless, it doesn't work for me. So three, uh, the, 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 the drop thing, right? Three of them. You're free basing it? Yeah. It hits harsh. It hits, but I got a mighty throat. No, yeah, I did a, a, a look, I'm deeply invested on the on the thing. Now, I did buy salts one time for a mouse or lung, and it worked well, but I got all this nicotine here. What am I supposed to do with it? Gotta be like the, the guy on Family Guy. Got a surplus here with a flailing guy. <laughs> you wanna buy nicotine? I got, I got loads of it. Any idea? No, I have to measure it. It's like cooking. I cook very well. Yeah, but I, if you ask me what measurements, I don't know. I can pick the banjo. I can pick a few tunes. You know, I play. It's been broken for a while. If you t if you ask me what chord I'm playing, I have no I, I have no concept of what a chord is. I can play a whole tune. I read the tab. I memorize the tab, and I can play the whole tune. I can play Foggy Mountain Breakdown. But if you ask me what chord, I'm um, I don't know what key, so I'm a bit, a, bit of a weirdo <laughs> when it comes to measurements. Well, well, play piano, also play the okay, the, the Scottish bagpipes, the Great Highland Pipes, although again, I kind of <sighs> went lazy on it. It's been cold out there, you know. I gotta go back into it though. I used to play the bagpipes here, and it's middle of nowhere, but there's some farms here. And some folks used to drive up uh, up the road here uh, in a van, and they'll stop and, and see me from afar uh, playing, which I thought it was cool. But maybe they had a sniper rifle and they tried to get me, and I didn't see the bullets passing by, <laughs> whizzing by my head. <laughs> That's uh, half an hour of tuning, 10 minutes of playing, and over that thing. I did, uh, I did live in Scotland for five years, and I did have some lessons with a, a pipe tutor up in Wick, 
Leza Campbell, and it was great. Uh, and it, it got me to basics. You know, you start on the practice shanter, so you, you spend a long time on the practice shanter. And it's funny, what is it? I, I read tabs on, on, on a tablature on a banjo, but when it comes to the bagpipes, it's all musical notation. But if you put musical notation on the banjo, I wouldn't know what to do with it. I have no idea what that is. I don't know the concept of it. But on bagpipes, yes. And piano is nice. It's such a beautiful, it's such a beautiful instrument. You, you can go anywhere. Moonlight Sonata uh, is one of my favorite tunes of all time. Such a beautiful, sad tune, you know. And the backstory behind it, you know, Beethoven was uh, losing his ear, and and it's pretty impressive. I love the piano too. No, you know, Clint Eastwood can play piano, can he? I think he can. Another thing I find interesting is Frazier. Uh, Kelsey Grammer cannot play the the piano, but uh, Pierce can play the piano. Niles. He's actually a pretty accomplished piano player. 5% juice. It's probably going to be around that that area there, 5%, I think. Yeah, I only read music for the bagpipes, that's all. Because that's how I learn with it, you know? Piano's good. Strings on kids, yeah, it's very different. When I went, yeah, because it, it won't help you much when you go. Now, the banjo, I played a three finger style, the bluegrass, the one that most people associate. But there's claw hammer, there's Irish tanner banjo, there's a plectrum, Dixieland banjo, there's many different ones. There's a banjo guitar, which is not a banjo at all, come off it. That one at, oh, one time, some, some lady said, Can you play some Taylor Swift? See, what are you talking about? No, I cannot play Taylor Swift. I, I wouldn't even, even aware she played the banjo. And she doesn't, because I looked it up, and it's a banjo guitar, or gitcho, whatever. It's a, it's a guitar with a banjo head. It is not a banjo. It's just a guitar that sounds like a banjo. Uh, so there's no music for it. Believe it or not, you should be a point of contention online. Some folks are, how dare you, you're a gatekeeper. Yeah, they have that on a banjo community. Every community is all of this shit. You're a gatekeeper. Banjo tar is a valid banjo. Well, where's the music written for it? It's not. I'm happy you play it. That's fine. I'm not shitting on you playing the banjo tar, whatever you want to call it. But it's not, you know, it's not its own instrument. It's just a guitar with a banjo body. That's all. So it kind of it sounds cool, right? But there ain't no music written for it. It's not its own style of instrument. That's... So why are we even arguing that? That's just a fact. And facts don't care about your feelings. You know? Uh, it's a huge help for playing those kinds of instruments. It's fast bass. Blue get bluegrass member. Of the yeah, that's the one. Fiddle is awesome. I thought of, I thought of doing fiddle too. Bluegrass metal. I've looked at those things up. I'll leave the tab open here. That's for myself. Where's the troll today telling me I'm talking too much? Are you serious? No, I'm stained. I thought I was actually sweating here. Why is my shirt stained? It was the fucking deodorant. Piece of shit. I don't sweat. I'm not a big sweater. Okay. Quit talking so much. You know, I won't guard your ball sack. Or will I? <laughs> it's okay. Uh, I like, I like, it reminds me of Quagmire, said, hey, this too late is talking about, hey, I don't want to come in between it, or do I? <laughs> oh, no, that's terrible. <laughs> Who else but Quagmire? I like talking racks, fuck you, troll. Yeah, do my own thing here. Why all the talking? That's called a stream. I wouldn't do that to you, but imagine I just go, okay, and just come here and mute the, mute the mic and just stay here like this. Just play it again, look. It's, it's quiet around here. And look, there's a, there's a market for... Um, for quieter streamer, even streamers are quiet. There's a, there's a mark. A lot of times I look up no commentary videos.
but uh, yeah, I know about the break overlay, but it's, it's just not my style, you know, it's just everybody has their own style. Every, everybody loves their own brand, you know, it's the way it is. And I, I can only be me here, that's all. He's the boy dolphin. He's thanking us for saving him. Let's signal his mother. We'll never forget your kindness. Now, we must help you. Please follow me. Please follow me. I got that. I heard it the first time. It's all right. Okay. Ooh. It's automatic. Arcus doesn't really talk. Yeah, I mentioned that here. And look, a lot of people, I watch him. I'm actually surprised at all when I went there that it, he read my chat at all. I was under the impression that he would never be able to read anything. And why would he? And uh, he did, then he replied. And I found it amazing. I don't know how he does with so many fucking people in the chat. I, I got to get some of that, harness some of that power. Huh? But I don't have the view, so who gives a shit for now? You know, I can't manage now. I don't know what the future will have in store for me. But I really, I'm really impressed of how he's even able to mention anything. By the way, is he still in Seattle? <laughs> I, somebody told, I, I heard that he's still in Seattle. I heard no more PB airplanes. And I heard he brought the grow bags, I think. That's the word on the street. He reads the whole chat with it. Yeah, it's insane. I can't do it. No fucking way. Maybe if I really practice hard. I, I think, no, I don't. I don't think so. It's crazy. But he's doing speed runs and a lot of shit that I'll never do here. So for me, I think it's all right. You know, just stop and take it easy. It'll be my style of stream. I'll never be doing the things that it does. I don't have an interest in doing speed runs myself. I like not disrespecting it. I love reading about it, watching Summon and Salt, uh, watching Arches, watching Junkyard Dave, uh, Christine, all those people doing those amazing things. But for me personally, it's just not for me. Hey, I like I like football, but you're not going to see me going on a, on a pitch there with the NFL players. No thanks. They'll break me in half. No, no fucking way, man. Good luck. Thank you. So yeah, some things, just because I see something I like, it don't mean I want to try to do it. All I like to do is this fucking camera here, if you could go a tiny bit this way. There you go. That's it. You all right? There you go. So, it's a rack. Salamander says, the fact that you take the time to chat with us is a big deal. Well, thank you. I, I do try my best. And piano artist plays the piano too, wouldn't you know? There you go. Awesome. Watch hundreds of retro streamers. I'm really into that community. But this stream and your personality and style is one of my favorites so far. Well, thank you kindly for saying that. And I really mean it. That's, uh, that means a lot to me. To be honest, for the longest time, and by that I mean still now, uh, it's beyond me why anyone comes here and watches this and has an enjoyment out of it. For, for the longest time, I didn't understand the concept of streaming. Because I was mostly on YouTube. It's like, But then I, I, then I watched Maximilian Dude and Mike Matei. I like him. And I was like, well, this, this is fun, you know. So I kind of get it now a tiny bit. But at first I was like, mm, I, don't, I don't know. Why, why would I? I was, I was expecting nothing. I was expecting, why would anybody, anybody come here and watch me playing fucking games of all things? But there you have it. You awake and find subsea was wrecked in a storm. It's always strange to calm after a storm. There you go. Good life advice. It's a whole vibe. I love it. Well, I'm happy to have you here. Thank you. You forgot the heart. You let down Miracola. But it's been a cutscene, so I can't... So that heart is like Zelda's gone forever, man. Huh? Is it... Did I fuck up my playthrough by not getting that heart? There's no way... There's no chance of returning. Oh, jeepers. You go now. Well, thank you kindly, Princess Retro. I appreciate it. You're very kind. Well, I hope to see you here many times, many times in the future. It'll be good. You've been good to me. Thank you. 
Did it mess up or just miss a thing? Increase the max life. I hate that though. I should have gotten it somehow. It kind of sucks. I can go back to it. Yeah, the fucking thing is a rack, so that's that ship is sail. I'm not fucking going back in time for it, so I'll try to be more, pay more attention, I guess, and not losing anything. Thank you, Princess Retro. You're very kind. Please don't go broke yourself supporting my broken ass, all right? <laughs> Thank you kindly for it, though. I really appreciate it. Even though I lapped down a Miracola. No hamburgers. Well, we're gonna go ahead and uh, push on anyways. Right after I get more nicotine, sorry. Don't smoke, kids. I'm vaping, I'm smoking. It's nicotine, that's all that matters. That's how they get you. You work a lot. 500 little more towards your camera fund. Everything I make here, I it goes back into it. I got the last CRT I wanted, and now a uh, bank account, uh, anything, everything, every single dime, it has, I have to get that camera. So that's all I'm doing from here on out. But you never hear me bagging for it here. I'll mention because it's just something I need, but I'm not you know, telling people to fund me here on anything. Uh, but I appreciate when it comes my way, you know. It's, it's good. And I thank you kindly for it. Even though I missed the fucking heart. Where's the gameplay at? Somewhere else. Ooh, oh no, he didn't. Oh yes, he did. Oh no, he didn't. Oh yes, she did. No, Peter! I was there! She didn't do it! Alright, alright, Joe, calm down. <laughs> you ever seen that one? <laughs> Some family guy. For just a dollar a day, you can support a cowboy overseas. Well, there you go. <laughs> you know, I watch a, a very... I want to watch a movie that I've seen a long time ago. It was on TV. So there's this cowboy guy from... I think it's from Texas. And he goes to Malta, which is like an island nation in the Mediterranean. And he uh, he's there walking around with a cowboy hat. And <laughs> he's a cop. He's after a guy. And he's so out of place in there. It reminds me of me. Reminds me of me. It sound like an awesome powers. I allow myself to introduce myself. <laughs> hey, hey, Persian Air, how you doing? You will let up in the end. Thank you. I will save everything here. I don't spend your, your hard-earned cash to support me here with anything. Uh, uh, it goes back into the channel. A hundred percent. I don't, I'm not a very ambitious person. I don't have a lot of interest, to be honest. Retro gaming, I used to work on my truck a lot, my Dodge Ram. Let's go to this village here. Hmm. Maybe should, no, maybe should go look around for hard, see? But I, uh, I stopped many years ago to work on the truck. It got, it just got too damn expensive, and I was like, no. And then I moved on to, uh, you know, gaming. Now, mind you, like I said, uh, there will be sometimes it won't be retro gaming here. It'll be CRTs, but it'll be modern gaming. I would, I'll be doing modern gaming, too. And I know a lot of people are not into that content. Or if I go too retro, if I'm playing Atari 2600, I'm aware. But beware that I tend not to, I know it could be a fatal mistake and all that, blah, 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 yada, yada. But I tend not to care about the numbers and really be adamant about playing what I, I really want to play. Keep a variety, but not be locked to one thing. That's just something I want to be straightforward with anyone who signs up here. There will be modern games at, at times, not garbage for clout, no Fortnite, no Roblox, none of those things. That I, if I'm not into it, I'm not playing it. Uh, do I play bad games sometimes? Yeah, absolutely. I love uh, Predator on the NES. I, I like the game, actually, which is fucking horrible, but I like the game. I had fun. Cuphead. Yeah, Cuphead's a weird niche, though, because niche, because it's a... Uh, it's kind of retro, right? It's, it's, it's modern retro, but not. It's a very unique game. I definitely, I'll be buying physically on the Switch. Well, I'll talk to the guy first. Let me steal his stuff. You look tired. Here, drink some coconut milk. Oh, it recovers my health. End of time. Go to Miracola and find help for your rack ship. Okay. What if I touch this thing? Okay, it doesn't, doesn't do anything. Cuphead is a mofo, fuck that game. Read it hard. 
I heard about it. Yeah, I look forward to it though. I like a good challenge. I, and I, oh, but you're not you're not good. Well, doesn't that make the challenge better to have an average guy just going and trying to beat a game? I beat ghosts and goblins. Look, I did it one sitting. We've been through this shit before. I, I did it one sitting at home one time. Both loops, of course. We didn't. If you didn't beat both loops, you didn't beat ghosts and goblins. It's that simple. So you, you have to say forever. I beat the first loop. That's the way it goes. I don't make the rules. So, I beat Ghosts and Goblins in one sitting. It took me, took me a while, especially the second look at the last stage. The whole bullshit with the knife. And then I went to do on stream, and I, I tried to chase some kind of dragon with a strategy from, uh, you can be video games, and that fucked me up so hard. Uh, three streams. 24 hours in total. That was fucking horrific. But I beat the fucking game, though. And you know how I did? The minute I, I decided to give up on the bullshit cheese, cheese strategy for the two Satans, I beat the fucking game. First try, my own way. When I said, that's enough, I'm not doing the... <coughs> Just die already, old man. Or it belongs to you to young. Look, the minute I decided to drop that bullshit, the new crap, the cheesing the bosses, I, I beat the game. So, have trust yourself sometimes. Who made all your pixel art? It's good. Uh, it's me. I made all that. I used to make it. Later, if you have time, you go on YouTube and you go to my... I don't know, any of the very early... I think it was before I even streamed. Limbo. I have. I used to have intro animated intros. I took two fucking days or a whole full day, non -stop, full stop. Sorry, non-stop of working on the pixel art with Ace Bright. I used to do animated stuff. Gargoyles, uh, look, I'll link if anybody, because a lot of people don't. I understand it's kind of inconvenient. Let's see here. Ba -ba 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 -da, I'll show you. Allow me to show you to you. Get the bed. Give me a second here. I'm going to throw, throw something y'all's way, because it's very quick. They're, they're brief, because it's... You know, it takes forever to fucking animate those things. But I used to... <clears throat> Look, if you're doing YouTube, you got to put a lot of flair on your stuff. Streaming is different, just purely streaming. Give me a second here. We'll, we'll, we'll face the dungeon. In a very brief moment. I'm looking for something here. I had to stop doing it because it was unrealistic to do those things and stream every day or a lot of, a lot of, you know, many days of the week. It's just not possible to, to do it. It's just not. So I had to give up in order to do more content. Uh, here, Pitfall, Resident Evil. So yeah, I did, I did enter on Resident Evil. So I would do like CRT little, little jokes. Uh, I don't know, here's the Mario one. Let me give you give this one. Right? Was there an intro for that? Let me just see. Yeah, there was. Okay. So... I hate that I have to press enter. I don't want to press enter. There you go. The very beginning of the video. So I had many videos. Tracks here. I feel like... I'll hear the song in my head forever, or you will. Absolutely. Uh, NES films have a thing that's staying in your fucking head. And they do. Some some of the some of the time sometimes it's good, but sometimes it's pretty damn bad. I had the predator tune in my mind for a long time. Edit? No, I don't want to edit anything. And there's another one. If y'all want to check uh, those... Sometime. So, uh, it's very short. So, I used to have an outro as well. So, pixel art. Uh, yeah, that's about it. I think just go all the way back to the history you find it. So, I don't do them any anymore. But yeah, I do my own pixel art. That's the whole bullet point of this presentation, isn't it? All right, let's uh, face the Le Dungeon. Mario Underground thing. Yep. Yeah. 
<clears throat> Good stuff. Got some kind of crazy bird thing here. Blue alien chicken. Here's another another game that I, I could never pass the first fucking boss, but I really want to play Alfred the Chicken on the NES. I really like that game. Need to, need to play me some of that. But I need to educate myself a little better because I couldn't get past the... What the hell is this? Couldn't get past the uh, first boss, really. Try it real hard and it didn't, didn't work. Star Tropics, hi there, Tracks here. You had a round shooter for Ghosts and Goblins Star. Yeah, that's right. I mentioned that a lot. Yeah, but it's like, you know, just let folks know, you know, uh, I, I can play tough games too. I don't shy away from a challenge. Come on. What if we, what if we do this thing here? Let's test it. <laughs> test it! <laughs> oh. Oh. Ooh! Ah, oh, you fuck. All right, enough of that. Now, save that for the bosses. There we go. Lost some health, though. Super hard as a... Did I heard about this. It's gonna be hard. Love to go back and play as an adult. You should. I, 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 I got sold on the... Uh, I'm playing now with the Nitro Reds video. Is here, they're gonna try to fuck me up. You die, sir. Got him. Is there any sort of secrets that he walk about and son it gets revealed? I, I don't reckon it's fine. Oh, I, I remember seeing this part with that nitro red. Ah! Okay. Damn it! Shit. The other one is not moving. Step on the things here. Ah! No! Why did I walk to the left? Why? What? Compelling force drove you to do that, you dumb idiot. Mm. Fuck that there for no reason. It's all right. We're getting the getting the lay of the land here. We'll we'll get there someday. Oh yeah, in this game here, I'm not concerned about one stream only beating me. It has a save, so who cares? I'll, I'll, I'll happen to come here tomorrow and play more if. Uh, now, by the end of the stream, I don't beat it, which I don't think I will. So I'm looking at more than one stream on this one here for sure. I don't, I'm not in a hurry here for things. You know, so if a game takes more than one stream, if a game takes a week, that's fine with me. The jumping mechanic, yeah, the, the feller, uh, Nitro Red, he said the second one he didn't like it because it was pretty much like everything else at the time. So he liked the fact that it was quite unique, this one here. It's like it has his own identity. Yeah, my stomach is growling. Growling here is making a lot of unholy sounds. So soon I'm gonna have to go get get me a beef sandwich. Yeah. Come on. There you go. Hey, we got a heart. That's good. Oh yeah, it's a flashcard. With around, yeah. I uh, do nothing but flashcards for the most part. Flashcards, OD, ODs, all, all my assistants, for instance, retro are uh, modded to the limit usually. This one is stock, but yeah, there's an ever uh, an ever drive in there, and I actually have a lot of problems. Wouldn't you know? I've never had a problem running any game on the ever drive in April. This was one of them. I had to download it three times, and that was a lot of fun because the contact pins on my console here are pretty bad right now. 
Uh, so every time I had to remove the SD card, I had to I had to stay half an hour here fiddling, jiggling the cartridge. It was hell. It was fucking hell, and I couldn't believe that. Of all games, and I I tried a gazillion games, and only Star Tropics was giving me a problem. Say, how the fuck does the damn thing know that that's the fucking game I chose to, to play next? It's like it knew. No other game had any problem running. Everything, rum hacks, out the ass, everything working. Star Tropics would not work. I had to go and, and find an archive.org, no interest set, uh, and then it worked. Uh, I was looking at buying that cartridge, so, uh, but yeah, I didn't have to. True Pirate of the High Seas, yeah, except for modern stuff, I don't pirate modern things uh, to support an industry as crooked as in, as much as they shit, take a dump on my fucking chest, uh, I get, but physical only, so I have a, a number of, so if I want to play a game on a PS5 or, 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 or Switch, I'll buy it, even, I buy it, so I don't, I don't play it, I don't think I play modern games enough to, to justify read a pirate in them, I have pirated games to, to try them first. That was the case with Resident Evil 2 Remake. Come on. Because uh, I shot piracy, it leads to more piracy. Well, not, not exactly. So, I, first time, I wanted to try and I pirated the uh, PC version of uh, Resident Evil 2 Remake. And now I have the game physically. I bought it, my wife played it, she loved it, and I'll be playing it too. But old stuff, me going on eBay to pay two, three hundred dollars for a, a, a copy of Silent Hill that might rot two, you know, a few years later, no thank you. If you can, I'm happy for you. I get nothing but respect for people to collect real you know, real games and whatnot, they have shelves. But for me, I just, I wouldn't be able, I would, if that was the case, if I had literally buy every old game that I play here, I would probably go down, uh, go the, the Mr. FPGA route, which is a, a very good route, uh, road to go down to. About 10, maybe 20. I do have a few games, though. I do have some retro games. You know, I, I buy a few of them. Yeah, I got 80 of them. This is retro. Steam is the only digital solution. And even the, um, is, they're, they're, for me, I would say they're, they're tolerable because they do have the REM and a lot of bullshit. Uh, they did bully their way into the PC game in a tiny bit. I mean, as a modder that works, and I love Steam, I have Steam. I don't have a gazillion games in there, but I, I, I haven't used them much lately, that one stream. But I think as a very good model, I think they did a very, very successful. So let's face it, physical on PC is dead, and it's going to be dead on consoles too in all time. That's, they're working hard against it, and, and when it does, unfortunately for me, uh, I'm, I'm out. I'm not going to buy a console that has digital only. I'm not going to get into Game Pass. Game pack, pass. I don't. I don't care about the value. I don't care about those things. I'm pretty stubborn, and I'm not. In, I'm not interested in recurring costs. I'm not interested in subscriptions. I never have streaming services ever. Not even once. So y'all know. I don't. I'm not into it. You know. That's all. Did you check? No. Uh. Did you send to me on Discord? Salamander. Now we go up here. Did I check everything? I think I did. Oh, it's time. Okay. Ooh, my stomach is really loud now. I, I have to eat in, in a bit here. Okay. Going up, huh? Do look. I think this is a good time as any. I'm. I need to go to the kitchen. It's been. It's gonna be five hours, so I think that's fair, right? Uh, I need to. I. I. It's all dice. I'm gonna go in there. I'm gonna bring back a beef sandwich, and I'm gonna eat a beef sandwich. Okay. Um, nothing fancy, but uh, Feller has got to eat. You know, I gotta eat. I'm. I'm my stomach here. I could go home and my stomach goes like and it gets tough, you know? So I'm gonna I'm gonna go get my food, prepare my food, get off my butt here a tiny bit. And I'm not gonna leave you hanging here. Let me see. Do, do I have the background music? Yeah, I'll leave you all some music at least here. Um Yeah, that's not that's not gonna burn in. Is it 
Some fucking static. There you go. At least that's not going to burn anything in. Uh, I'm going to be right back. Okay. I'll put the on br the brake thing here. If y'all, and for whoever has to leave, I uh, I understand completely, and I wish you a good night. Uh, I'll be back in like uh, very soon. So I'm just going to eat here, anyways. I'm going to take a leak, make a sandwich. I have coke here, so that's all. Okay. Uh, and I'll put some. What about the music here? Is that working? Wait a minute, let me see, let me see with the music here, I'll, I'll turn off the, I'll leave the microphone on and pick it up the music, I think, just, cause otherwise it's echoey, it's kind of weird, so just have, uh, wait, monitor, okay, So let me know, is the music coming through there? Some pleasant, really nice music. This one is better. I like this one a little better. Can y'all hear the music okay? Oh wait, shit. Uh, driver genius, okay. Let's pause anyways. Yeah, all right, I'll leave the music on here. And I'm gonna go on and uh, get my sandwich. I'll be right back. Break over it, asshole. There you go. I think that about covers it. Pixel art intros, so good. Oh, you enjoyed it? Oh, thank you kindly. Yeah, a lot of work to do those, a lot of work. An immense amount of work. I miss it though, to be honest, a tiny bit. I'll thank you for the compliment. All right, beef sandwich time. I'll be right back. Mods, uh, throw show up. Give them the boot. You know what to do. I'll be right back. Mm -hmm. Leave my damn cigarette here. I, I, I need my vape everywhere. What are you on about?
with that check hammer. All right. <laughs> Don't boot me. Thank you for following Landhorn. All right, so what we got here is a modest piece of cheese, cheddar. Should have really, could have used a tray here, right? The fuck am I to do now? Use my can of tobacco, I guess. All right. So I'm gonna be eating here. So we got some, uh, so just mustard mayo, some American cheese, and some maters, and then a uh, Toaster bread. Now I'm gonna be bummed out. I couldn't get the uh, green chili. There's a spicy green chili somewhere in the fridge. I can find anything in that fucking fridge. So I'm just gonna go ahead and watch a, a man eat a sandwich because that's what I need to do. I'm out of the season cheese on the smaller side. Now usually I'm, I mute my mic here, but I just realized that if I do, you lose the music. So I'm trying to, I don't want to make any gross sounds of chewing here. I'll try my best to distance myself from the microphone, I guess. Around here. I think it might be disturbing. Let me know if it is, by God. I just want to eat. I might fit Call a paper for the mustache troubles. All right, then. Commence the, the eating. Thank you. Some tough beef, but, you know, it does the... I don't care. Cheap beef is better than no beef, you know? And I love me some garlic, so I added some garlic powder, too. It's good stuff. I like raw garlic, though. You should take a bite. Oh, you love it. It tastes damn good. Sometimes less is more, you know? I, I make some elaborate sandwich sometimes, but this one here, it just tastes good. This good. Mm-hmm. Hit the spot magically. I'll give you back the share and the scaring. back to the game some of y'all might be new here I stream for usually long periods of time for me five hours is nothing so there's much more more to see here Eat the plane. I think I'm miscalculated. I mean, like, like not, not having a liquid, right? I have this bottle of Coke here, but when I'm eating, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go get a cup. I don't like to eat and then drink out of the bottle. It's kind of nasty, I don't know. Even though I'm the only one drinking out of it. I'm gonna get a cup here, I'm gonna have a cup. Very fancy glass. That would do. It's clean. 
and washed and disinfected and all that. Don't want no flow? Gross. <laughs> Backwash, you know? Yeah, I don't eat and drink out of the bottle. It's disgusting. I don't want to do it. Matter of fact, keep this, this jar here, though. Come in handy. Miss your wish. Oh. <laughs> Shit. Floaties, that sounds so gross. A lot of beef in here. Good. We have a culture barbecue in the south. You know who wins for me? Your princess rat will love it. Texas. I love te Texas barbecue. None of that. Look, I like our pork and our stuff too. But. A dry rub in beef being the main thing. Don't need no sauce, you know? I love beef. I'm, be I'm a beef man up in here. The barbecue is Texas for me all day. Sorry, Mississippi. Boy, well, Mississippi barbecue is awesome. But it's the beef that gets me, because I'm just obsessed with beef, you know? And I love pork, don't get me wrong. But for me, beef is just it's a step above everything else. The only thing that can come close to challenging that for me is from pork is bacon. Because bacon is fucking bacon, right? Let's face it. Moist brisket, awesome. Shout out, man, your mom is from Texas. Oh, so she move up there. Oh, let me tell you, this here, this will do just fine. Mm. This life as a mater here is what brings the whole thing together. And I just, I almost didn't do it. It's like, hey, do I want to fucking die as a mater right now? I say, yeah, let's go a step above it. I almost put some lattice here, but I don't know, you're getting too fancy. I'll just make it a bit more plain. And uh, man, it worked out. Yeah, and please let me know. I hope there's no gross sounds coming out here on a, on a microphone. I usually have the microphone muted, but I kind of fucked up because uh, the music is coming through the microphone. So if I turn off, turn it off, it'd be just silence, right? <laughs> Now, Mater's, where's that? I love Mater's. Good. You wanna know the best sandwich on earth for me? My wife makes it for me quite regularly. Elvis. People have their different ways of doing it. I'm almost done with the sandwich, am I? Here, stay right here. Uh, I like mine this way. Two pieces uh, of uh, sliced white bread, 
white bread. Ain't gonna fucking hold meal shit because they're gonna soak in the fucking lard. It's coming. So, lard on a pan, deep fry, deep fry now. Fry that bread in there. Let it soak up. Yeah, soak up the lard. If you have bacon grease, it's even better, but lard will do. Fry that bread once. Now, flatter a bunch of peanut butter, smooth, uh, a ripe banana, and now fry yourself three, four rashes of bacon, nice and crispy, put in your sandwich, close your sandwich, and uh, now put some, a bit more lard on the pan, and then fry it again and squash it a bit. You won't regret that sandwich, it is excellent. <laughs> yeah, for me, there's no replacement for lard. I like healthy stuff too, but not always. And if you if you skip on the lard, you go soft on it. It's just not it's just not the same, the Elvis. Cheers. So now you can say you've been to a stream and you watch a cowboy man eating a beef sandwich. There you go. It's the first time for everyone. Did you enjoy any of that? The excitement, you say? Mm. Good stuff. It's done. The Sanders, Sanders, the cowboy man. <laughs> yeah, because it'd be a kind of redundant, right? I get it. Cowboy girl. It's a cowgirl. <laughs> Yeah, if you follow what I, I'm saying here, sometimes it's just a bunch of crap. I cow, just cowboy would have sufficed. Thank you. You're fucking embellishing the, the words here. Beef sandwich. Good stuff. I recommend it. <clears throat> 10 out of 10. I'm going to have my celebratory smoke after a meal. And then we... Uh, we hit that uh, Star Tropics, my good sir. It's, cow it's cowper. We prefer cow people kind. <laughs> hmm. How you doing, Persian air? All it refers to the sexual position. Yeah. Well, leave it unlearning. There you go. Thanks, Chief. I'm trying not to burp loud here, okay? Drinking a lot of coke here. I don't fucking rush. I need a vape. I need a vape. I don't like call it. It's smoke. It's the same shit. Uh, I need to do this after. And then I got my smokeless, and then we head on out. I don't think I need... Do I need to bring this? No, I don't need to bring this. Just put this on top of this VGA monitor here. We'll do. That's fine. Check what's on the other channels here. Different types of statics. So I got that. 
darker one. Don't matter. See, right now I don't have to pay attention to what's going out there because the workers are in. This one is kind of crazy. I can put it here back here. It's a quick smoke for me and we'll head on back. I told you that. Keep up. Keep up with that information here. Scramble for it. You got some fucking opera or some shit here the other day on the, my Japanese set because it picks up the radio sometimes. But I remember the good old days of scramble porn, trying to trying to get a glimpse of a nipple or two, you know. <laughs> good shit. Those are the good. Everybody did that, I think. I know I did. I like this track, and this here's White Bat Audio on YouTube. So check him out if you like this type of music. And if you don't, no refunds. It's free, anyways. Maybe it was C3. You never know. Wasn't that Chandler from, I uh, can't believe his dad had a guy, the actor. Ch Chandler from Friends had a third nipple. It was a big, it was a big revelation. Someone's ass. I'm not sure if male or female. Hey, it worked well what he had now. <laughs> Supposed to use your imagination there, Mr. Pycelle. That's it. Mad Marky. Hey, CRT Rex. Great looking CRTs. Oh, thank you. Try to keep a variety here of tubes, you know? Never get you, you kids who bored out there. Yeah, so, uh... <clears throat> I repeat CRT sometimes. I'm liable to repeat them, but, you know... Of, of course, in the long run, I'm, I'm talking about repeating more than one day. So, I'll probably play more of this tomorrow, obviously. It's got to save. Not really concerned with the speed here, to be honest. And then... And then after I'm done with this game, I'll probably, for the sake of variety, I'll get another console here. I've, 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 my cables for the NES were lost for a while. It's kind of shit. But uh, now that I found them, it's probably going to be, there's always, look, I'm a bit biased towards some consoles, and the NES is one of them. Even though it's been two fucking months since I played last time, I couldn't find the fucking cables. Want to play many times, I couldn't find the damn things. All right, Charlie Daniels, smoker or non-smoker? Smokeless. Charlie Daniels used to have some uh, dip commercials, you know? <laughs> so I'm getting my smokeless thing, but I make it here at home. It ain't no tobacco. You won't believe what it is, but it gets the job done for my smokeless needs. Sort of like snooze. Oh, this this track here is laps. I like that. I like that shit. All right, cowboy man. <laughs> Let's head on back to the world of Star Tropics. Beautifully, beautifully done. That sandwich hit the spot like there was no tomorrow. Oh yeah, my Luigi time. All the time. Where's my gloves? There we go. You're gonna drop this mason jar. Put it down here. Set on back. Let's play some games. Satanic music is the music of the devil. Yeah, so it reminds me of my aunt. I had an aunt who was a Jehovah Witness obsessed with that shit and that's how everything was satanic. I was like, you're satanic. She beat me beat me senseless. I did tell her, you're satanic. Yeah, she didn't like that. <laughs> I don't think Satan plays music. I'm just going, I don't. I don't think they have musical instruments, so I never got the the thing of satanic music. Cause I like some heavy metal here and there, like thrash metal and shit. And there's satanic music. Even people that I like tell me seriously, isn't that the music of Satan? So I don't know, man. I I I haven't I haven't been through a Satan Spotify list, so I'm not sure it might be. I don't know. You tell me. You've been talking to him lately. I don't know what goes on with his musical taste, but, you know. <laughs> I 
make no mistake, I'm a country guy. I like country. I like bluegrass. Uh, but I have other tastes, some weird tastes. I like Celtic music. I like uh, some heavy metal. Heavy. I'm talking heavy. I like some Iron Maiden. I like some Metallica. Uh, I like I like Irish traditional music. I like bagpipes. Um, I like traditional, like uh, classic, some classical music. Uh, piano. It's nice. We we're talking about that earlier. <sighs> Sorry, I got, got a blow. I uh, I like Japanese and Chinese tra traditional music. I think it sounds amazing. A lot of instruments. I like the Chinese Da San Shan and uh, the Japanese Shamisen and the Okinawan Sanshin. They're all derived from the Sanshuan from China. A lot of instruments are like Erhu. Uh, some I don't know the name or forget. The national instrument of Japan is beautiful. The Koto? What is it called? Damn it. Forgot the fucking name. Beastie Boys? Eh, eh, no, not much. Alice in Chains. I think uh, Van Halen's alright. Metallica. I don't know much about it. Judas Priest, I'm not a big fan of it. So, like, uh, I'm not well versed on what goes on. What I'm trying to say. Like, when I was a kid, I had a, well, kid my ass, I was working around it. When I was a teenager, I had a disc man. I had a Walkman before that. I had a disc man, and I had, I bought a Metallica. I bought a Sand Anger album. A lot of people don't like I liked it. I thought it was all right. <coughs> I'm sorry. And I had uh, Iron Maiden, Edward the Great. I had Sepultura, and I got into that. But past that, I don't know my Judas Priest. So I have to look that up, to be honest. Uh, Ozzy Osbourne, I like uh, I Am Iron Man, uh, Black Sabbath is good, Pantera is good, I like Pantera, some of those I know, Motley Crue, uh, what's the other one, Ace of Spades, is that Motorhead, Ace of Spades is Motorhead, right, the Ace of Spades, the Ace of Spades, yes, because uh, I like that, Beastie Boys, I don't know, is that older, I have to look him up, I know about the Beastie Boys, I'm, I'm just saying that I, I, I'm not as, I haven't spent a long time here listening to their music, off screen was sweet. Yeah. Motorhead, yeah, I like that. I like that guy. Yeah, his dad too passed away. Fucking love that shit. Every now and then I have a drink at night. Uh, it's been a while, but uh that's the kind of music I but I will go, you know, on the belt for whom the bell the bell tolls, and I go fucking orgasmatron and fucking Sepultura and then I go Iron Maiden and then then all of a sudden I'm listening to fucking uh, fucking Hank Williams Senior, <clears throat> Johnny Cash, uh, you know, uh Conway Tweedy. Then for the more modern shit, I don't know about modern country. I don't listen to that. Sorry. But I, I know like Alan Jackson. I know and I fucking listen to him. You should have all his old but I used to be in a Garth Brooks, but then. Um, yeah, and then some unknown people, you know. Trace Atkins is cool. You know, I know a lot of bluegrass, Earl Scruggs, Flatten Scruggs. And, and yeah, re rest in peace, Lammy. Guns N' Roses, not into it. Not into Guns N' Roses, sorry. Or, in fact, I'm annoyed by it. I know they're a great band, but they overplay. Is that Guns N' Roses? Would that be the um, Sweet Child of Mine? I, I never want to hear Sweet Child of Mine ever again. I, I, that, I have a thing with tunes that are overplayed in my head that it was it's, it's borderline torture to me. Walk and talk here. <clears throat> and there's uh, some tunes that are great, but they just... Uh, I think they were so overplayed that they... I don't know, man. I... <laughs> Just not into it, huh? Punch them on time. What about an Elton John album? I'm respectful of other people's faces, you know? He has some good tunes on Nikita, right? It's a good, it's a good tune. Uh, he, 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 can, he can sing well. You know, he's a good, uh, he's a good singer. Do you like Madonna? Mm, I like her early work. Who knows if the family guy, <laughs> Joe. Even she had a couple of tracks. Oh, that's that's all right, you know. <clears throat> I don't want to hear to like labels like, oh, what? Well, I'm wearing a cowboy hat here. I gotta only listen to country music. There's only two types of music around here: country and western. <laughs> Why does that does that joke get old? <laughs> still funny. No, it does. I guess it doesn't get old. It's still kind of funny to me. 
When I live that way, I say like saying that a lot. Whenever you say like you like some other different type of music, I don't. Uh, uh. Better performance here. I like it. Uh, welcome to the. I know. Ooh, I'm gonna watch you bleed. <laughs> It's been played a few times, right? It's enough already. I used to work in a lot of warehouses and they had a fucking radio with a pop music. I can't stand that shit. Repeating and repeats and repeat. Three fucking years later, the same fucking tunes are still repeating somehow. Not a big fan of mindless repetition, you know? Into my umbrella, e e e e e. Into my umbrella. Oh, no. Oh. Funky town. It's, 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 shut up already. You're raping my fucking ear hole, you piece of shit. Come on. There you go. Okay, gotta be careful here. You, you done goof the first time? Get him. Oh! Get him to come here and then hit him from here. That's it. The honest, sane choice. There you go. I know I sometimes I get so panicky here and don't do things the right way. It, it's such a simple concept here. Lower him in and then hit him. Done. What's the problem here? Chips is your Philistine. Uh. Uh, probably, yes. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not very well known for my taste in cultural matters. I would say, Chips. But look, it could be anything. I don't know, man. I love. Uh, I don't. Know, I, I'm so lo lonesome. I could cry. But if you play that shit in my ear for fucking 24 hours a day while I'm at, at work, I'm already grumpy because I gotta do all that bullshit. Be in a dusty, cold ass warehouse, and you're playing. I'm so lonesome I could cry, or whatever the fuck it is. Hey, good looking, right? Tunes I like, but if they play to death, I, I guess what? I, I don't want to. I don't like them anymore. You know, such thing as moderation, my good sir. <laughs> Rihanna, is that who? who they just, uh, yeah. Ah! Nearly jumped there. Panic in here. Yeah, I don't hate her or anything. I just don't wanna. I don't wanna hear it. I don't hate you. I just don't wanna hear you. <laughs> that sounds hateful. Okay, let me. Yeah, shocker. I don't. I you know I don't like everything. Okay, let's go. Go, go. Yeah. Yeah. Look at those things. Oh. Okay, get. Ah, I remember. Attract him here. First, take care of it. No, no, no. Get off me. Oh! Lord, I mean, no, you want to be on the other side. Well, that fucking went. Yeah, I panicked and everything was bad. There's an upside down cross in there. I always wonder, Rex, are those compression gloves? What are compression gloves? And then I tell her, they're probably not that. I watched a lot of wrestling back in the day, a long time ago. My favorite should be the Big Boss Man, but I like Hulk Hogan too. A lot of the old stuff. I don't like the new stuff. I don't watch that. It looks like everyone is just wearing underwear. I like the, I like time. You remember the Super Mario Bros? Uh, Super Mario Super Show? And all the wrestlers will come in. And they all have their personas and costumes. I, I like that time, that period of time. <clears throat> I don't like I don't like the new generics. I, I think everything nowadays is kind of bland. It's like they go make a remake. Man, we're not gonna put this cheesy line. No way. Why not? Why not? Like people have to be surprised on the Resident Evil 4 remake, which I love. I want to play it. But I'm saying like they had. Oh, they really put the bingo. They're not gonna do the suplex. Why do they do that? Why take a little bit of joy, of che cheesy joy that we have, you know? Come on, come on, man, quick. Does that disappear? 
you know, or, or, or like a song or something. You know, if it was good then, it's good now. What's the problem? To keep a healthy blood flow to the extremities. Oh, that's what that is. Uh, they're not. I I do have arthritis in my hands. I got di a diagnosed. A doctor told me when I was 28 I had arthritis. I asked him, can I still play the banjo or the bagpipe? He said, yeah. And I asked my family, it turns out there's a history of arthritis. Uh, I do have kind of bad circulation, but I never, I heard, I think I heard of them types of gloves. I, I just never use them. No, they're just gloves I got on, e on eBay. I got a bag of them, and it, the idea was just not to be touching my controllers. And then, like I said, see, even if you don't wear gloves here, how much the hands really reflect on the CRT. So that double is that as well for me. I'm sorry, it's all right, it's, it bothers me sometimes. It's been, it's been bothering me lately a tiny bit more. It's more on the right hand. It's, it's not the end of the world, at least not for now. You know, let's see how, how it plays out. I did ask my family and they said it's not the, the one that distorts your, like makes everything crooked, crooked, like the your, your fingers and whatnot. And uh, I hope they're right, they say that like my aunt has it, my mom has it, I think, and they just say it just hurts. And but I did, I did lose some. Like I can't, I can go past this here. So I, this here is fine. But here, this is if I force it, this it hurts like a son of a bitch. And lately, I've been feeling more on this finger. Sorry, on my pinky. Uh, and here, here not so much. And it depends on the on the weather. It, it kind of flares up and it hurts the joints a bit. Rheumatoid. I hope I don't have that one. But it's all right, you know. It's, I, I just want to be able to play video games and use my fingers for for other things here, Un, unspeakable things. Okay. I gotta. How come I'm? Why is my health all fucked up already? I don't understand. I'm not even talking about real life. I'm talking about the game here. How come I have only two hearts? Who hurt me? I don't get it. <clears throat> yeah, I think it's weird they said it's just pain, but if it's just pain, how come I can I can close, like, you know, bend my finger the whole way then? So probably you see me here in 10 years, I'll be like, ah! I don't know. Can I do a VR or something? Guitars and Cadillacs, I love that tune, man. Guitars and Cadillacs, and anything. He'll be leaving music. It's the only thing that keeps me hanging on. And then I got a few. And he played on Terminator, that's right. I love that tune so much, man. I love Dwight Yoakin. He's one of my favorites. I love his, his work. <laughs> Dwight Yoakam. You know, he makes uh, biscuits. Bakersfield, out of Bakersfield. And buy me some of them. Some gravy, gravy up in here. Doll, that's right. And he, he worked, he worked on his sling blade. And he goes, the famous line, you motherfuckers, y'all just a bunch of losers. I'm the only saying some bitch here. Just get the fuck out of my house now. You fucking practice, Randy. Randy, you tuning son of a bitch. Come on, Morris, you fucking genius. <laughs> he played he played a mean actor in that movie. I love that movie. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Mm. Gotta be quick here. Nope, nope, no! Oh. Okay, the special fuckers here, quick. Now, now. Okay, keep them on one side. No, don't. Keep the use the, use the power. Nintendo power. Oh. Ah. Ah, there's that little stop. Get the fuck out, Johnson. Nobody wants to take this shit, man. 
That's no good on paper. You don't sing them anyways. You're just showing your true Irish collars now. Stay out of my fucking face, you fucking buzzard. <laughs> no, it's not. I don't want to jump. My God, what am I doing? I'm forgetting the button. Dude, no. That, 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 that tears it. Come on, bitch. One more. Die already! Me! Like Rex, my, my dad had a rheumatoid, rheumatoid arthritis. I suck at pronouncing things. Uh, I hope it, uh, I hope it's not that, to be honest. Sweet child of mine. <laughs> so this here is kind of satanic. Feller's talking about satanic, or look at that. Upside down cross. The evidence is piling up of satanism. <clears throat> How that Trota came here on time? I'm a satanist. Like, who told you I gave two shits about that? Oh no, there goes my sleep. Y'all man, what you do is your own business. What other joys I have here? Bundles of joy. No, nope, no magic items here. It's gonna get tough here a tiny bit. Oh shit. So according to, oh. Oh, that's gonna be fucked. So you gotta kinda memorize, and I'm memorizing it poorly. Holy shit, it's kinda, yeah, it's kinda bird. So go, go back to the beginning of, beginning of the fucking dungeon here. Can you stop losing hell? The fucking beginning here, not got the whole fucking dungeon ahead. You know, getting fucked here already. Those fucking blue things. Come on, a fucking inconvenient angle here, let me tell you. Yeah? All right. I barely started here, two hearts already. It takes a while getting used to you not being able to jump forward, but there's no need to, but it's just, like I said, you gotta, one thing I like about that Nitro Red, even though I don't follow to the T what he says, but he says that a lot of people fight in the controls of a game and you just gotta sort of adapt to the rules and make yourself at home, you know? <laughs> not complaining and fighting the whole time, which is something I, to be honest, I often do here. You pick the fucking game, that's the controls of the game, get used to it. Adapt. Coward. Got him. Oh man. Oh boy, oh boy, oh man, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Oh man, out of control. He lives in control. He lives in control! No, 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 dude, come on! We're about to die. We're both gonna die, Jill. Why don't you use your powers? Kind of. Well, maybe. Maybe moderation would kind of be, a, would be wise. You disappoint me, Katana. Not very wise. I just want to lure him here, but I don't want to get hit. I don't want to get hit. How do I not get hit here? I did it one time. Remember? Now, those are the good old days. Uh, okay, I need to amp up the the, the FB like this here, because I'm sucking mate I'm sucking a big bag of elephant dicks here. It's too much. Nearly got hit again. What are you doing, son? There you go. Alright. We got no jar of preserves here no more. Okay, this is a make or break. Gotcha. 
They like to jump on top of your head. That's what that is. Gotcha. Hmm. Maybe I'm missing out on secrets here. I need it! Come to me, my children. Gotcha. Eh, maybe he's up on it, huh? Come on, bitch. Come on, bitch. Come on, bitch. Come on, bitch. Bitch ass bitch. Come on, bitch. Come on, bitch. What's up? Got him. Okay, what is the problem here? I'm trying to identify what the problem is. How would I not get a hit here? Right? Go quick? <sighs> no. Die for your insulin slow. Dare to touch the, the walking master. <clears throat> Sure could use a jar of preserves here. No! Was there something in there? Okay, they do give you full health here. Come on, come on. Okay. Okay, this here. The blue guy's first. Okay. Uh, you got a lot of a lot of those things here. Use them. Ideally, you want to hit them as they're about to jump. Right? But I think I'll eliminate one of them if I can. No. Okay. What is the star again? I, I think... I think tomorrow... Or today... I will educate myself a tiny bit on, on this here game that I'm playing. You know, as far as what the power-ups are... Or liable to make your uh, life a bit easier. You know? You can't jump in as soon as you get follows. Jump them? What do you mean, jump who? Who am I jumping here? I'm trying to understand what he said here, Master Pycelle. Jump in. Oh, that tastes like fucking a ball up piece of toilet paper. Sometimes you get them dry hits, you know. And wouldn't you say, I bought this fucking brand new fucking cigarette. It's already problematic. Are you charging? Look at that. I, I bought a new one and it's the same fucking goddamn problem. Unbelievable. And jump as soon as we get. Oh, okay. Jump them. Oh, gotcha, gotcha. And I remember, I think, from Nitro Reds video. So I gotta memorize this shit here. I need to give the fucking bats. Isn't that the same spot? Was it here? Damn it! How the fuck was it? Now shut up, you old bitch. Damn it. Fuck you doing? Don't despair. You tell me, bitch. Kind of despairing a tiny bit here. Tiny bit of despair. It's called reality. Oh. Oh. Hey. Just gotta be more careful getting hit, I think. Just. Yeah. I hate you. Gotcha. Come down here. It's okay. I'm gonna try to jump the. Every fifth counts. I really. They probably gotta memorize the fucking room when the bats come. 
I want a fucking bat. Every game with a fucking bat. No. What the fuck y'all doing? Ah. Oh. No! I knew it! The prick! Fucking prick. Ooh. I'm spitting here again. Oh, like I got rabies or something. Come on, bitch. I know you want to come up here. Oh, gotcha. They charge you after after a while. Hmm. Oh, the bolo. No. Bonanza time, bitches. Start talking. Or start eating a trash can. Okay, uh, I'm gonna give you some good old yo-yo medicine here. Mm-hmm. Oh. No. Oh, come on, go home then. Go home. She isn't here. She isn't here. She isn't here. Go home then. Okay, I'll try to do the, the jump thing. Aha! Now you're working smart, Peter. Oh, oh ho! Hey, hey! Yeah, the flying monkeys are fucking annoying as fuck, man. Holy shit! Just checking everything. I'm gonna shoot the messenger. And the next time I don't have to check it, I think. And that's it. All right. Please don't fuck up here. go. Oh, this shit. Kill him, kill him, kill him. Quick. Let him go for a round. There we go. Uh, ball. Ah. God, they're freaky. No. Oh, my God. They're bastard. No. Ah. Oh, my God. Oh. Save some of them. See if I can. I see Nitro Red doing this thing. Oh, he's looking for me now. Wage on him here. Get get a couple of hits in. Like that. There you go. Save you some ammo here. And then the S looks nice. I love the looks of this con. I love this console. So good. Now, now I gotta really memorize this shit here. Stop goofing off. Right here. You ain't making me move. There you go. Where's your messiah now? Is that gonna... The fucking angles! What the fuck are you doing? Is that gonna go off? Stay here. Just in case. Coming in at an angle, son of a bitch. Okay. Some progress. That's good. Yeah, that, that was what you should have done to begin with. Just not move away from the part where you need to be. That's good. I, I bet this here is nothing, right? The trap. Where's the easy way? But should I explore it a bit or no? And that's a million dollar question, right? Eh? Think you beat this one that I no fucking chance in hell. This game is horrifically hard at the end. So this is gonna be a multi-stream. That's why they give it the saves. Zero chance of me beating this one. It's already what? Six hours in? I don't think so. Is this TV red? It's a, it's a reddish wooden collar. Uh, I was showing earlier. I'll show you a tiny bit here. It's just a fucking cable too short. Give me a second. Pause here. I don't want to fuck around. All right. Okay. So there's the set. That's the front of it. And the top, I think what he referred to, is sort of like wood. Uh, I bought some more ring lives like this one here. Where is it? And one I put on top to keep it illuminated. 
Uh, but I think on the side here, be able to see. So it's just a uh, reddish wood, wood is very polished, it's like immaculate. It really is. The guy, whoever had this here, took very good care of it. I wish I could go up. So yeah, it's has rabbit ears. Here's the panel. Yeah, it's the light that makes it look red. That's all it is. It has a reddish tint to it. Oh, what's funny when you when you open that, the image gets weird. I'll show you. Just the way it is. But it's not a red red TV, no. Code red. Got crumbs of bread here. What are you doing? Got a nasty ass dry hit. All right. Should I go go up? Let's go up. Just make a decision. Don't be a pussy. All right. What's this about, fellas? Thank you. Wish I don't know if I should have gone the other way, but Rooster forty nine forty three. Thank you for following. Yeah, it's strange that the door effect. The effect of brightness, I guess, like a halo effect here. Couldn't capture Bell with this, with this fucking shitty ass webcam here, but. What the fuck are you doing now? Oh! Cable's getting short or something now. Fuck me. You've done it. Now save, saving your data, okay? Get Elemental Master. Ever tried that one? I never played that one. What's that about, fella? Wait, Liza. No, I don't read that already. Went out of school. Good morning. How goes it? We got another village here. Oh, welcome to Miracola. I can't believe I still, I'm still shocked about missing out on that heart. That would have helped out a lot. What the fuck am I doing? You're gonna need it for the last boss, I think. I think. Oh, I wish. I really, 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 really wish I could go back. This is funny, I remember this here, because it's from Nitro Rads. I'm a brave sailor too, can I go with you? Y'all must die to see? Mmm, uh, mmm, uh, mm, I'm getting seasick, I better stay here. <laughs> Hilarious. Yeah, let's go to the houses here. The shmup. You're a dude instead of a plane though. What, what console is that? Where do you come from, Maricola? Fuck yeah. I'm so worried. Ben and Nat has been sick for so long. Oh, thought it was more. All right. Ben and Nat. I miss, I miss Myra 1990. You met Miss Coral? Tell me which one is best. Well, I ain't no fool. You're so honest and cute too. Oh yeah, I'm very honest. To be honest, I, you, you both look good. Our chief loves his daughter very much, but Alice, she is very sick. Genesis, I remember seeing it on a classic game room. The classic game room, yeah. He's kind of making some new content. It's kind of weird. He's kind of back into it somehow, a little bit. Oh, so you can just walk, walk in into this one here. Huh? You gotta do something. Something unholy. <laughs> she just stays quiet if you disagree. Did I talk to you already? Yeah, I have. Uh, maybe there's a secret tunnel here or something? Miracola. Yeah, I don't know that one, but like, I don't know if you may remember, but I never played shmups that much. I wasn't into it, but I'm kind of wrapping my head around the idea of doing some shmups here and there. Turn-based RPGs is never happening, but shmups, yeah. Oh, there's a lady here. Oh, I already talked to her. Oh, you can't, can you jump? 
how would I? Something is, something is going on here. Can I uproot the tree or? That was a good channel back in the day. I haven't did any of the new stuff. I heard it's more promoting the band or something. Oh, he did for a while. It was, it was weird. There was no content. It was just him talking about t-shirts and a band or something. Oh, there we go. Uh, no, he actually came back with some content. I surprised everyone, like talking about video games for a change. You know? <laughs> it's kind of crazy. And of all things, he talked about modern games for, for a racing game. But I don't know, you know, you kind of lose the trust. I don't know. Is this like an arrow thing? No, I'm just seeing things. So who knows if he's going to say, then I think he did a couple of band things. I think he went back to doing the band shit. That's all, all recent right now. I just seen him talking about a game. I forgot which one it was, but he's, he's been making some content like the old times. I, I don't know what, what the problem is, you know, what's going on, to be honest. You know about the castle of Sheep Cola? Better not go there. Don't tell me what you're doing. You my daddy. The downside with shmups is that it can be so hard. There's some that I like a lot, but I still never beat them. It's all right. I, I'll play some some here, and if I don't beat them, I don't beat them, you know? But yeah, I heard. There's one that I really like. Do I have how much power I have here? I don't. Is that free? It's just half a heart, but thank you. Okay. Uh, Hellfire, only because I like the song so much, the first the, the first track. And what's interesting about that track, if you look it up, it only works well on a Sega Genesis Model 1. It does not work on a, on a Model 2. It only works half the speed. It's all fucked up. So quite, quite interesting. How, how different it is. Uh, but the, the track of Hellfire, the first, and I never played the game, but I looked into it because I really like the soundtrack. The Schmups, they have good music. And yeah, the, the game is supposed to be very hard. And it, you, you shoot all over the place. It's kind of a complex way of shooting things. And I, I, I was like, you know, I never play Schmups that much, maybe a bit of 1942 here and there. So I don't think this is the right one for you to start with. So I, I didn't play it. Thank you, my good sir. So we're gonna to talk to the chief here. I'm just hanging out. Is the chief of Miracola? Why don't you go ahead and make yourself useful? I'm we're talking business here. Kind of eavesdropping here. Who the fuck are you? All right, there you go. Another chief here. Not a mustache man. He's got a friendly mutton chops. Chief Miracola, Mike, I've heard of your courageous adventure. Please, can you help me? One year ago, men of shooting stars appeared in the sky and settling dreadful lightning flash. Since that night, my dear Beninette has left and she will not awake. Please help my daughter, she's upstairs. Some say a mountain hermit leaves, a mountain hermit leaves who has. Some say a mountain hermit lives who has a healing spells. Okay. Uh, <laughs> you must find him. Please help my daughter and I'll fix your wrecked shit. Okay. Wouldn't be good if I could go back to the previous stage and get the heart. Oh, you're streaming right now. All right. Uh, well, have a good time. Happy to hear you streaming. Like I said, do your best, and if it's causing harm, then it's, it's no, there's no shame in not doing it anymore. You know, but if you're doing it and you feel it again, that fire in your belly, the only advice I can give you is the same, just stay away from numbers. I said that already, so... If you're having fun, you're having fun. You know, if you're not and it's causing trouble, I, I understand completely. Uh, Master Pysel, give, give, give it a shout out to CRT4K. Anyone who wants to go in there, maybe you're bored with this game. Maybe you had enough, you had your field of CRT racks. He's doing the same thing on different CRTs. So, you know. And again, uh, if you leave, I wouldn't know because I, I don't keep track of the numbers here. So I, I have no clue how many people are watching this right now, to be honest with you. I tend to assume not a lot, and that's fine. And if there's a lot, I just pretend there's not a lot. I don't know. Okay, the green patch of this room. So this is a different entrance, right? <clears throat> is that what you're on about? Thank you, Master Pricell. 
probably be done before you. I'm just gonna mess it around. Yeah, yeah. Don't worry about raids and shit like that, because <coughs> half the time the people they're they're not they don't stick around for a raid. I know, because I go with a raid to somebody else, and people are just leaving. That's fine. People are tired, or they, they watch the stream for a long time, and some of them stay for a little while. Say, so yeah, I better get go to bed. You know, can't jump from stream to stream forever. Just the way it is. You know, no problem about the shout out. Like I said, I like your content, uh, but you know, don't force yourself to do anything that is not pleasant to you. Don't harm. I'll always be here for you. You can always find me on Discord. We can do phone calls, if you, video calls, whatever. Uh, we can play online at some point. So, so I'm here, dude. You know? But if you're happy doing streaming, if you get it back, why not? You know? All right, pay attention to green patch here. I don't think I can do much from this side. Can I? Oh. This here is a wall, so I can't. So does that mean I go from the back of the building or something? Let me try. Try that out. I can't. Okay, maybe. I think I got it. Oh my god, do I have to go back to that thing? The cave? Oh shit. Okay. I'll have to go back. So my plan here, based on your hint, uh, Master Pycelle, should go back to where I was the first time and go from the top and it's liable to be invisible. Is that the correct, assum correct assumption? That's what I'm thinking. And no one is half the battle. Uh, yeah, let's go. Let's go. Oh, I thought I'd have to go to the cave of trials and tribulations again. So let's try that for a spell. Let's see. I know it's here, but I'm going to try everything. Oh, there you go. Let's go upstairs. I think we get to see Ben and Ed. Is that it? It's sick and bad. Ben and Ed is sick and bad. Oh, you're Mike. That's right. That's right. The famous guy. Okay, let's see. Um, I'm so worried Ben and Ed has been sick for so long. So I hear. Is she in here? Catching some Z's, huh? Okay, can I do something for her? G.I. Jose. <laughs> G.I. Joe, yeah. To be honest, I didn't pay attention. I, I think if you hadn't brought up to my attention here, I eventually probably would have seen it, but I didn't see it right off, you know, right off the bat. To be honest, you mentioned pay attention. I, I, I don't think it was the right call to tell me that. Make sure to talk to each NPC in the village. <laughs> I did try that because I, I think uh, he mentioned. So maybe I forgot somebody. Let's head on, head on back. I think I thought I talked to some everyone. Uh, the boy. I don't think there's much I can do for Princess Bena. Is she a princess? Benanette? Did I talk to everyone in here? I talked to her. Yes. Fine one. Fine one. <clears throat> so I go there and she's sick and then that's it. Did I talk to this fella here? I did. I talked to him. Did I talk to him? Sir? This game has a good, a good vibe, as they say. The hoot and holler, all right. Let me see here. Did I? I yeah, I, I talked to the fella. He, he healed me. Hi. Music is great. Did I go all the way here? I did. Whoop. I, I'm pretty sure I talked to everyone. <clears throat> so, what am I to do now? I just leave this, the village? Yeah, I guess. Go find a, a cave somewhere. <laughs> the shield game. Did try to do the top left again, top right. I talked to that bastard. I'm pretty sure I did. Uh, 
not, you know, how the fuck can you go back in there? Even though it's bullshit, there's a door in there, we all seen it. Hmm. Let's see. He wasn't, right, he wasn't in the right frame of mind, is that it? Oh, thank you. Would you mind getting out of my fucking way, asshole? Thank you. Talked to him one time, and piano artists also said that. <clears throat> so lesson learned, if you talk to, talk to everybody twice, there you go. Problem solved. Right? Right, but wrong, because everything you say is wrong. All right. Fix my submarine. So this is the next dungeon I, I take. It is. Mm. Couple of drags here and I'll, I'll be back to it. All right then. So this, I don't have the bolo ties, the bolo thing, bolo ties, well, you should have them, I miss them, <sighs> oh, okay, you're going to really have to do the uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh, Come on, dude, what are you doing? Don't do two, just one. Oh, shit. I'm in a world of shit. Oh. Just one. Everybody gets one. Oh, shit. Getting, uh, getting, getting smart here. Getting intelligence. Nah. Damn it. Yeah, I'm gonna die here for sure. Having a real problem with those fellers. So you can do two. No, should have gone here, okay. No, oh. What the fuck was that? No. Oh my god. No, I'm dead. Here. And here. There you go. No. Damn it. Oh my god, they're gonna ambush me here. Fuck. Yeah, I need more practice here. Can you get, can you two get together? Re Reacquainted. They're kind of creepy. There you go. Come on. Join, join forces. That's it. No! Ah! Got greedy. If you jump in the water, can I bet it? Oh, that's right, I should do. How about this here? How the fuck you avoid this shit? Kind of nonsense, but can I jump? Ah! Ah! Mm -hmm. Who says an old dog can learn new tricks, huh? I'm forgetting about that I, I can jump in the water here, like an idiot. Isn't that pathetic? Oh, come on, man. Fuck me. What are you doing, weirdo? There you go. Life is easier now. Why did I jump up? What compelled me to do that? Idiocy, I believe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. Now we, we're getting better, man. An important thing. Look, you play the game. Are you getting better? Are you making progress? That's good. That's all you need to do. Oh shit. What the fucker? Ooh. That's it. 
Hey, hey! Everybody loves Raymond. Yeah, that's a the good tip. See, you gotta be able to figure the shit out like that, though. And just keep pushing through like a like an idiot. All right, all right, all right. Oh shit! Okay, there's a there's a thing here, right? Oh my goodness. Okay. I'm sorry, but I couldn't see uh, the rest of it. Okay. Oh. Oh, shit. Huh. Oh, my God. No. Son of a bitch. Okay, gotta see where they're jumping here. How am I gonna kill those fucking snakes, man? I, I... What the fuck? You sure damn clumped up! Oh, jeepers. sometimes making sure just making sure you've heard i got it steak and eggs and eggs and steak yeah 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 okay now those fellers should be a lot easier <laughs> fucking asshole blocking me here Doing. Yeah, but look at my fucking health. I'm not getting those fucking, uh, fucking snakes out there. Okay. What was it again? Okay. Right here. But I'm not. How would I. How would I kill him here? How can I. Because if I jump them here in the middle, the other one is going to get me. No, no, no. I don't. I don't get it at all. Do I need. Is a necessary hit? Are you telling me I have to take a hit here? Can I jump both of it? What? I'm not following this one. I can't, if I jump here, it's gonna be a water, isn't it? Yeah, I'm not getting that part with the snakes there, how, how to avoid taking damage. Can you stop fucking me up here, you assholes? Freaky looking motherfuckers. Come on, bitch. Okay, did well. Batter here. Kill the top one as they're closed and kill the try to kill the top one as they're closed and jump the two when they come after you. It's gonna be a close call. This is a tough one here. Tough racket. Can I? Oh. No, I can't. I can't, do, I can't do much with this. Can I? Come on! Damn it. And I can't attract them here anymore. I'm thinking of. Nope, that's not enough time. I'll try to kill the top one. So the bottom one, I mean. How would I. Okay, well, but now, get ready to, okay. No, I'm gonna leave this guy as my guide, okay? Pa, 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 okay. No, 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 no. 
What are you doing? Oh, thank God. There we go. Hey, hey! Hey, 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 Ray's here! <laughs> there we go. The fuck is this? The bat! Bat! The bat! No, but... See, every little bit you go further here, you, you get to learn more. Look at how... How better I'm doing here now compared to my old pathetic self when I came here to this dungeon the first time, you know? Look, that's what gaming is all about. You get better, you know? You do better. And I want to know what the secrets here are. I don't know about not taking hits from the, them snakes, but, you know, they're not that bad. So we're going to... There you go. Don't need you no more. Don't need you no more. There you go. Bingo. And then, what I want to do here, I think, is equip the bat. Right? Take that! What the fuck? Well, that didn't go as well as I planned in my head. Sure as hell didn't. That's fine, we're getting there. Gosh, darn it. I like this game. There you go. There you go. We know the drill here. Uh, try it using the sling shot, I suppose. They gave you to you, so maybe just try that. Yeah, sure. Why? Why'd you do that? What'd you do that for? Coming in with idiotic mistakes in the last fucking minute. This thing is kind of creepy looking. Come on, bitch. So are those snakes, instead of taking a hit, jump up to their platform? Well, I can't see shit. I don't understand. Jump up to their platform? Okay, oh, I think, oh, I know what you mean, okay. Oh, so there are platforms here, that's right. Oh, shit. That's stupid, wasn't it? Okay. God, I hope. Yep, that's the dumbest thing I ever did. Yeah, that is, yeah. Oh, derp. Oh, my goodness. What were you doing? Oh. What are you on about? Am I on the wrong one? No. That's... The... What's happening here? Don't ever do that again. Stop. Don't. Why would I jump? Okay, let me try this link shot here. This link was link shot time. Oh, shit. Come on! Okay, I'm not not feeling it. Past. 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 Come on! What the fuck? Okay, but fuck me. Look at my health. Give me some. In the jar of reserve here. Didn't clue until I saw it about three times. Yeah, I did, didn't clue in. Yeah, I, I wouldn't. I didn't uh, put you and two together there, but you did. Oh, shit. Okay. 
careful. Be respectful now. I'm gonna... I wanna know what's in here. I don't know, this looks kind of suspicious. Oh shit. This place looks cool though. Yeah. Laugh, huh? Yeah. Just wait for them to shoot and then move. There you go. Nope. No! Okay. Oh, I'm dead. Zero fucking way. Zero fucking way I'll make through the... Oh. In the wrong form. I'm up. Panicking here like a motherfucker. Oh shit, I gotta co I continue here? <gasps> Die, you bastards! Ho oh, ho, you fuck. Yeah. Found that one? How about some more? Checking everything. Well, found a secret there. That was good. That was good. That worked out. Oh shit. Is that the boss? Why ain't got those links? Some folks call it a Kaiser shot. I call it sling shot. Well, where, where is? Keep going, I guess. Do I, do I need to kill this? Who's not? Who's no boss? Oh! <laughs> no. Open up. This is Nathaniel Bard. Oh shit! Oh yeah! I killed the monster and then a fucking. Don't tell me you never swatted a bothersome fly. Give me the thing. I don't need a son of a bitch. Okay, come on, come on. Where's the clock here? No, no, I don't fucking need it. Just ignore the haters. Keep going. Don't need to worry about him. Okay. I actually know. I, I actually. Nah! I actually know this. No! Give me. Ah! There's no point in killing this asshole. Come on. I think. Ah! I think you'll die if you go in the wrong one. That one right there. Look. Is it. No. I think. I know you die. I, 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 that got spoiled for me with the Nitro Red video. As long as I can come back, right? <clears throat> you die in there. So it's a sucker's bet, if I recall it correctly. Ah. Uh -huh. Yeah, they're not getting me. You, you have to go the right path. I, I remember this one. There you go. You Ah! No, no! Wait. God damn, how the f- I, I think I, I fucked up already, didn't I? I didn't check this one here. Okay, let's go. You're playing the dangerous game. <laughs> That's crazy. That's crazy, Jesus! That's crazy! Alright, let's go. Boss man! Uh, fuck him! Wait. What the fuck is going on? 
What are you doing? Wait. I would have to do... No! What the fuck is this? Get the thing. Come on, quick, 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 quick. Oh, my God. Quick. <laughs> Kill him. Fatality. My Jones wins. Flawless victory. Okay, just keep going here. Don't be a bitch. Now I gotta decipher what the, what the fuck that boss wants. I, I don't know what he wants. <laughs> fuck. No! My God! I wasted it. I wasted everything. Ah! No, oh, man. That's okay. What's with that fucking boss? I, I don't know what he want. What do you want from me in there? I'm not getting it. Fine. This is shit, man. I don't know what that boss one. There's like a couple of things on the side, so I, I think that's gonna do something. Maybe after. I got a thing before I jump a tiny bit more than what I'm doing right now, because I'm kind of just going for it, and uh, that's not the way it goes. Not around here. You got to make sure you know what you're doing before you click that jump button. And I'm not, you know, not got to think about it. But things are, no, things are looking, what the fuck? Things are looking better here. You know, we get there. Okay, I track in here. There you go. Like this here, this used to be a white knuckle moment for me, and I was, and I was kind of nothing. There you go. There you go. And uh, the snakes too, you should be a, a big mystery here. I don't think I would have figured out though the thing, the, the logic. But it's right there, the answer, right? Just go on the path of the fucking snakes, and, and that's all you have to do. And I'm here trying to jump in and do the fucking impossible. And it's just so much easier than it made it out to be. Well. No! Ah! What did I just say? E you think, guys, you gotta think before you jump, and I go. Um, oh, fucking dumb, man. You're dumb. Why? What are you. Are you, you dude, fuck me. Fuck me. Why? Wow. Wow. I can't believe I... Did I... Did I do that? I can't believe I just did that. Better believe it. Done it. You fucking... You didn't give me shoes. Don't jump, y'all. Don't... Don't be too hasty with your jump. Think before you jump. And what the fuck did I just say? Hmm? It's like a shit. No, really, pay attention before you jump, for, for crying out loud, stop. That's one last try with a ball. No! What the fuck is wrong with me? I seem to be addicted to that shit! Oh, no. Die, just, no. Die horribly. We're restarting the shit, and please, can you stop? Can you fucking stop? Can you fucking stop? This saggy old whore. Man, fuck me. Can't believe I did that twice in a row. What in the fuck is going on here? And I got pigeons on top of my trailer. A roost in here and fighting. Oh, it's gonna be a hot day, it looks like it. Son of a bitch. Close this. You hear that? Motherfucking pigeons here. What time is it? I don't wake up my kids, you bastards. All right. I can't believe I jump, jump. Stop jumping and then go to the left, but you keep jumping upwards and keep going into the water. Keep going into the fucking drink. And I don't, I don't. Mm 
Why? Why? Why'd you do that? Should have asked for it. Just told yourself not to do it and go on and do it. Will you shut the hell up? I know what you're doing. I don't know what you're doing. It's a it's called trial and error, but the the point of the trial and error is to learn from the error. Not go on. Tell you tell yourself and your viewers you're not gonna do it and then go on and do it again. You know? I don't know what them stars is for. What is the stars for? I need to read the manual here. Well, thank you for the clip master for myself. That's like I just t told myself don't do it and then I go on and do it again. Is there gonna be a third time? I hope not. I, I think twice is enough. I mean, I, well, I'm getting stars here up to Yin Yang, and what's what's that about? Yeah, you do you do one you do one mistake, you do two mistakes, and and then you're gonna, you're gonna do a third one, or you're going for the record of stupidity here, or what's the drinking stupid juice out here? Maybe that's what it was. I fill up the mason jar apparently with stupid juice. Stop now! It's fucking simple. It fucking flies now, man. Is it? Oh god. Okay. How about I just ignore your ass? Come on. I don't want to deal with y'all. Fuck you, dude. Fuck you too, you fuck. Come here. Get your ass in here. Come on, come on. How are you gonna get me, bitch? Okay, a lot about to get some hearts here. Mm. Don't fuck around here. Don't fuck around here, mister. Oh, th those rooms here are kind of weird. Just, are you able to, Do you fall in here if you keep going? I, I'm not going to try it, but just wondering. Manuals are for pussy. I keep not reading the fucking man. I, and I always say to myself, but hey, you're, you're talking to a guy who just said to himself, don't jump there, and then I just jump there. So every fucking playthrough, I say, hey, I'm gonna, I'm gonna really get into it now. I'm gonna read the manual. You know? PDF is available out there online for free. And I go on fuck around and don't do shit. Alright, let's try, it. try this again. Hit a despair. We get at least we got another heart. We got lives here. No, 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 no. Get move your ass. Move it. Move it. Move it. Oh God, which one was it? I think the one up there. This one here. Nope. Okay. Wait here. Huh. Okay. You ever heard of memorizing? You gotta try sometime. It's fun. You know, you've been to a level and you kind of memorize where the things are. It could help you some time. There you go. Sort of like that. So now, oh shit. So now you remember uh, top left corner and then top right. And now you remember here is the thing. Go. Oh my god, it's so slow. Not today! Come on, man. I don't know if they don't freeze, but you don't want to stick around here to find out. Okay, here's just... Off you go. No, 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 no fucking around here. Off we go. Off we go. Thank you. Thank you. Lovely. I appreciate it. Nope. Thank goodness. There you go. And now, this side here, just to get the heart. But he had a heart. And then head on back, because you know that's bullshit up there. It's nonsense. Son of a bitch. What the fuck? Why do you that? Alright. Nah! I'm gonna find out the last one there. But maybe something. Nothing. Okay. Okay, the boss is coming up. This here 
doesn't do anything. Uh, I was trying to think, because I, I don't know what that boss, what's the deal here. Let me think, let me see if I can remember. He has a few things on the side. He's spitting fire from the front, his front pie hole. Right? Uh, two things like look look it looks like they're closed up eyeballs to the sides and then some fires that go around the room and I don't know try the, we'll try this here first I don't know if shooting him is having any effects it's just being a fireball is it a fireball I don't think it can hurt him let's, let's just go we'll learn this part here is a bit weird. I mean, what's in here, you know? Not a fucking thing. What's the, what is the purpose of this? What is the purpose of this room here? Is it a combination? I mean, surely they made this room for, for a reason, right? No reason? Just... Okay. That's kind of weird. Uh, all right, let's... Uh, Try to hurt, hurt the fireballs, I guess. Okay, can you get the fireballs? No! Get the fireballs to come up here and light those things up or something? I don't fucking know! I ain't got no time to fucking practice here! Oh my god, come on. Let me figure, let me try to figure out. Let's see. I'll try to figure out. It's a sentence, you know. Five of them. Okay. Go. Son of a bitch. Fuck. Okay, try to get this way. Go. It's cool you can jump over him. You don't have to deal with his ass. Okay, that's good. And then you need the, the bolo things. Ha 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 ha. Asshole. Oh man, what are you doing? Don't fuck around here. Oh my goodness. Mm. Go, 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 go. Oh. Good. Fine one. Fine one. The room with no purpose here, kind of weird. I think you were on the right track, baseball bat. Uh, I haven't had, didn't I have a baseball bat here last time? Pretty sure I did. What happened to it? Hmm. I ain't got it no more. Good drink. I, I, this is not, the problem, I don't have time it's like a coffin of nonsense here. I don't have time to, to know what the hell's going on here. Uh, you know, I guess I gotta keep trying until I have a little bit more time and try different things, I suppose. Sorry? Pardon me? What was that? Excuse me? You can't just change the fucking rules like this. The clock stopped them, and I'll just lose them down. What? Yo. Suck my winner. Since when? Since when? Since when? What the f I don't get it. Is that... Am I running out of power? Do I need power or something? Just change the rules just like that? You remember the good old days where the clock would just stop them? You remember that? Now oh, that was a hit in the holler. I remember those days. Those are the good old days. Times have changed. I'm just trying to think here. No. No, 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 that. Okay. 
You know what? I, I, I didn't even get the fucking bolo things. Way back five minutes ago. Remember that? Remember the good old times that... Those are the days. We're gonna turn the thing here. I can't seem, can't seem to damage. I don't remember the nitro rat video, so that's that's gone out of the window. Can hit him. I can't hit him directly. I remember something about 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 shooting water into him or something. Try to hit those things. Is it possible? Right there. Fuck you. Give me a fucking... Nothing happened. Nothing happened. Nothing happened. Not a fucking thing happened. This guy here. That feller. See, that's what I'm talking about with the, that's what I'm talking about with the back seat. But I appreciate it, Master Price. I'm not calling you out. But the minute I said that block right there, you said the block right there. Did you know that already? That's the thing. You give it time, you know, you can, you can find stuff. But I was wondering if you, if you came up with that idea at the same time I did. The block, because I, I noticed the block. I hadn't seen the chat yet. Uh... Again, again, I call you out on back seat. You help me out. I didn't think of this. Just, by, I just saw it too. That's that's got to be it. That's the one thing standing. I didn't, I didn't see it before, but there it is. I think that's 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 your guy. That's not a guy. I think that's it. That's the answer. The fucking thing was standing out like a sore thumb, and and we didn't. I didn't think of it. There you go. That has got to be it. You'll do something. Well, I'm able to do something. <clears throat> good, good, good. I like it. I'm screaming, I'm screaming internally. That's one last life that I have against a boss on bullshit. <laughs> Mind you, it never happened before. Never happened falling there. That was nonsense and you know it. We both know it. It was garbage. Don't you dare. Here's the thing you had to do last time. You see what are you doing here? This is called stopping. And stopping has amazing power. Guess what? Stopping is also an action. So when you stop, everybody wins. My most is like enemy. The starfish. The four starfish that go around like... Uh, second of that, I'll say the flies. Yeah, they are fucking annoying, man. They're just a mess. See, mm. no, oh, bitch. Oh! What are you doing? Remember what you said about sending about thinking before you jump? And I lost a life here for no reason. There's some crazy rooms here to do nothing, right? It's kind of funny. Yeah, and then now, uh, C 
senior moment, perhaps. It's called memorizing. Isn't that beautiful? You memorize where things are so you can remember them that next time you come around. Now let's see what we get here is a box of chocolates with this fucking thing. Oh, back just stopping normally? Oh, oh, what? What's that? Oh, it's arbitrary? Oh, thanks. What the fuck was that? Why that one time? There's gotta be something. It can't be completely arbitrary. Come up it. Son of a bitch. Okay. Ha! <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. That actually scared me this time. Forgot it shows up on the side here, too. Now, I'm gonna have a lot of weapons here. Let's see how it goes. I don't know. Do they even help me? Ah, why are you jumping, man? You, that's the thing. I want to. I have the instinct to jump forward, and you can't. This is this game is, is different, you know. You can just jump in there. I was jumping out of the way, but that's not that's not how it works here. You just push on forward. Did you pick the bat? I, I got the bat. I got the bat. Something tells me you know the bat is the best, sir. When did you pick up the bat? Uh, it's right when you, uh, that block I keep jumping forward for no fucking reason to kill myself. The part with the snakes where it's all dark and you'll, you light up, you, you hit, you jump on the block, it lights up everything, and then there's a slingshot and the baseball bat. That's, that's what just happened. So I think because you die, if you die here, it continues you on the, the, the room with all the, the three flies and the clock thing, the stopwatch. Uh, so then you lose everything that you had. The way it goes. Yeah. All right, then. Okay. Sit. Don't don't talk to it. Don't acknowledge it. Just go to that block. Just just. It's fine. But I'm wondering what that. That do something. Oh, it did something, but I'm, I'm wondering what, what now. Let's see if we got the good stopwatch or the bullshit one. The, is, was that a glitch then before? Or is lost in, it didn't look like a glitch. It looks like deliberate. A deliberate attempt to sabotage my gameplay here, I would say. Kind of fucking me up here, you know? Fucking me over, bitch. Uh-uh. Good, no damage here. Every little heart counts. I can't believe I left a fucking heart back there. That's gonna fuck me. I know it's gonna fuck me on the last boss. Forever. Not having those hearts. I can't believe it. I hope I don't have to fucking repeat a playthrough because of that shit. I fucking sincerely hope so. Because I... The, the fly! No, I... The fly is the worst enemy. That's it. Horrible. Horrible fucking things. Alright. Okay. I, I, that doesn't make a difference. I, I, I'm concentrating on the things here first. This here. What am I doing here? Come on, dude. It's like, how do I dodge your shit? <sighs> okay. Oh, there we go. Fucking flies. Are... Yeah, I hate the flies the most. No, it's the flies. I hate them. I hate flies in general. I mean... Hey, there you go. That makes no sense. What the? Why? I don't, I don't get it. So after a few tries, did I run out to something that is needed? I don't, I don't, I don't get this shit. Boy, wouldn't have the, the having the snowman here would be good, huh? Would it though? I don't know. Would it help? Oh yeah, I guess it could freeze the, uh... Oh. The fireballs are becoming an issue. Now if I continue here, I don't understand then why I didn't have the uh, equipment later. Oh, no, I got you, yeah. Oh, you fuck. What about the, the bolo thing here? 
Do nothing, and those blocks here do nothing, right? Kind of, kind of fucking weird. This is kind of weird here. In a fucked up kind of way. Ooh. Okay. Yeah, I don't... I'm trying to be a, a bit more careful here, but it ain't easy. Ah! Come on! Oh shit, I, I came here and then... I, 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 I don't know, dude. I'm trying to think, so... Do I need to step on the block again, or...? Hmm. Yeah, the pattern is fucked up. This is getting there is a known, known issue anymore. It's just. What'd you say? You're saying something? Hey, you there. On the fucking TV. You saying getting there is no issue? Doesn't look like it. You saying something? Something arrogant? Saying something not factual? Can't lose hearts here. Okay, so here's where you get the bat. Don't jump forward. And a sling, slingshot. <sighs> Took a lot of hits already. This is where the story ends, right here. You're not gonna make it. I'll kill you first, you bastard. The, 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 the perfect, the perfect right of the angle here. I can't do nothing about it. Can't do nothing about that shit. So it seems like I got addicted to you losing a life here for for absolutely no fucking reason whatsoever. Oh shit, is in you? Hey. Fucking hit me that one time for no fucking reason. Died here one time, one time. Oh, okay. What the fuck are the stars for? No, we're, not, we're never jumping there again. Well, I'll say that and then you do it next time. I know it. I know you're kind. Uh, for that boss fight, you have to find the blocks. And I can't hear the rest. I can read the rest of it because YouTube is stupid and does this. Let's, let's laugh at YouTube a tiny bit. Just give me a second. So, you have the pop pop, pop shit, right? I can't read the rest of the message because it's heart bullshit here. This dopamine garbage. This dopamine shit here. I can fucking read the rest of my message. Yeah, I could make it fucking gigantic here, right? So, just. What? <laughs> But I don't want to. I got I got the Twitch chat here, so I can't like get this crap out of here. Get this trash out of here right the fuck now. Can't fucking read the goddamn messages here. Got to go full screen. What are you on about? On about? I don't hard anything on YouTube. I'm not doing it. It's stupid. Well, likes were good enough, and there they mean nothing anyways. You you remove the fucking dislikes. Who cares? So for that boss fight, let me fucking make it full screen. Should, should be able to read, cause fucking YouTube. Uh, one on each, yeah, one on each side to make the boss. No, I got the gist of the the, the blocks. I'm, the only thing I'm only seeing one block. So 
I remember now, you 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 make the thing fall, he got, gets into the water, and then it puts out the fire. I got that bit. I'm just having a problem locating the second one, but Mark tries here with get me into it. Just had a dick. Might as well add a middle finger there. Hey, you want to read your message? Fuck you. Here's some dopamine. Come off it. I, I, I don't like the hard shit. I used to do it. And then it. You know what I did? I went through the... I thought the hearts were like, oh, is that the new thing? I went through every every comment I ever hearted on... Sorry. On YouTube, I unhearted it. I left one. There's one secret one in there. Only one comment ever has a heart. Uh, I... Because then, you heart one and then the other guy, well, we didn't heart me. It's like fucking... It's like that episode of South Park with a fucking Facebook. It didn't have me on Facebook. Fuck that shit. I hate it. It becomes a... It's something that's supposed to be nice, but it... it ah! Ah! Mm -hmm. It becomes a problem. How many lives here? You know what? Fuck it. I'm pushing on. I'm, I'm, I'm not going to give up. More practice. Obviously, you need to get better at this stage still. My eyes are twitching now. Well, only my... Only one of them is. Yes. This guy's a fucking weirdo. Fucking weird, man. It's like a, a bird with a human skull. Kind of weird. You said we're not friends. That's that's right. So yeah, you get folks like, oh, so you didn't heart my comment, but it hearted the other guy. I'm not my comment not, not good enough for a heart. You got the likes, you got the heart. What else are you gonna add in there? I can see people I get there. Ooh, I, oh, he hearted me. Oh, oh. Stop. Stop. No. I refuse. No review. I refuse. Hey. No, we're not doing that shit. We, we, we're past that. We're past that crap. I hope. I sincerely hope we're past it. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna... I'm gonna ignore y'all. Had enough of... Can't stand y'all anymore. Yeah, just, 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 just say goodbye. I can't believe I, I died here. I can't believe that. Upset about the hearts on YouTube. Oh, shit, we fucked up. Okay. Ain't no thing here. No. No! Oh my god. You, you playing the issue fast and lose, man. Yeah, no, I got the gist, but where's the second platform, I'm thinking? And thank you for the tip, piano artist. Yeah, there's something. You gotta do something in there. All right, you gotta... You'll fall in, but the sec where's the second one? Where is the second block? You ain't doing it. There you go. I forgot, we, we got lives here. Ha! So that's good. Quick, 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 quick. All right. And what's the... Uh, piano, if you know this, this game well, what's the deal with the stopwatch here? Why? Why? Look, right? They stop. Is he using up something? Why later on it's not permanent? Why is that? That would make no sense to me. Is it depleting something? I don't get it. You know, we avoided this asshole here beautifully. Get that heart. You come here the first time is bullshit. You got the heart, you're gonna keep jumping forward. Or you're gonna get fucked, and you're gonna get fucked hard. Because ain't nothing but death out there. Get out of here! Nothing but death out there waiting on you. Oh shit. Freak. Right? So if you pick the, the left side here, you're done. You're gonna fall, you're gonna burn. It's a horrible death. There you go. Here we go again. I don't know. Can you attack him with anything? I, I don't even know. Let's just say it. Where's the second? Oh! No, oh, no, you fucked. You fucked up. Okay, where's the second one? One of them is going to be the second one. 
This guy! This one! No. What the fuck am I to do here? I don't fucking know! Alright. Uh... That. That one. That one there. Shut up! That one there. Something we gotta raid it here. Hey! CRT4K just raided. Welcome, y'all. I think the stopwatch is random. It's really of no. It's not really of you as well. It helped me with the flies a lot. Thank you for the shout out. Uh, I think I know which. I, I I know which block. I think. Let's go. I I think I, I know. Raiders of the Lost Bark. We're playing some Star Tropics here on NES on a good old 1980s 1980s uh, RF only Trinitron. And the getting is good. The getting is good today. I love this game. Uh, so far, is the challenges are good. It, it's good. It's a good game. First time playing it. So, nope, nope, no, nope, no. Nope. It's been good. Okay. Very interesting, unique, quirky little game, you know? Okay. So we're trying to, trying to defeat this boss here. Give me the bolo things. There we go. Get fucked. No, 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 no. Later, bozo. I wonder what Jamie Oliver is doing right now. Covered his letter himself with olive oil. No, no, no. Time this ride. Okay. Okay, there we go. Two braid. How was the stream today, CRT4K? What you, uh, well, you told me earlier you're playing right the Genesis. Is that what you're playing? Just Potato 7, how you doing? If he's playing Sartropolis, I'll feel disgusted. If I learned that Jamie Oliver would was a fan of this game, he'd probably put me off yet. Okay, let's go. I know, I know, I know what you want now. I know, I know. Watch, watch me. Watch me, motherfucker! The secret is in the sauce. Come on! That's not it! Then I don't fucking know shit. I tried every fucking... No. Nope. This one here? I reckon I gotta... Sh don't tell me the blocks. Nobody tells me the blocks. I'll kill you. I need to find the shit out. I need to do it. Don't rob my, my innocence. Okay. I appreciate the hints, but I need to I need to do this. I need to fucking do the shit, man. I need to figure figure this one out. Okay. Nobody moves. No sudden movements, Doc. Okay, let's go. I don't know. A checkpoint near the boss would have been okay, but that's fine. It's not, it's not the end of the world. Here. Mm, yes, son of a bitch. Okay. Oh, shit. And that's me looking, making sure Elgato is performing as you should, because sometimes Elgato likes you to fuck things up. Like my fucking fight with goddamn William Birkin. The fucking thing froze up the whole fight. I had to reset the game and fucking do it again. Fucking Elgato. Fucking Elgato, man. Alright, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's fucking around there. There you go. Okay, so... I, where would the second fucking block be? And what is this shit here? It, it makes no sense. Not enough badgers in this game probably would. Representation. Where's that? Where's that? My dear, I don't see the aubergine. <laughs> here. I need to check everything. No, no, I need to check this. Check. Fuck you. Check that. Don't jump into the fucking water, whatever you do. This is so fucking annoying. Okay. Yeah, but then I'm kind of lost here. I thought the answer would be... I, I don't fucking know, man. I was pretty sure I tried everything. How about the, the one immediately when you come in, the one to the right? I'll try one more time, and if I don't know, well, I don't know. Have a little smoke there. 
Uh, how's the game, CR24K? How did it go? How's your migraines? You got better? Tiny bit? Uh, I need to stand up here. My ass is actually sore. Give me one second. I'm going to stand up and have the smoke standing up. Okay? Just deal with it. Let me put the, br the brake here a tiny bit. I need to stand up for, for a tiny bit, by God. The chair is as hard as nails. It's, it's fucked. I put the pillow here. It's not doing me... It's not... It's not going a long way, let me tell you. I had the donut pillow thing here. Cushion. It didn't it didn't do much either. So I need a I need a stand up here. I need some blood. My fucking buns here. Okay. Just give me a second. Yeah, I'm not wearing jeans. Okay. I need I need a I need to stand up here, by God. I just need to stand up. Just give me a hot second. I found I don't get headaches if I take a nap in the middle of the day. But I have to be really consistent about it if I, if I wait until about four or so then it's too late. Ah, I've got to follow that regimen now. Yeah, I usually have a lot of migraines myself. After Elemental Master, I played a little bit of Indie Games and RPG from 2010. Oh, yeah, they have a lot of Indie Games for the for the Genesis, right? Here's one something about a uh, what is it? Uh, is it a square or a fox? It was around sort of a puzzle thing. Not very big on music there. Uh, there's a lot of homebrew. There's an, here's another one for the NES if y'all like homebrew. Uh, it's called Bubble, but with a weird like diacritic on top of a U. I don't know how to pronounce there. Bubble, boo uh, boo. So it pretty much is a physics game. Awesome physics. It looks just, just looking at it. I think I can like. Okay, just kind of sit a bit weird. No, I mean look, man, I gotta stand up. I know it's weird to just see my torso here. Look, uh, you were a uh, some sort of bubble. And it's going around. It's on Ichio. I'm gonna buy that. My ass is, is getting some relief right now, cause uh, you know it's been seven hours. So let me, you know, maybe, maybe move around here, kind of pretend you're walking. Walk in a mile. Walk in a green mile. Derp de derp. Uh, if I have any health things like related to being sitting here too much, what I'll do is I'll have breaks and I'll just walk, you know? As a matter of fact, I think I'll, I'll walk after the stream, you know? Probably good for me. Too fucking sedentary here all the fucking time, and I'll fly by the... Fly by the... the spring here. You gotta have your breaks. You gotta have breaks every now and then. Blood pressure medication. I, I, my wife, she measured my blood pressure. It's been okay. Uh, however, when I get angry, it goes sky high. And that's not, that's not, not a good sign, I don't think. Well, she told me it's not a good sign. I don't know if she's about health. All right, give me, give, me, give me a couple of minutes here. And I'll go back to the sign. So the problem there with that boss is finding the second block. So it's my understanding i got to find two blocks. We found one that's, you know, it's kind of obvious. And, uh, you know, what are you going to do? I appreciate the bits, y'all. Princess Retro today gave me 1,700 bits. What a sweetheart. That's very nice of her. I appreciate it. I'll be I'll be lying to you if I know how much that, that's worth, to be honest. But it don't matter. And it, 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 you know, it looks like it's a lot. Uh, I appreciate every bit here. Uh, yeah. I had a those because uh, I had a bunch of trauma. You know, I fell a lot. I got in a lot of fights when I was younger. And uh, uh, a lot of trauma in my face, nose especially. So I had a deviated septum. Uh, sep septum, is that what it's called? So they went and corrected it. It was fucking horrible afterwards. They put a tube up your nose. Two tubes up your nose again, but it's fucking, that was a miserable fucking night, let me tell you. And after that, 
it sort of, it didn't help me as much with the nasal stuff. The best thing I ever did, did is remove my tonsils. 1700000 dollars $170,000. See, I can't buy a Lamborghini with that kind of money. You gotta, you gotta amp up, you know, up the ante here a tiny bit, you know. Well, the first thing to do is drink Coca-Cola, obviously. That's, you know, the shirt here don't come free, you know. They're, they're sending me the money. They're sending me the checks from the headquarters in Atlanta. And uh, we need to, you got to drop that Pepsi. You got to stop with that Pepsi stuff. You got to give that up. Okay? Tell you. And the second thing to do is uh, Raid Shadow Legends. You have to, to get in there and you got to do it. You know, whatever you do on that game, not, I looked it up a tiny bit once. Not, <laughs> God, no, not, not because of interest you're playing, but I, w I want to know what the fuck you actually do on that thing. And, uh, yeah, it's pretty much a scam. It's gambling. But I was surprised to see some YouTubers actually playing it, like, talking about the strats and stuff. And all of a sudden, I was very glad that I'm me, and I was very happy with my life the way it is. You know? I'm, I'm like, boy, am I, am I playing Star Tropics right now? I'm so fucking happy that I'm not doing... Strats videos for Ray Shadow Legends. That's a fate. I, I don't envy that. Thank you. Who here? Yeah, I'm coming back. Mm, that, that did wonders for my asshole and my, my buns. Look, you ever, you ever, who here ever seen the Hero Wars commercials? With the little guy tending and then tending and they go like get an apple go, <laughs> and then and then he goes and kills a bunch of guys with lower what do you call it, hp than he, his power level whatever it is you ever seen those you get those in your neck of the woods hero wars and then you go and then the game is nothing nothing to do with with what you've seen there apparently in the commercial because it wouldn't work as a game if you look at it right you're seeing how powerful the, the enemies are before he gets you them. Why the hell would you attack him, right? Because there's a little guy who goes, to see, he kills like a guy with one HP, and then he kills another one, and then there's a guy with like 999, usually a big monster, and he goes and attacks him, and then he gets fucked in the commercials, right? But why, why would you attack that? You know, I don't even play RPGs or none of that, but, you know, I get the concept that you know, it's not going to bode well for you. It's not going to... Again, it's not going to end up nicely, is it? But the games apparently are nothing to do. Those I've never seen. The actual games, I don't, I don't. I've seen the Raid Shadow Light. It's horrible. I, it's very evil. Like, is it? When you're just watching the game, I felt is it's is is loud garbage. It's like it's for me. It's like it's. I want to get out. I don't want to see that. I don't want that on my screen when I look at it. There's numbers everywhere. And of course, they have a thing which I never, I, I don't get the concept. It's, so the one in, and I, I watched Moldahar talking about that. I like Moldahar. He's, he's talking about the, he's talking about the game. So he goes, you press a button. Is it pretty much the only interaction, you press one button to do an attack and wait your turn. But then you don't have to do that. You can do the uh, autoplay which removes the only, as it says, uh, the only element of gameplay there is, which is very little. And the game, get 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 this, the game plays itself, plays for you. Can you imagine I just sit here? You imagine a stream. Let's, let's dream about the future of gaming here. I go play Star Tropics, and the stream, I, uh, I come here, and this dungeon is too hard. I can't do it. So I press the, the third button here on the NES, on the new one. And it does the level for me, right? Because that's what you want out of video games, right? So we sit here, relax, and just drink it all in, you know? You'll beat the boss, you'll do the, the thing, you'll do everything. Who wants to play video games anyways? Well, who, who wants to, you want to watch video games? You don't want to play video games ever. Just hit the, as the nerd said, the, the beat, beat the game <laughs> button, you know? Fucking crazy. You have to insert money to get, get, get the uh, subscription. Because that's how it is now. Oh, I love Game Pass. I'm sure you do. But I don't. I ain't have none of it. You never gonna, you ain't never going to get Amazon. Amazon didn't get me with their Prime. Netflix didn't get me with their subscription. And you're sure as fuck ain't getting me with your Game Pass. It's not 
fucking happening. Everybody's doing. Yeah, and? I don't care. I'm not doing it. I did Xbox Live Gold one time back in the early 2010s and was shoot as, as that episode of uh, Everybody Loves Raymond. Look it up. Look it up. The way I fail, gonna know. And it's kind of funny. It's a funny clip. Look up Everybody Loves Raymond, Too Much Fruit. That's how I felt. It's like, there's so many fucking games, and yeah, they're free. Because you're well, not free, because nothing is free. You pay for the fucking thing, right? You pay monthly. But it was so many fucking games that I, I don't have time. It, I was overwhelmed. I don't want to. <laughs> too much. My hard drive was. Oh, oh, this is. Oh, this. You can get this. And it was too much shit. Eric's follows. Thank you. It was just shit all over the place. I don't have time. I ended up buying physical. <laughs> I'll buy the game. Maybe it was reasonably priced and play the game I want to play. I don't want to sign up to no service that inundates me with a gazillion fucking games that, are, quite frankly, most of them are garbage to me. To me, you know, they have some value to some other people, not to me though. Now, oh, nice. Drop your cigarette, because you're not having enough problems with the fucking thing. What's that? Stop working? Oh, is that? You're not supposed to drop a cigarette from a hide? Really? Isn't that what you do? Oh, great. Now you done goofed. Now, now I fucked it up. Can you stop harassing me with a fucking headphones, goddammit? So I dropped my... That was my cigarette. So, uh, it's brand new, by the way. So I got this fucking tank here. I'm coming from this one here. So the fucking thing has problems. And you know what helps? Dropping it. Drop the fucking thing. They'll, they'll, they'll teach it. How to... How to act. I'm, am I punching a new cigarette? Is that it? But it wasn't working before anyways. I... There you go. Fuck me. <sighs> Fucking Game Pass. It's gonna be the death of game and watch it. Watch it. You enjoy it now, but the price you pay would be very high. You know, all the shit Microsoft, Xbox is irrelevant. They're laughing maniacally. <laughs> They're gonna have the last laugh, and we're gonna have the last cry, the last tear. It's all nice and convenient now, but we'll see. We'll see how long that lasts. I don't know, man. I'm not not Sir Damas here. I'm not Quasimodo, you know. <laughs> you know, Quasimodo predicted all this. All right. Let's try it again. So we've got to find a missing block here. Uh, I am aware of New Zealand Story. Never played it. Looked like a, the cutest game ever. I definitely want to play that. It looks pretty cool. Very colorful. Give me that. So I definitely want to play that game. Is that on a Genesis? Is it Genesis, right? Was it multi-platform? Prox PL, how you doing? Yeah, there's a lot of cool games out there that I'm yet to play. You believe I never played Mega Man? You believe I never played a 3D Zelda game? Just never happened. We're gonna we're gonna fix that. What do you mean you don't play? You didn't play. It just didn't happen. Dude. Relax. You played every game ever ever made. You ever play Astroneer? I play Astroneer. Not jumping up there anymore. No At that time that. Did I ever come here? No. That time of our life is, is gone. We're never going to do that mistake again. Maybe just ignore them. They'll, maybe they'll go away. They'll tire themselves. There you go. Okay. Be wise, be wise here. Oh, 
I lost a lot? I didn't know the fucking thing is a lottery. You took... I'm gonna lose it. I'm gonna lose it. I'm gonna lose it. I'm losing it. I'm losing it. I'm gonna lose it. I'm gonna lose it. Took a life away from me. The fucking thing is a gamble. I, I thought it was a... So that's why I got on a queue one time and three another time. The placard, it took a life away from me. It, okay. Thank, uh, fuck you very much. Okay. Yeah, no, I needed a boost today, thank you. Thank you for instead of giving me lives, you take, you take, take, take one away. I, that's what I needed. Will you calm down? Took a life away. <laughs> okay. over the fucking place. I'm doing good on the race today. I think I'm doing I'm doing fine. Shit, 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 shit. So there's a boss again. We got a lot of weapons here, but I, I don't think you can hurt it. The, the thing. I gotta really think about what I'm doing here because I'm not finding the, the goddamn blocks that I, I need to find here. I, it's, I sort of been everywhere. I don't. I wonder if piano artist is still watching this, but I haven't tried, I think, this one here, and it didn't do it a thing. So let's do that one first. Maybe, fuck you! Maybe, fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck, relentless! It's fucking relentless! It's relentless! There was no time to do nothing. Oh, with this shit again. With this Balani again. Oh, I mean, fuck me. Ah, you're in a fuck. What are the stars? I don't know what they are. God, if I had a jar of preserves here. Damn it! Why are you jumping? It doesn't do anything! Stop! Fuck! Come on, health. I gotta just bit my tongue too. Shut up! Motherfucker! It's personal. Come here. I don't care about the fucking game. Come here, you little shit. Come here, you little motherfucker. Get in here. Get in here. Okay, I need to calm the fuck down. I need to calm the fuck down. And I didn't kill the fucking fly. Piano artist. So the one I ask you the <sighs> ask you the uh, answer right away. But is there some bullshit there that I'm, I'm missing? Because it's a second block. I, I I have the impression that I jumped on every block. I I tried everything. I'm not. Is there a hint? Is there? What's happening? I'm not sure what's taking place. I need to go back to regain my composure here. I'm still playing Ridge Racer. I'm about it on the 360. The heart cover by YouTube is on par with Mario Kart 150cc. Very stressful. 
Mario Kart 150cc is no joke. Oh no, yeah, I'm I'm pretty sure if you look at look at a speed runner, we'll we'll do it no problem. Yeah, I'm talking about talking about normal regular yak offs like me. Uh, it's tough. Anybody who says otherwise, you're 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 lying, scumbag. It's it's a tough racket. It's not easy. Wow, did I get fucking on the last turn? Just taking my loss away. Not happy with that. Come on, bitch. And you think I hesitated? He hit me. The, the fucking goddamn fireballs hit me every single fucking jump on that turn. Completely, completely ravaged my sphincter there with a the fuckery. Unbelievable. Don't, don't, don't pause me. And don't jump up. We know that now. We learned the hard way. Two, two turns in a row with that mistake. I should come here and jump up, though, if you're not here earlier. The red block will be on the boss platform. Bottom right. Thank you. I jumped on the boss platform, but it was a lap one. I didn't I didn't realize you could jump on the in front of him. Of it. It's not, he's not a human. You know human. Don't shoot! I'm a human. Fuck yourself. Fuck yourself! Here we go. It's a good game. I'm, I'm having fun. I know it doesn't sound like because look, I have outbursts sometimes. I'm an asshole. I know. It happens. Yours happens in private. Mine is happen happening live here. So, what can I tell you? I'm a victim of the circumstances. Okay. All right. Let's uh, calm down. Thank you, piano artist. Uh, don't know why I didn't think about jumping in front of him. Let's see the fucking lot. Give it. Steal my lives. Uh, gave me two. Good. Never know what you're gonna get. Shoot already! Oh my god, it's gonna get me. Okay. So it looks like the, the stopwatch here loses its power after a couple of turns, because... Oh no, now. He's doing it now. So, I need the star. I, why? I don't know. It does something. Something I'm not aware of. Fuck you. Hey, buddy boy, sit and spin. It does something. Yeah, didn't think of jumping, like, into the boss. I, 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 why, why didn't think of that? Like, under, right? You didn't try to ever block. You're alive. Well, today's the day. We're doing it, and we're doing it live. Get the bolo. I don't know. Are weapons useful here? And then the capacity, maybe, after it turns into, uh, like, a normal thing. Don't do it. A normal thing, you, you're able to hit him. We'll see. We will see. Good, good. Fine one. Prepare... The slingshot looks like to be, because I'm going to go on the limp here and, says, and say, because they give me the least amount of ammo, it's the most powerful one, right? Uh, didn't think of jumping on the boss's platform. Why, why would I, why would I be that way? Why wouldn't I not? Yeah, try that. Get off me. Get off me, scumbag! Okay. Oh my god. It's, it's relentless. But now we know that one. Okay. We're... We're getting there. You gotta... You gotta pay more attention. Sometimes I'm disappointed in myself with my lack of the creativity. Like, problem solving sometimes. Like, you're trying the same thing. Okay, granted, I jumped on, on every block I could find, but why, why didn't I think for some reason... To not jump on, on that one. Like, 
the ones on the boss. I don't, I guess I assume that if you jump there, you die. And I jump on the left one, so it, the thought has crossed my mind, but not on the bottom ones. For some reason, I, I, I don't know, I think it was the space is in, is in relation to where the boss is situated. No, don't jump, you never jump. The jumping, you can't jump forward. Please stop, you're not playing Mario, dude. God damn. Sometimes I'm just not getting it. Yeah, I didn't think of jumping on that platform. Why, why is that? I'm gonna get to the root of the problem here. Yeah. Okay, let's try it again. And I don't have hearts. I don't have enough hearts. I'm not. I'm. I'm you, you, you gotta. Come on, dude. Come on, dude. It's kind of rough, huh? It's kind of fucking rough, man. Nonsense. Okay, I like the heart. Give it to me. That's good. Try not to lose a lot. I need to get in there with a lot of hearts. Don't jump. I nearly jumped forward again. Don't seem like I'm capable capable of learning here sometimes. There you go. Okay, that's good. Get the extra ones. Good, good. That fucking fly. Stay the fuck away from me. There we go. I'm feeling this one here. This might be the this might be the one. Get out. Get out. Crash. Oh no. Okay. Good. That's good. That was good. Don't fall here. You know what I hate when you do all that and then you fall and send the trigger like this. Not today, no. Okay, good. Yeah, I'm gonna rush. I don't know. I'm not understanding the, the dodge here, to be honest. Okay, maybe. Oh, shit. Come on. Daga! No! Passed. Passed. Not that, you know, not that hard. I don't know why I had so much trouble with it. Man. Feels good, man. Feels good. I don't know if it can fall here, but I'm, I'm being very careful. Yeah. Ah, uh, finally. Kind of this massive barrage of the... Yeah, I think, yeah, when they, they throw... Yeah! <laughs> they throw the things, you gotta just avoid them. Yeah, save first. Never know what solve that. This is the, the NES has crashed here on stream before for me. Gallows, 1886. Just follow, thank you. Welcome in. Yay, good luck. Thank you. I'm gonna take a look around here and relax. Take in the, the sides, you know? Good shit. Oh, don't worry. I'm not gonna end the stream now. I'm gonna still stream here. We're gonna we're gonna go on to the next one. I'm um, enjoying myself here. Good times playing the NES. I think every couple of hours, or as I think, is best to just uh, stand up and you know walk about a bit. Trying to read grim grim. Dream Reaper. Dream Reaper. Thank you for following. And welcome in, everyone. And thank you, piano artist, for the help, too, as well. And Master Pycelle, everyone. Smoke break. Yeah, I have a smoke break. What's the fucking hurry, man? The streams are fucking gigantic in, in length, you know? Let me let me have my smoke. Let me have my mom. And... Oh, that's right. Thank you, Salamander. Thank you, Green Reaper. 
Good to see you. Where's my damn Coke? Oh, there he is. Good shit, man. I can't awake already. Oh, not yet. Okay. Yeah, brakes is what keeps you going. See, this is the time I'm happy I don't have the view count. Because this is the way it works, right? The way I understand it. So let's say you have, I don't know, man. I don't know how many views I have. Don't don't even tell me. Fuck it. I, let's say I have I uh, have a good view count, right? Which is, for me is like what? I, I, let's say I have 24 people watching right now. Just pitch a number. So you go on a smoking break and you see it's like 23, 22, 20. 18. They keep going down, like, because you're not playing the fucking game. You're having a break. And then you go like, oh, I gotta pay me. And now you, you're letting the numbers dictate what you're doing. And so that's why, that's why I don't like it. So I'm like, I'm gonna have my break, and whoever leaves, leaves, and that's fine. It don't make a difference in the long run. Unless you're going for partner, and you're, you're doing those numbers, you know, which for me is, will that ever happen? I don't know. Probably not. But, you know, but I think even then, I think even a partner thing, I'm going to take it at once. I, if I was to apply for partner ever, if I was ever to get up there, I, like, again, I'm not saying I will. I'm not going to grind like a crazy man here to do that. I'll do streams, you know, plenty of them. Uh, it looks stressful, you know, to be mining the numbers, and I, I don't need any more stress in my life, so I'm just going to let the chips fall there to me. So I, I need to be aware of the numbers at some point if uh, I'm to apply for partner, but that's going to be tricky, right? Because I think you need seven to five. So I think I'm going to wait until I'm well above that and safe and then apply and don't, don't have any bullshit of worrying about it and fuck it. So I think even if I watch, if I get to the point where this worst kind of like, kind of safe, looks like it's safe, I'm still not going to do it. I want to be above that if I ever get there once again. And then I'll do it so I don't have to worry about it and keep the fucking numbers and be like, oh my god, because I, I don't I don't want to do that. Hey, Jerome, how you doing? Female streamer puts a little... I saw that. I saw, too, a, a thing that... It was, um... What was it? Some art. Show some art. And, and that was like a... Um, a picture. So it was the likes, right? So, just some art. Look good, got some likes, and then the same art, but a uh, hot chick holding it. <laughs> Gone viral. <laughs> That's the way it is, you know. BC Boys is see this Laker music. Yeah, I don't know BC Boys. I, I know they exist, but I, I don't. I can't say I know their music. I think I heard, and I, I don't think it was for me to be honest. Was it? I don't think so. Mr. Goddard says, agree, I think it's the ideal attitude to have. Well, thank you. That's the attitude I've always had. When I started this, I expected no views at all, and I got views. And, you know, you got to, at some point, you got to be like, uh, at, at what point are you going to be satisfied with what you have? You know? I don't, I, to be honest, I don't know what partnership does. I know is out there. I, like, I congratulated John Carr Dave, Bradio, who's another friend of the channel here, is going forward. But I'm not sure what it entails, what what happens, what is in there for you. It's, I'm, I'm not, I haven't looked it up, to be honest. I wonder if there's, there's going to be something special. Did they send you cookies or something? I don't know. Uh, official past team lead yesterday a bit anxious, otherwise all is well. Oh, you're doing well out there. I saw you post you about the N64 stuff. And don't worry, your stuff is going to be sent here. I got to do the taxes today. And we're going to pack up your stuff. Like I said, I'm going to send... I think I'm going to send the stuff that you need first. And then I worry about my consoles on my day off. And then I'll send that then. Free prostate exam with partnership. Well, then I, I, want, I want in. <laughs> CRT Racks America. Fuck yeah. Yeah, I know that I, I don't want to mold my content here to fit numbers. That's like, oh, there's one thing I don't want to do. Like, come come time for me to play this here. I was talking about this earlier, so I got this here, right? I know a lot of people played. I never played it. I want to play it. I want to. I want to see how it, it's hard, right? So, I want to. I want. I want to play. The point here is, I want to. So pretty much like this. 
Why am I myself here and I'm, I play those games? Well, I'm pretty much do what I, I'm doing what I would do in private. So before this, I would just sit in the living room and play for many hours. The games that I would choose, I would pick a console. Oh, this is fun. So I'm pretty much just streaming that. That's the whole idea here. And of course, I had the pageantry with the console on the CRT. I wanted to share that. So that's pretty much it. Just so whatever I want to play in real life, I'm gonna play play it here. So I'm not playing like ooh ooh. Do you think that that? I don't think Demon Souls is gonna be a hit. But everybody has an angle. So the, the promise I make you here as a, as a viewer is that this will always be the thing. So it'll be a CRT, the console. This here, this is this is new. I didn't even have a webcam at first. Well, I had a webcam. I just. You know, I, I didn't know how to fit in with the content. I'm not afraid to show on my face before, I just, it didn't fit in with, with all the, so if you, if you watch my archive on YouTube, the old stuff, it didn't have a, I started with Condemn, I think, to do a, the, the webcam, because, cut why? Because it worked. So I thought, mm, I could I could use Jerome here, on the, here in the chat. He gave me this here, PVM, it has burn in. So I was like, I could use that for, for that, right? I, and I can't feel bad about it, because it has burn in anyways. And there it is, you know? I did use this here as a main set one time when I played uh, Devil's Crash on the PC Engine or Devil, Cra Devil Crash. Uh, and the game is so busy, and that game is awesome. The game is so busy that it, the, the, the burn, burn in didn't matter. You know? Demon Souls, woof. That's gonna be good. I will, I will, I will get the FW9. No, FW900. No, the BVM, D14, because it's 720, there's no reason to use the FW900. And it needs a Windows anyways. So yeah. And the internet has been holding up beautifully. Yeah, so here, yeah, pretty much, I just play whatever I want to play. And I got a... Cat Lady Kayla, Raiden. Thank you, and welcome in. Raiders of the Lost Bark. Welcome to La Casa Griffin. No, La Casa CRT Rex. Uh, and Chase, 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 Chase. I, I don't know if you've seen it, because you sent... We, we'll do Demon Souls, Chase. You're, you're, the CD, the discs that you sent me are not going to be ignored, but right here, man. I, I bought it. It's, it's happening. I don't know when. Not, not right now, but it'll happen. Do the BCM for Demon Souls. See, that's um, that's the kind of, the kind of thing I'm talking about. I don't even, I don't know what BCM is. Probably, Y'all probably know it. I, I don't know it. So I think there'll be a lot of that. People, people are warn me too that there's going to be a lot of backseaters, annoying backseaters, aggressive backseaters, and uh, no, not here, man. No. Unsolicited, unsolicited backseating for me can go suck a big bag of elephant dicks. I'm not allowing it here, and uh, there'll be the band hammer. The band hammer will come, and uh, I want to have fun with the game. You know, if I need help, I'll just ask for help. Little hints here every now and then, but I, I prefer like if I ask for help, you know, or you know, just figure it out. Is there another game people would like to see CRT Rex on the PS3? Oh, the the BVM. Oh, sorry. That's okay. I like backseating if I ask for it. Same here. Backseating, unsolicited backseating is annoying. And some people can't read the room. They keep, like, aggressively. Like, right? And I've seen the big streamers. They all ban. Uh, no, Max, the, he gives a timeout. I'm going to tell you something about timeout. Uh, the bot has a thing that it does a timeout. I don't believe in timeout. I think if somebody comes here and they're a massive day, I just ban them permanently. Good, goodbye, perma ban. You got one, one, that's it. I'm not, you know. I don't think people that, well, that, that have a horrible, nasty attitude, they're gonna change it within the stream. Why am I doing that? Did they do for the numbers? I don't know, maybe a timeout. It might work for some people. I don't know, I don't wanna mess, up, mess around with timeout. Timeout shit, I don't wanna do, be doing none of that. Because sometimes I'll be stuck, yeah. But you can always ask, and guess what? You know, the reality of things, I have the internet here. I could look, look it up, you know, as well. Some, let's say I ask the chat, and there's like two people in here. They're, not, they're, they're like, oh, fuck you. you. You don't like backseat. I'm not going to backseat your ass. Fair enough. <clears throat> just, go, just go online and look it up. I try to avoid it. I, I really hate looking stuff up if I'm playing a game. I feel like I failed the game, and the game failed me. So it's overall, overall just a failure altogether. <laughs> so yeah 
So when I play Demon Cells, I don't care who's the expert is in the chat. Shut up. Don't don't bother me, man. So that's that's enough. And thank you, kindly. Did she get a shout out? Cat Lady Kayla. And thank you kindly, ma'am. Oh, she got a shout out. Excellent. They do exist. Well, that's true. I do. I believe in them. I, I don't believe in using them. I guess. <laughs> Poor choice of words. I see the timeouts. I don't. I don't. I know. I don't get it. I don't get a lot of stuff. So there's a. So I think there was a fella earlier that said there's a castle. Don't don't go in there, right? We, we're going in there. It's a proper castle. Castle music and everything. The rent. The Renaissance fair. Some say a queen of peerless beauty lives in this castle of Shikola. But only women make me enter the I know. Uh, unfortunately, unfortunately, when you watch a video, it did spoil for me a tiny bit. Uh, I wasn't sure if I was going to play the game, but it did spoil a few. So you got to dress as a woman to get in here. I know that much, unfortunately. That got spoiled for me a tiny bit. Uh, seek help in a fortune teller's camp. So I think you got to go this way here. Now, I remember a few things. I don't remember everything, but I remember there was something cryptic around here somewhere. Scotch Malice is a good, cool monitor. I like the button. Yeah, this here's an early 1980s CRT TV. RF. RF only. Took me 16 to 18 hours to beat the first time. That's not too bad. I, I'm expecting a lot more. I'm, ex I'm expecting when I do Demon Souls to... To be a week to lose half my subscribers, uh, two thirds of my viewership, and that's that's a price I'm willing to pay to play the games that I want. Look, you want to do what you want, that's fine, but there's always a cost. I'm a fortune teller. Sorry, but I can't help you. I dropped my crystal ball into a pond at Ghost Village, so we need to go to Ghost Village apparently. Yeah, a lot of buttons here too. You can open a panel here. Cut on YouTube was asking, and you can tune. This is how you tune the RF to your like in here. Dial it in, and it's weird that when you open the door, it gets, it goes weird. I know it looks, it looks like it's better there, but it, it just shifts a bit. It's a bit weird. Yeah. Do I have too much brightness here? Maybe turn it down a tiny bit. Too much color. It's fine. It'll be fine. Uh, yeah, I watch a Maximilian dude, uh, very rarely, like, live. I tend to catch him on YouTube. I tend to be on YouTube more, to be honest. Oh. Oh, just actions. Okay, let's look for a ghost village here. And I remember... Oh, shit. What we got here? Hey, hey! Too bad he didn't pick up the other one, you piece of shit. I can't believe I left. I left a heart behind. I think it's gonna cause me trouble when I go find a fight the uh, final boss. I don't think it's gonna be good. I think it's gonna be kind of fucked up. Too bad I can't I can't go back anymore. Though. I can't be crying over the spilled milk though. But it's gonna be a, a bit of a more challenging. So let's look for that ghost village. So yeah, Maximilian dude is funny. Goes like, "Don't be aggressive. Do not be aggressive." <laughs> like on the pin message. I'll pin a message here when I'm playing a game that uh, I'm already wanting. And some folks, unfortunately, puts them off to streaming some games all together. I remember Mike Matei saying that he won't stream Metroid. Metroid because of that, because the backseaters are out of control. They're very anal about how he should play the game. I don't know. For me, I'm just going to tell him to fuck off. Keep telling him to fuck off and keep playing the game. What are you going to do? You know? I'm most polite at first. I say, if you could please refrain from doing that. You know, that's... Is this a ghost village? It is. So yeah, you can always strap a light in the first, but it doesn't always work, but you know, what are you gonna do? I think, yeah, I think there's gonna be a lot of bands. Dennis says, uh, go ahead and explore the castle, such but graveyard north is. Northwest. Well, I'm there right now. I don't know if I watched Red Deer. Yeah, no, I got the gist. They told me it would be in a ghost village. Is this like a Zelda? Which one is Zelda? Just got a 
This one is colored different. Oh! Oh! Different color. That's a dungeon, eh? That's the next one. Y'all getting tired of this music yet? I ain't. Yeah, I, th I think, from what I understand, I think the Demon Souls, when I get to stream that, it'll be a lot of, a lot of hatred and bans, but, man, what are you gonna do? I'm not gonna, I'm not, I'm not gonna not play the game. I wanna play the fucking game, and that's, that's just that, you know? I wonder how dark it is. Darker games, dark 3D games are harder than this, this thing here. It's tough. It's very tough. All right, let's go. New dungeon. I'm seeing what I'm up against now. Dogs, devil dogs. Yeah, but it's never that way, is it? What's that? Now this here looks awesome. Do you see the reflection? That look cool. All right. Groovy. Earthworm Jim. Definitely play that. Y'all ever seen the Earthworm Jim cartoon? It's actually quite good. It holds up quite nicely. I was watching with my kids the other day, and it was pretty good. It's it's good for me. Because a lot of times you're watching kids kids content, it's like, you're not into it. You're watching for the sake of the kids, right? But uh, that one, I actually uh, was surprised how much I liked it. Still holds up. Watch the Donkey Kong 1, 2... The first one is already weird. It has his head shaved, and his head is a uh, shape that is abnormal. So it's basically, you know, Donkey Kong, right? Donkey Kong, the, the main guy, not the old-fashioned one, the, the Donkey Kong Country version from Rare, right? So he has a tuft of hair coming up top of his head. So I don't know what what gives, what happened there, but in the cartoon, which is like early 3D, they shaped his hair because it is like they're trying to take his powers. But then, the problem is, his head, the, the, the hair, right, the, the, look, he has like two tufts of hair going up, right? So when they shaved that, that, that was actually part of his head, and it looked very bizarre. I don't, look, watch the first episode of Donkey Kong Country in its entirety, and you know what I mean. you see it. It looks very weird. I went into the comments, and nobody talked about it. So apparently, I was the only one freaked out about it. And I, I, I actually watched that cartoon back in the day. I did not uh, have access to Earthworm Jim uh, back in the day. You never played in my neck of the woods, but I, uh, I did watch the uh, Super Mario Bros. 3. Also, no, Super Mario Super Show. Yes, grew up with it. But not, not every show, so I missed out on a lot of shows. Donkey Kong, I remember watching. I, I... Some cool different music here. Uh... Can I spare the heart, or does it make? I don't. I don't have a need for it right now. I see. I see the. No, I think I'm gonna need it to, to get in here. Mm. Yeah, the, the that one made sense. You know, the stone, the graveyard stone, thing, because it had a, a different collar, right? A different collar. It wasn't the same collar as everything else, so. It makes sense. You go like, ooh, what's this here? You know what doesn't make sense? Going into a graveyard at midnight and dropping a garlic, you know, randomly, and then having a guy to come out with a silk bag. You know what doesn't make sense? Uh, kneeling at the end of a stage, at a d dead end, and you, know, you can't go anywhere anymore, with a, a certain jewel, and then the tornado comes in. But I still love the game, though. But if you don't know those things, man, you're kind of fucked. <laughs> How the fuck would you even play it? Oh, you can't play it. Just... Oh, it just kicked me out, huh? Oh, so it's a maze, is it? Is it? Yeah. So I've done... You're done taking a wrong turn. I reckon. Yeah, I tell it was the right thing to do. To not, it's, it's hot in this room here right now. Let me tell you. Did they jump here. So this is there's a secret here. The sun, sun is happening here. 
Okay, something is, something's up here. Well, let's try not to take the same path, I guess. Kill this thing. Okay. Come here. Hmm. Just hope you don't have to kill every enemy or something. Oh. Oh. Oh no. Okay. You gotta go that way. Alright. Okay. Ah, uh, la 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 la. I'm gonna try my best not to repeat the same thing. Oh, I saw it. I saw it. Uh huh. Huh? The fu oh, invisible enemies. The fuck? There's ghosts in here. So he has sort of a maze here. Gotcha, so we open. No! The star! I don't know what it does, but I wanted it. Shit. There we go. What the hell is this here? Some kind of special power. Don't know what that is. Got to, got to read the manual. Read that manual today. Give me the bionics. Shit, man. Come on. What the fuck am I to do here? What the? She's kind of fucked up. I hate invisible animals in every, every game. Fucking Dome 64 had that shit. I think I played another game recently. I had some invisible animals. Who wants that? Wow. It's kind of too much, huh? Don't you think it's too much? I think it's a bit too much. I think invisible animals are kind of bullshit. Regrettable decision. Come on. Come on! Get, get down here. Son of a bitch, I'll go up there. Uh, okay. Come down here, fuck. God damn it! Uh, okay, I got you. No. Got him. Okay, gotta keep an eye on the... Here, you gotta really think before you do jump, you know? Gotta check everything. Uh, low health alert, is, uh, I think it's something that most people agree is bullshit. And nobody likes it, right? Yet it, kept, it kept being made somehow. Is there people that like the low health alert? Because it's, uh, <laughs> yeah. I know a lot of iconic games have it, like Zelda and whatnot. But, uh, hmm. A lot of people have trouble understanding some game they love might have a flaw or something unpleasant. I always go back to this life puzzle on Resident Evil 4. I hate that shit. I love that game, but I hate that fucking specific part of the game. It's, it's trash to me, and I don't want it. it. Doesn't make the game bad, but, you know, not everything's perfect. I want to make sure I click on every... I, I hit every block here. Because you, you never know what the secret is here in this game. You just, you got, it's got to be, make sure you're not in a hurry. And, and before you jump, you know what you, where you had it, you know? No, I want to really make sure that I, I got everywhere here. See, see what I'm talking about? You don't need to be rushing here. You really don't. Oh! Fucker. Oh! The, 
Ah, uh, the, the item. This is... You've... Okay. Yeah, it might be too late though. My health is, is fucked. How? Come on, quick, 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 quick. Too bad about my health though. Fucked up. Does that seem high? Is it incredible? It's just perfect fit here. It's extra closer than what it looks in. Oh, heart, I need that. It actually, it actually is, because of the angle here, it looks like this is a tiny bit higher, but it's not really. It is really the same height. In fact, the TV is a bit higher, too. It just works. Hey, Cool Runner's here. How you doing, amigo? You doing all right? Got our shells back, finally back to some Nintendo here. Nintendo stuff. Now, now you're playing with power. Welcome in, Raiders. Cool Runner. What have you been up to uh, this fine evening, my good sir? Or morning, rather. We'll, we'll jump on the blocks here. Clean and repaste it, my Xbox 360 limb. Oh, were you having some problems with it? I got one here. It's not the Red Ring of Death, but it's giving me giving me a hard time. That's for sure. I think it just needs a good clean, but yeah, maybe doing a repaste. I got some Arctic Silver here somewhere. You gotta put that to good. Oh, I don't know where it is. Though. I gotta fucking get into it. Chill cleaning stream. Oh, good shit. You gotta take care of your hardware. You know. I don't think there's anything else here for me. Uh, it's good to take care of your hardware. I uh, I got a few jobs that I need to do here myself. Hmm. In regards to maintaining everything, you know. New thermal paste, yep. Never touch cooler, the cooler cleaning it. I gotta do I gotta do some of that. I did I did maintain some of my uh, original Xboxes, but. Problems I have right now. I have an Atari Jaguar that is missing a. So I came, I came from here. So I got, I rec Oh, bullshit! I'm not doing it again. I already did it. Okay, this is new. Atari needs. Uh, I bought another console though. Killed it. No, no, I didn't. I didn't want to go in there. Uh, I gotta repeat everything again. Oh shit. That's the brutal. So basically, okay, the gimmick here is as follows from what I gather. The easier way is the bullshit way is gonna kick you out. So it's the hard way. But the more you come back here, I guess the more you learn about which one is the right way or the bad or the wrong way. <clears throat> Get an axe clamp removal to it. I think I have one here somewhere. Beats me where it is. But I heard that it's kind of essential, yeah. I might have one here, I think. You know, I'll buy another one. In fact, I'm gonna go open a tab here. Yeah, put that on go. Make sure I get one. I think it'll be easier than finding that shit in the shed. There you go. So I'll remember put a little little tab here. Yeah, I heard is uh makes everything easier. It's kind of a nightmare. But there's a thing. Sometimes you're gonna do a mod job or something, and life is hell because you ain't got the right tools. It really is. What the? F oh, shit. My goodness. Got you. Got your friend. You alone now. Are you scared? There's something, something wrong with, something wrong with Aster. Seven dollars worth having a backup. Uh, yeah, a uh, hundred percent agree. If you don't, if you don't have the right tools, and life is gonna be miserable. I remember before doing soldering jobs and with shitty ass tools, you know. And life is just a nightmare. Did I get everything here? As far as skulls, yeah, I think so. 
They don't have the right tools and you're kind of fucked. No, I didn't, asshole. Come here. Come down here. Come on, man. What are you doing? Fucking annoying prick. Man. Some of the enemies are fucking annoying here. All because I touched a fucking flight of stairs. Can you believe it? That's all. How'd that happen? That was my... That was my sin. Touch some stairs by mistake. Kicked out of the fucking level. Damn you. So yeah, it's all about the hard bits here. Okay, let's go. No, y'all gonna die. And the cool thing, you can shoot while while in the air, so that's pretty good. Pretty damn good. Okay. Where do you allegedly keep those death dogs of yours? Hmm? There you go. Activate. And, and see, and then you, the first time I came in here, I went straight up. Big fucking mistake. See that thing flashing here? You gotta go down there. So if you go up here, it just kicks you out. So basically, from what I gather here, the easy way is shit. You need it's something else hidden in here. The hard way is the only way. I love playing Nintendo, man. I just love it. Oh, sh can, can I have the thing? So I think the ghosts are sort of static here. That's why moving around doesn't do anything. I think you used to... Nah, no. No, thank you. My throw red man to show how he hit them. They do a little, a little stop. It's a little, it's a little detail, but it makes all the difference you know, with this game. It's a charming, charming little, little game here. <clears throat> You're gonna need this here for the uh, hidden ghost. <coughs> Sorry. No. Uh, use it because health is fucking important and maybe try to memorize where they at. So I'm gonna come back here next time and try to go to... Oh no, they move. Oh shit. And here's another quirky little thing with this game. You don't... When you turn, you don't go uh, attacking right away. Sorry, when you turn, you, you do this. And then you you go. So here, if you couldn't do that, it'd be quite tricky. If you're going forward, attacking, because you're gonna you're gonna get hit. I wish you could know when to use one without getting hit first. That's true. It sort of reminds me of uh, if y'all play. Well, you were an MSX man. You ever play CRT for the original Metal Gear? I have on emul emulation on the PS2. So there's a part. That you gotta get, you gotta, you gotta go in, inside this room, right? And it's full of poison. And you get in there, and you take, you take damage. And then you get a radio, the, the, the colonel, or whatever, it calls you on the radio. And you tell, ooh, I forgot, you gotta put the, the gas mask here. And then he equips the gas mask. But next time you go in there, it don't matter. You gotta wait for that call. So basically, every time you get in there, is a free hit. On the original Metal Gear. Uh, I haven't played it yet, but Chase redeemed. It's the only Metal Gear I knew until I played Metal Gear Solid on the PS1 at one time. I think it was before I even met you. Uh, so yeah, you, you you take so you you know you see that part. It's a good game. I, I like that game. I played it to the end. It was good. Ugh, pain in the ass. Pass. Gotcha. And here, 
I'll just read it. Just think before you jump. That's all. Gotcha. Very easy to make harsh decisions here. That's it. If you're hearing the thing, it's just a gate. Okay, right away. Right away. Use that. There you go. I can't believe I, I got kicked out just because I touched the fucking stairs. So I think there's hearts here, right? Is that it? Yeah, that's good. I'm not usually in choosing neat games, but I'm gonna give it a chance. It's not that bad because it's not 3D. It's kind of simple on that part. Das Alien Geek, how you doing? Good to see you. Yeah, man, it's, it's a good game. But you know, do I need to do, maybe, trying to save one of those things, right? You can't hurt him. I'm out of here, I'm not spending another one. Okay, so I gotta be careful here. I touched, see what happened here. I came here last time and I touched a fucking, I fucked up, you know. <clears throat> Leave that there, I think. Right? I don't want to touch that accidentally. Not now. I'm gonna check every block here. It's, it's a very pleasant little, little little game here with lots of good music. Huh? You don't say. Do I need to kill that fucking slug thing? Just gotta be careful. You don't. Yeah, you, know, you can go up there. You get up there, you get kicked out. Careful. Oh, I tried to jump two of them. Is there something hidden? Use the thing, I guess. Wasted it. Yeah, well, I gotta find out somehow. Looks like I'm a bit stuck here on this one. You can go up there up there on the stairs because you're gonna, they're gonna kick you out of the fucking level let me think here i think i'm pretty sure that i clicked every block here just looking for clues here is that can you jump here is that is that what that is no that don't make no uh, talk about here Taking a look around, relax. <clears throat> I'm, I'm trying to I'm see if we can jump here, but I'm not sure if that's just wall. It looks like it is, to be honest. Let me open this fucking door here and let some some of my air come in here, because the fucking CRTs are kind of infernal right now. Let me see, I hope that doesn't affect your mic for the live. I get a little bit brighter here. Uh, just opening the door a tiny bit, let some let some of this fucking heat escape the room. And God damn it, it's too bright in here. Okay, just give me a second. I'm gonna leave that. Let me have a, a tiny quick break here. Just let leave the uh, yeah the sun is blasting here. That's why. So the CRT will look like shit for just a hot second. I need to get some of this hot air out of this, this room here, kind of bit. Okay. And while that's happening, I'll just think about. This year. This year. <clears throat> okay. Look, I might as well go take a leak, actually. Yeah. Piano artist says, Enter the passageway where the slug was? I, I did that last time, and it, it, it sent me back to the graveyard. What are you on about? That was the mistake that I made. I, so I filed. I mean, it kicked me out of the, of the level. It looks pretty easy. It's not. If that's the case, it's not even in you with the rest of the stage, which you have to go and do something. And this one is just killing this lug. There's no easy way out here. Just one way out. You sure about that? I'm gonna go take a leak here. Just give me a second.
but... Alright. Let's see what uh, this is here. Behind us, look, not the stairs. What in the world? <clears throat> Behind us, there's a there's an action in there. What? Say what? I'm just getting trying to get comfortable here. Behind us, lug. What in the hell? Hidden passageway. Oh, that's a fucking hidden one. That's a hidden passageway if I ever seen one, because there's not a fucking indication of anything right there. I don't see a fucking thing. Right here? There's no... That's fucked. How did anybody find that shit out when they were played the first time when they were kids back in the 80s? Because I don't fucking understand how in the world anybody would find... I don't think they would have found that. Maybe by accident. Right? kind of scratching a little bit. Not seeing any indication of anything in there. Well, let's go take a look then. I'm just kind of fucked. There's something in there. Alright. Think before you jump. Remember the, the rules here. Okay, so... Okay, just... I'm... I like the game. I really like the game, but this here... This is hot garbage. This is no good. Because if you, if you touch those stairs... Right, I've been here. Kill this luck. If you touch those stairs... I guess it's a game of this. Okay, I get it. It's you got to discover. Now back in the day, it's a hood and a holler. Cause you go here, like what the hell's going on? You start to try everything. I mean, I love Resident Evil One, Two, Three, but you got to be clicking everything. Things are hidden, so it's part of game and whatever. Yeah. I uh, I would have suffered here quite a bit. I wouldn't. I don't think I would have figured that out in in one lifetime. Well, thank God you're here, to be honest on that. See, this here is... It, it is disappointing to me a tiny bit, though. I like... It. You should have a tiny bit of an indication or something. Like, so far, the game has given you, uh... Deeper levels of, like, green, right? You can look at it and like, oh, there's something in there. Uh, this one here, this one was a stinker. This was no good. This was a slide puzzle of Resident Evil 4 low point of the, of the game here for me. That's for sure. And I still have the break over Leon. Well done. Is the... Wait a minute. Just so you get to see without, without the break overlay, right? Was it here? Unless I'm missing something on RF, I, I think I see a dip... Kinda? Is it? A different color? A tiny bit? Did I? I'm trying to see if maybe the light here, the light came here. Look. Yeah, CRT is on like light. Neither does your flat panel. It's like playing Zelda. Zelda has a lot of bullshit cryptic stuff to it. That's, that's for sure. I love the game, but it, it does have cryptic garbage. I'm trying to see if there's any difference between this here and, and this one. Barely, I guess. You have to look real hard here to see anything. I'm, I'm not seeing it, though. Hmm. And the problem, I, I think, okay, if they didn't put the stick... Okay, I'm sorry, I know I'm insisting upon this here. But the only way I think, with no indication here, I, I think the problem I have with this bit here is that the stairs that kick you out of the level are here, right, right here, and you can't touch them almost. And if you touch them, it's over. So I think if this wasn't here, this was somewhere else, separate, and this here was like, uh, I would have designed so it's like, okay, the way I would have done this here, and I know, Captain Hind Hindsight, the hero of the modern age, but I would have done that, I would have extended this a tiny bit one more here, so they look odd, like sort of like that boss, there was a block here that didn't sort of belong. 
I would have made, I would have made, I would have get, gotten the st stairs out of here, put it somewhere else here. I would have extended this here to look different in the spark. So it's like, why is there a dead end that goes through the edge of the screen? That's how I would have handled it. Personally, you know? It's a bit, it's a bit like the retro version of padding, right? Because it's, okay. There we go. Touch everything. There you go. Got to touch everything. Uh, how is this here, though? Is there a secret passageway on the other side? <clears throat> I could I could use a couple more hearts. Investigate. Is it? I'm just curious here. Sorry, I'm going back here because I'm... Oh, uh, maybe I'll get get the chew jump ability. I know you get you get that later. You can jump over two blocks, right? Maybe that's what it was. I, I was gonna go back here and see if there's a passageway. Fuck it, I want to uh, take a look. No, there's there's not. I. I Kinda like I kind of sort of see it. It's pretty, I don't know. Maybe on RGB, I guess. As a kid in the eighties and nineties, uh, that kind of shit did piss me off. To be honest, it, even then, because like, okay, some of it was like amazing because you get a sense of how amazing it is. Oh, wait a minute. That's all you do. Oh. Oh no. You're kidding. So there was. I, I was half right. I put the ghost there. Come on. You're giving it hard in to put a fucking ghost in there. Huh? Nearly went for the fucking stairs. Nearly. Nearly made a fatal mistake here. Okay. Good luck with that. Good night, CR Team 4K. Thank you. I'll be playing it tomorrow some more. Yeah, that one was a, a bit bullshit. What just happened here? Did I open the door? Is that it? Don't open that door. Don't kick me out. Of oh, don't kick me out. Okay, I saw it. Oh god. I think the thing that fucks you up here is when they put... ...bats as well. Oh shit. You freak. Come on, man. What are you doing? Good? No, you're gonna die too. No, no, no. <clears throat> I think. Yeah, I think that's it. Oh, yeah, I just see your piano. Uh, the... Grab the hearts. <laughs> I got it already, so it's alright. Thank you. It's a vibe, this game, that's for sure. looking good. Uh, see, my skin is reflecting a lot. I'm sorry about that. It's, it's see more in the darker places. Just gotta really think before you jump here. That's all. That's all you have to do. No, don't don't rush. Just focus before. Yep. Don't go too fast. Make sure I hit every block here. There you 
go. Yeah, don't do that, okay. Okay, so this seemed to have opened something. I don't know what it is. I, I, I bet the manor would have helped. I have five of them. Did they do something here? To... Ah! Get your nose, sorry. Hmm. Who's thinking here? Make sure. That, oh. Did I touch this here? I don't do that. No. I know about the item, but I don't know what it does, and I don't want to waste it here. I don't know if that's a. So my theory, that item, that like sort of a lantern, right, kerosene, uh, reveals something. I guess it's worth a try. Yeah, that was a waste, but I don't know the game. I had to do it. This uh, it has gotten a tiny bit cryptic here, this, this level. Just a tiny bit. Not sure. Not sure. This this one here, what it does. Do I need to return or? Huh. Yeah, things got a bit cryptic here. All of a sudden. Waste of that item. Not not sure what that item does. And no idea. <clears throat> All right. All right, settle down. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not sure what you, do I leave this place, I guess? I guess, I, I, I'm gonna leave. Okay. Good. Going back some, going somewhere else, I guess. I'm out of ideas in that room, in, in there. I don't know what you're doing in that room. Past, past, kill, kill everyone else. Le Mumi. Le Mumi. Guys, I'm hinged here. Look for clues somewhere, I suppose. Where are you headed? Oh, oh. Anything that looks different. Okay. We have to go. Okay, can grab those hard. Okay, oh, some more tips here. <clears throat> have to go. Okay, now. So now I have to go back to the dark room and use the lantern. Okay. Wow. Well, so I guess I was half right going back here, so that's good. I want to kill those bats. They displease me greatly. Gonna come at an angle. Ah, gotcha. Okay. Oh, you get more of them. Excellent. Oh. Can you even die here? I don't think so. This is definitely going to be it. Here or here? Oh, you would die if you jump that way. Oh my god, okay. One, okay, S. Gotta remember that. It's going to go. Okay. Oh. Is another one. I can't fucking remember. Bastard. 
There we go. Oh, shit. My last one. Mm, oh, man, come on. Okay. No! Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, it was a fucking wall! Oh my god. It was a wall. Motherfucker. Fucking motherfucker. It was a wall. Shit. Very interesting, very interesting design. Okay. Yeah, they give you just enough here to get by. Don't break. Rick! Oh my god. You ain't got on me, will ya? You ain't got on me. You were shining me on. You were shining. Come on, bitch. God, what a fucking asshole. There we go. They respawn anyways, right? So what's the fucking point of fighting all those assholes? Okay. Nope. But the more you get you to the dungeons here, the more you become familiar and know them. You know? The way it goes. So head on back. I don't have I don't have to put up with this abuse. Yeah, go this way now. Dick. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Damn it. Alright. But now we know a lot more about this level here, that's for sure. Charging me. Reminded me of the... Oh! The goddamn shitty-ass fucking dogs of Resident Evil. Yeah, I made a mistake there. I thought that that was the way to go, but it was a fucking wall, so I got fucked big time. That's that. That's all she wrote. Oh. Kill them all first. I thought I had... I thought I'd done a weird-ass jump or something. My time. It, it was a wall. That's it. I can't tell you how big of a jump it was for, uh, coming from Atari 2600 to a game like this. Crazy. Come to think those, those generational leaps back then, you know? We're coming from the, uh, the Super Nintendo to the N64. Insane, but, but I gotta say Atari... Oh, fuck. I don't have anything here, so suck on my winner. Okay. I don't have that thing. What an asshole! Motherfucker! Oh. I hate him. Oh, look at my health, man. It's fucking over. Maybe I get the, the heart here. Wait a fucking minute. I kind of forgot where I came from, to be honest. Okay, I remember here. Let's try again. They rush you. Counter attack! Alright, let's continue. Let's continue. Let's push on. Come here, I'll pursue you. What? Did you get away with it. Yeah, I'm gonna do some reading of the manual <clears throat> on my time off here. Okay, that's good. 
Yeah, I can see a wise decision for me to change the time. It's so hot in this room here right now. Unbearable. Well, it's not unbearable. It's bearable, but it's not very good, you know? All right, let's continue. Push on. Ugh. Invisible enemies. Where, uh... Where's the things that let me allow me to see ghosts? Did I miss out? I think I missed out. Yeah. I think I did. I hate the mommies because they, they're like trying to fucking ambush me. Fuck! Look at them! They remind me of uh, one episode of Rick and Morty talking about Jerry and how fucking shitty he is and manipulative because he's always... I'm the poor guy, but... He leeches off your fucking energy. That's those mummies. They pretend they're fucking those things that are never gonna get you, but they do. They ambush you. They do everything. You think they're harmless, but they're not. Fucking kill me twice here. What's the problem? Since when I die on the fucking mummies? What's going on here? Jesus Christ. Didn't die a single time on any of them, and now uh, it's a few times already. Ah, shit. Resident Evil. There we go. Ugh. I hate this gimmick. I hate this gimmick. I hate this gimmick. I hate it. I wish I could see where they at. Here they come again. Oh, fucking away, asshole. Die. Die horribly. Okay. Alright. You got it, Chief. There we go. Get your two hearts, huh? Mm. Which way? How come I, I don't have the thing anymore? I hate invisible enemies. How come I don't have the item that lets... Is it the lantern? Where's the item that lets me see the ghost? What's happened? I, I, I thought I had those items. I'm not seeing them again. What am I doing something wrong? Is it the lantern thing? I'm puzzled now. I thought I had a different item. It was a torch. Where's the torch? It was, I, I remember now, it was a torch. Whatever happened to the uh, torch here? I thought I had a torch. Hmm. I'm not impressed. Hmm. I want to beat this level here, if possible. I'll see how, how I can do it before I sign out for tonight. I, I would really would like to beat this dungeon. I don't want to lose my mojo here until not tomorrow. And I'll just make sure that I'm here. I'm in a groove right now. Okay. Come on, Jerry. Oh my God. Pretend I'd be dumb. Eh? There you go. Pretending. Where where are the torches here? I had torches. Now I don't have torches. You might say it's a torture. Welcome to Pine City. Population U. That was my fault, Russian. No. Look at me. I'm, I'm a speedrunner now. Damn doofus. I think my little daughter is awake. Uh, the one year old. I'm up here, you asshole. Not fooling anyone. There you go. Alright. 
Time to go downstairs again. The fucking my, I, I don't know why my health is so fucking low. I, I ain't seen a gem. I ain't seen a gem. Fuck! Where's the torches? I had torches here one time. What happened? Where are they? Where are the tor- Can't get out. Where are they? Where's the torches? I had them and now I got nothing. I can't see the fucking ghosts. It was a time I, I can't remember where I got them. What is this nonsense? I have torches here. Now I don't have them. I don't. Sucks to be you, dog. Okay. Pretty sure I had torches at some point. Add frog 0010. Just follow. Thank you. I had frogs here a minute. Uh, frogs. I had torches a minute ago, and I, I don't have anything no more, and I'm, I'm finding this kind of odd. I can see the invisible ghosts, you know, it, you kind of need to know where they at, right? Losing health here. Okay. Like, like this is kind of fucked. No, I, I had torches, I, right? I've seen the ghost, right? What's going on here? Did I? I thought I had torches here before in the same region. This is kind of... No, I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna... Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Dig it, I'm... I hate you. I hate you so fucking much. Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. Yeah, I'm not feeling the uh, invisible enemy. Every game, every game ever, invisible enemies are bullshit. Sorry, it's just shit. I hate it. I was downstairs. I hate invisible enemies in any game. It's fucking nonsense. Pretty sure I came here with fucking torches before, dude. I don't know, maybe I'm thinking of a different dungeon or. Pretty sure I had torches. But how, how the fuck am I supposed to pass that bit without. get past that without knowing where the ghosts are? Yeah, come, come. Kill all of you. How the fuck am I supposed to go past that bed? The fucking things are invisible. I, I can't see anything. Yes, twerker. Now, use them. I, I ain't got them now. I had them. Those were the torches. Where? What? I didn't see any torches here. I ain't got no torches. There's no torches here right now. Is it up here? Did I open something up here? Or? I don't get it. Nope, not getting that. I'm, I'm trying to remember. I'll go back to the footage once I'm done with the stream. I'm pretty sure I had torches here at some point. But maybe I'm, I'm misremembering things. Somehow. No? I thought I had it. Huh. No. Get him. Yeah, they ambush you here quietly, huh? Cowards. Pretending they're dumb, they're not. Why are you move forward so much? Like, like, what was that? I can't believe I'm having trouble with mummies now. Am I tired? Is that what that is? The one you collected previously continues as usual. I don't understand. I, they should provide you with torches here. This is... They're invisible enemies. You should have the fucking torches. I'm not understanding the logic here. I'm dying a lot. Not now. I, die, I died on the mummy, but... 
You're giving me invisible enemies. You're not, not giving me the tools to, to deal with them correctly. I'm not sure if I'm following here. So I'm supposed to be just taking a bunch of random hits and leave it up to luck. I'm not... Is that it? I'm sorry. This is... No. The torches had previously, so this this dungeon here don't give you no torches. The chest equals torches. I thought they were lanterns. Are they the same fucking thing? I'm not... I thought those were for the dark rooms. The dark torches for the ghosts, like the, tor the, the thin one, right? And that that looks like, like, a, like a lamp, a kerosene lamp or something. This, this one, there's a, del a delay, especially on YouTube, so it'll be hard to know. Which, yeah. What? Mm. So I think I'm, I'm missing something that I, I usually, I got it previously. Is that it? Hmm. Not... Yeah, the problem is the delay. So I'm missing out on something here. I'm gonna... <clears throat> okay, so... So there's gotta be a room here, right? Let me spit out this thing here. Irritate my mouth. Just wonder which room is that? So there's a different room here, and I didn't pick up the stuff. So much sound. You know, usually headphones sound better, and I gotta tell you immediately, the, the speakers on this TV here, the speaker, um, it's, it sounds a lot better when I'm hearing here. It's crazy. It's much more bass to it. That Much more powerful. All right, all right. Okay, three mummies in the room. Let, let's go on the three mummies in the room. And, and let's see if they don't kill me this, this time. Because I'm dying on the fucking mummies now. Like, literally getting worse. Yeah, this is, this is horror shit. I, I have a hater for... Okay. Invisible fucking enemies. Okay, took one, only one hit so far, so... A monster. Okay, so I'm here right now. So the chest is right here, right? Oh, so so those are tor. Oh fuck! <clears throat> ah, I'm a doofus. I think I'm tired. I uh, I thought those were lanterns. The lanterns. Yeah. Still bullshit though. I gotta come down here without the two and take hits. Uh, but no, I got you. So for some reason I thought, um, look, we're approaching nine hours here, so that, oh, <laughs> I'll blame it on that. So I thought it was the lantern thing, right, a kerosene lamp or whatever you want to call that. Okay, fair enough. And 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 that's it. That's what. Yeah, getting confused here. Sorry, and uh, old age. Sorry, beer talk. All right, go on. Use that. There you go. Kill them all. Oh, this is uh, way fucking better, man. This is this is more my. There you go. This is a lot better. Yes. What was that?
Yeah, so I, I completely forgot that, that that was torches. Stupid, I know, sorry. Okay. That's good. Funky, morning, how you doing? Here. There you go. Ugh. Ah! Okay, and it was the top there. Okay. Right here. This one here. No, no, no. Okay. Oh, oh, the bottom one. Okay. Oh, okay. I remember. Right here. No? Be on about. No! I couldn't see with your fucking. You corpulent body! Oh my god! God, it's kind of brutal. One little mistake and that's it. You, you're fucked. At least I know about the torches now. Let's get back into it. Please, a motherfucking coffee right now, let me tell you. Okay. Get the dogs. You stay out there with them dogs! Until you learn how to play by the rules. Thomas Hewitt! Get your ass out here! You're so dead you don't even know it. There we go. Can I help you? Sounds making a sound here, I don't know. Ghostly apparitions. And ten. America the beautiful. It sure is a beautiful country. That, that much is sure. Thank you. Okay, here you gotta take hits. There's not much you can do here. But I did do this here. Is that it? And then just hug the wall here pretty much. And get this asshole here right away. Ambushed your last time? Where's your ambush now? Die horribly. Let's go here. So those are the torches already. For some fucking reason, I thought they were, they were the lanterns. You silly... You silly goose. So right here, you can use them. Use the torch. There we go. Thank you. Bingo. There you go. Yes, I feel. Give me that. What the fuck is that shit, you know? Okay. Let's open it up. Ooh, the skull's right side of the room. Lock. What is that about? Room with the skulls. Right side of the room equals block. What? There's more seekers in there than what I know? <laughs> Cowards! Ah, pass. Come this way, and I'll show you where the treasure is hidden. Ah, I should have kept going. Come on! Bulk rat, bulk rap you avoided that. Come on, come on, bitch. <gasps> You can come in here. Okay. What a bitch, huh? What a fucking little bitch. Fucking car. I can't remember which block here. We'll just try them. Just, just think before you jump, dude. There we go. <clears throat> no break over it, no break over it. Yeah, I'm looking at that monitor here. That's, sorry, that CRT it does look quite red on the side. <laughs> the lighting. Oh, and this here, you want to use this again? There you go. 
There you go. Now you're talking, turkey. Kind of learn what the stars do. Yay! <clears throat> I'll head on back. Don't hit me. Use the thing right away. There you go. And I reckon I gotta go down here. Oh, this is a bullshit with a fucking slug. Nonsense. Careful. Be respectful now. Okay. Watch your ass. There's, I know there's a thing in there. Okay, and then it, it acted here. Oh, fuck off! Come on! Yeah, I see, there's a different collar here. I I, I noticed the texture kind of loading. It was like a 3D fucking game. It is slightly different here. I see it. It's a bit of a stretch, though. I think the problem I have is that... Yeah, and I can see it's different here. Okay. Right here. There you go. Okay, keep going. <coughs> Up yonder. No, no. We're not doing this shit. We're not playing this game. Shit, shit! I knew it. Okay. No. It's over, Jerry. Kill all of you. Coward. Okay. So, this one here... Oh, it was down... This one was down, too. Hit his asshole. Right here. There you go. Now that's the lantern. So this, the whole hoopla from earlier is that I was mixing them up. So I thought I had all lanterns and no, no torches like an idiot. That's what the problem was. That's what the problem was. <clears throat> Feeling my voice today a little bit. I think, you know, I just came out of a nasty ass flu. So I think I uh, felt feeling a tiny bit the, the talking now. Ah, just go, just go. Okay. You don't need to shed. Not, not here, man. Save your, save your stuff. There you go. Yeah. Okay, gotta try to be economical here. That's for sure. Okay. Uh, pop. Okay, go real quick. No! Oh my god, no. Crap. Yeah, I, I'd rather use it than die, because I'm sorry I didn't. Yeah, I would have died here. Gotcha. Okay, quick. Huh? Huh? Okay, now I gotta use one here. Okay. Pa, pa, pa. How the fuck? Okay. Pa, 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 pa. Here. Pa, pa, pa. Okay. So this one is timed. But it's the only one you have to deal with. Okay. Quick. No, it's not. Yes! Suck it. Okay. What the fuck?
Guten Morgen. Nice TV. Yeah, it's a good one. It's a beautiful, it's such a good condition TV. Fuck you! What the f Taking my health off. Hmm. What the fuck is this shit? No! 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 Asshole! Ah! Fuck! Is demonic! Ah! The fuck, man! No, 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 no. Go, go, get out of here. Ah! Fuck! Brutal. Fucking brutal. It's a bit of a checkpoint here, I guess. God, I hate this shit. Coward. I hate it. Damn it. Fuck you. How the fuck do I fight that guy? Where's my bolo things? I need some, some... Fuck you! Come on! I need some kind of projectile here. You're not gonna hit me here, sack of shit. Fuck off. Gets you here. <laughs> My nose is fucking nature. Will you fucking give it up? <laughs> can roll follows. Thank you, can roll. <laughs> what's uh, what's this game about, and what's the goal, if you don't mind asking? The goal is to rescue your, your uncle. Dr. J. Dr. Jones, but we'll call him Dr. J. Man, we, we got kind of acquainted. You go to dungeons, you, you solve puzzles, you talk to the villagers, and you get some upgrades sometimes, and you gotta pretty much figure out the puzzles here in the dungeon. Kill some enemies, get good, you know. Pretty much it. Yeah, it's a sort of an uh, adventure game, puzzle adventure, I, I would say. Excellent game, yeah. It's very good. You have to jump up north to a room. The school skull looking room you were in, you have to I'm deducing this jump because YouTube keeps covering the the things here. Doctor Indiana Jones. And the name of the protagonist is Mike Jones. Mike Jones. The school looking room. I have to jump north. From the skull, I gotta go north. There's there was something going north there. I didn't even see it. But how come it they opened the the eastern part? How how in what planet does that make sense? The skull looking room we gotta go north. I got the shit memorized, assholes. Okay. You. Give it. Ah! I hate you! You dumb enemy! I hate I hate it because it's like, mm, I don't know anything. It's very slow, but they, they still get you, the fucks. Go to hell. God damn it. Oh, shit. Ah, pest! I'm hurting, Linda. I'm hurting. I'm never gonna make it. Oh. That room is a trick. That's... What a bunch of shit. Fucking old games are their crap sometimes, you know? This is a... Go, go, just fucking go, fucking go, dude. Go, get out. Uh, I can't fucking remember this this place for shit. I should, but I, I can't. So here, don't have to use it. Don't ever use it here again. Right down, okay. Okay. 
Right? That's it. Okay, and then you gotta use this thing. There we go. Ah! I'm getting tired, I think. I shouldn't have used a torch. Okay. A fucking bullshit trap room. Come on. I'm gonna die here immediately. I wish I had some sort of projectile here. Wouldn't that be cool? How the fuck am I avoiding uh, this guy's hits here? I like got. Oh. But I have, I have to kill him? Die, oh, you fuck. Okay. No. Just don't give up, huh? Uh uh. Ooh, asshole. I figured it out. Good. <sighs> Speaking of, I had you to play any Indiana Jones. Not yet. Not on the channel. No. I will, though. I like Indiana Jones. Yeah, I'm, I'm fucked here. There's no there's zero chance of this happening. So this is, uh, you gotta go north? How? Just go... That's it? That's kind of fucking stupid, huh? A little bit. Okay. No more fucking tricks here. Well, thanks for letting me know. I wouldn't have figured out that out. Not, not for, for a long fucking time. How the fuck I would have done this? Man, I gotta fucking look at everywhere. Like, yeah, you can see a tiny bit of green on top of the screen, but... That's a fucking stretch, right? And they're playing fucking boss music, so you... Calm down. They're playing boss music, so it makes you think that's a challenge, right? Any normal person, I think. And you go like, well, I gotta beat the shit, right? No, just leave. Who do you think I'm gonna design sunlight? So sometimes back in the day, man, what, what were they doing out there in, in Tokyo or whatever, you know? What are they smoking there? But the... I know, but the boss music... Lots of enemies, blocks everywhere, but all they have to do is jump up? Is a trick? <laughs> what? Why? Why? You see that? That's, that's kind of crazy. That is kind of, that's bullshit. It, look, it's fine to love the game. I love the game so far, but there's been some, as always, some questionable decisions here, right? This is one of them. If you disagree, please let me know how, how how wrong I am. But I would like to know. So like a giant fucking middle finger to the kids. You know, to the American kids. It's a giant middle th finger to America. No? I don't know, man. <laughs> it's kind of fucked. I don't know. Is it going to be a checkpoint? I'm, I'm about to die here. There's going to be a boss. I'm not going to survive because I'm, I'm kind of all fucked up here. Let's see. Okay. There you go. <clears throat> but let's take a look here. Let's see. Well, I don't I don't need your sag guys in a moment. Thank you. Wait until you start tropic shoes over his revenge release in that game you can move around freely. But again, like that guy said, the Nitro Red, there's a charm about the way this game here controls. It's just a cryptic bullshit, a cryptic bullshit. I mean awesome games have it, like Zelda, uh fucking name whatever game has a cryptic nonsense, right? Because the games were made to last back then, so it was more than a, an, a, an adventure. So, but we're coming here in 2024 with a different frame of mind, right? And I'm streaming on top of that. Uh, but yeah, holy shit, you know, that's cryptic. Uh, but I think, I see what the guy's saying now. Nitro Red says that the second one, he doesn't, he doesn't find it as memorable because it's, it's more like everything else as far as controls and stuff like that. They say the, the, yeah, I I can't see what is coming from about about the, the charm of this here, of moving the way the way this game is. It feels quite unique and quirky and and interesting in its own way. Uh, I I to be honest, I, I came here open minded about the controls, and I'm not having a problem with them to be honest. I came in with a mentality today of of I'm gonna I know how this game controls because I heard what a guy had to say about it. I'm gonna come in and sort of uh, get adapt to that instead of complaining the whole time. So, and it worked. Uh, 
don't really have a problem with the controls. I like the way the game moves and everything. You know, I can see what it's coming from. So it's interesting. I'll play the second one as well. Now, cryptic shit, I hit it then, I hit it now, I never liked it. Cryptic is bullshit, is garbage, and it should have never existed. I hate cryptic, I hate it, I hate it, I hate it, I'll always hate it. You know, don't, you can defend cryptic as much as you want. It's not gonna convince me, I hate cryptic. It's not fun. It's, it, for me, it's a big middle finger. It, for me, it's lack of imagination. It's cheap. I, I hate it, I hate it. All the games that I love, the cryptic, the cryptic parts, I don't like them. And I never will. And and that's that's something I can never get on board there. The, the bullshit was like, well, it's a boss fight, boss fight music, but no, just jump here. <laughs> so you, you would have come here as a kid or as an adult. Now, if you wasn't here, I would have been coming here forever for a very long time trying to figure figure out what I'm what am I doing wrong? What is that a block? Did I forget a block or something? And then I go in that room and as a trap. Metal Gear, the original one on MSX, that has a bullshit part like this here. The guy tells you, get in there! And you do do as he's stowed, and he's gonna send you all the way back. And you're left there, like, what the fuck? What just happened? At least there they go, like, the guy's betraying you, so he's speeding now false information, as explained later. This one here is just a fucking middle finger, right? It's like, oh, you liking the game so far? How about this? Fuck you. Your boss fight that you've been fighting? The door you fucking open, that don't mean shit. Cause you're shit. That's how I get it. I see it as a hostility. It's not endearing. I don't like it. It's, I, I think I'm beating a dead horse here by now. I think I made it clear enough. So, boss time, and I don't I have shit for health. Not to mention I left it hard. Back in the beginning. That's gonna that I I hope that's not gonna be a big problem. So, I don't know if you're here, piano artist, but I forgot to pick up a heart. I didn't do it. That would have been bullshit. Thank fucking Christ I checked that shit. So I would have gone here boss time. Cause the last time the the, the, the things didn't do a shit, the blocks, but now they do and they open it. So that was a fake. I would have come out here and I would have I would have been kicked out of the stage. That would have been that would have fucking make my day right there. Hey Pingy, how you doing? Doing alright? The game is still excellent, just a bit it's cryptic at times. Eh? Okay, this is a perfect spot here to tell you how life would look without gloves on, on the screen. Yeah, pretty fucking terrible with the reflections. Even here, not wearing this, but it's too hot here, I can't do it. Fucking nerd. Uh, it's coke time for me, and uh, I'm not 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 gonna even pretend I'm gonna go in there and kick the boss's ass. I'm gonna probably die immediately. It's probably gonna be some shit like "What the fuck do I do here?" kind of thing, right? Huh? Hitting like too strong here, buddy. Tighten up the home up a bit while the wife is at work, so she'll leave me alone once back home. That's a that's a life. Living up la vida loca. Hell yeah, um, uh, yeah, cryptic puzzles really dig into your thinking process, kind of like the Sherlock Sherlock Holmes games here. I never play Sherlock Holmes, but not a part of that that thing digs into my thinking process. It's just is shit. That, that room there, are you saying that that my thinking process that that one like like a boss room and a fake entry, and you all you have to do is jump up. I would like to know how. How does that dig into your thinking process, that, that part? And how, like Sherlock Holmes are looking for, for clues to solve murders, right? I haven't played him, but I know Sherlock Holmes, right? So he's a detective, he's looking for clues. I don't know. It's, it's kind of like Sherlock Holmes is there with Watson and uh, he's trying to solve a big case. And is working with Watson, but the whole time it was just Watson. And then Watson goes, uh, Sherlock? It's like, yeah, Watson. It was me. Oh, yes, you can arrest me. Thank you. I'm guilty. I don't know. Just... 
You had some, I accidentally had some wine yesterday. Yeah, I don't like cryptic. I really don't. There's some things I'm, I'm very adamant about not liking, and cryptic is one of them. There goes here, right? I'm trying not to use the torches. This is the part where the fuck... Wait a minute, you motherfucker. Kinda weird. I've been here already. Took me a minute to crash to get through that area, especially shit. Yeah, but it's not. It's, it's not difficult. All you had to do is like, oh, there's a little bit of green here. I jumped there, done. That's like the op. That's like that's like all the thinking that you did, kind of like just throw it away. You know. I don't have enough. I don't have enough of them. It's, it's over, I can't. Can you kill him without seeing them? I don't have more torches. Oh. Get off me. Do you give me more torches here? Oh! What the fuck? Oh my god. Oh god, just like Zelda now. Damn it! The fuck? Can't hurt him? Do I just need to go? Get off me, you freak. No. The fuck is going on here? What is this? What the fuck was that? Don't despair. You get your fucking saggy ass in there and you, you see how it is. Oh God, it's just like the fucking... Oh, the Zelda ones. Oh, this flashback. You know, you know what it's the darnest thing though. You know what you can do on the Zelda one? You can actually kill him if, if you hit him. Isn't that crazy? I have the yo-yo. The guys in front of me, I, I, I hit it. it. It didn't do anything. It didn't look like it. it. didn't do shit, so... Hmm. A mist of mirror spell room. A mirror spell in the room previously. Uh... You know, the way they framed that, that hallway, it, it looked like an endless loop. That's why I didn't bother checking the, the green things. They, they framed it like it was an endless loop, and all of a sudden I was surprised because I saw them dogs, and I was like, wow, it's not a loop, so... I don't know. The mirror, yeah. Well... Great. Fucking right, man. Yeah, it's kind of cryptic here. This one. Look as art, art's pointing quick advantage is very cryptic. I don't think cryptic is good design. I think it's terrible design. I don't care what game is it. Um, I like a lot of games that have cryptic stuff. I love Castlevania too, but I'm not gonna sit here and say that's good design. Well done. Put it this way, if I, if I had a game, I would not put cryptic stuff. I would make it easy, but I would not do cryptic stuff. There's a difference between a good puzzle and just cryptic bullshit that is, is, makes no fucking sense. Now, this one here is my fault. It didn't check the room, okay? But um, in my defense, they framed it like it was. It seemed like an, an, uh, an endless hallway, and I thought I was doing something wrong, because who knows? 
Uh, but it was my mistake, it was my fault for not checking the green blocks, and I take full responsibility for that. That's fine. Yeah, I get the thing with the mirror. Yeah, the mirror said mirror. It's like area reflective shit. Just like the, the shield in, in Zelda would stop him. Uh, I'm gonna have us uh, just stand up for a bit. I'm gonna give me a rest here, and I'll, I'll go back. I'll still play a, a try, try more. Okay? But I need to stand up here. Maybe use the bathroom. And, uh, I'll leave you the music here, let's go. There you go. I'll be right back. Give me a second here. I thought a microphone was off. Yeah. I'm to think I request my wife some coffee here, get me out of this wreck here. Get my mojo back, you know? Get my groove back on. Silent Hill Cryptic, a time special the first. Silent Hill, the only part I had a problem with, and it is cryptic at times, not this cryptic, here we go. Uh, but yeah, the, the nowhere. That shit. And I love that game, man. That's the thing. I, I love that I'm able to look at games I really, really love and see the flaws with them still. It's the best. It's the best. Gotta have that. Gotta have that. Can't have blind blind devotion to something. I mean, a fucking game or, or whatever it is. You, know, you gotta be able to see the flaws on yourself and others and things and stuff, man. She. Uh, nowhere in Silent Hill. Fuck that place. Fuck that place hard. I hate that place. When I do the stream, I think I spend like three fucking hours in there. Fuck the horoscope puzzle. Disgusting. Fuck that puzzle. Mr. Coat Lump, thanks for following. Fuck that goddamn puzzle. I hated it and I hated it. I hated it then, I hate it now, and I'll hate it forever. The puzzle that is, you, you, you're trying, you're breaking your head around that fucking horoscope shit. And, um, turns out it's the number of lags of the animals. Fuck you. I would have... Mm, mm, uh, yeah. Yeah, you can't be correct. Yep. Yeah. Love the game? Love the game. Love it. But yeah, the first one, yeah. Nowhere. When I think of that game, I... Ooh, I really want to miss playing that game. And then I think of Nowhere. Mmm. Man, that's a rough area. Yano says, uh, I forgot which Castlevania game was in the ass. That's uh, Castlevania 2, Simon's Quest. I love that game as well. That one I really do. I have a good time playing. I might play it again, even though it was my second stream ever. First stream was Mortal Kombat. Um, yeah, I love that game, but good luck going in there without knowing anything and saying you're going to play blindly. It's just not fucking happening. I don't see any... In, I don't see it. Maybe in like months and months. It's a sort of game It's so fucking cryptic. You have to know what's going on. If you know what's going on, it's a, it's a good game. I, I like it. It's a good game. I'm not going to tell it. For me, it's a fun game. I'm not going to say it's a good game. It's not a good game. Any game you can't go in there, you can't fucking beat it. You have to go, look up, guys. It's not a good game. Look, Castlevania 2 is not a good game. But it's a game that I like. Let's put it that way. I think that's, that's, that's better. Let's go with Take 2. It's a shitty game with a horrible design that I happen to like because I know what's going on by now, you know? I don't think I would have liked that as a kid. Yeah, maybe, because sometimes when you're a kid, you're crap and you're just roaming around and you don't give a shit. You don't know what's going on, you know? I wonder how we did progress in Simon's Quest. You didn't. You got magazine. You had no fucking way. Pinge is no fucking, and it's not an alternative fucking reality that somebody will go in there and think about all those things, like kneeling with the fucking red jewel. Not with the fucking dialogue, not with that translation. We did it because in the 90s we had magazines and we talked to each other. So somebody think, the way I think it is that somebody had a magazine, and I think sometimes that they had games just in, uh, tied in with magazines. Say, look, we have magazines, we're selling, right? The guides, it was a big thing. Because we go like, we go nowadays and say to kids now, eh, derpy derp, back in my time we had no internet. But we, we had fucking magazines. And we had... We had recess. We had, you, you talk, 
you're talking to school buzz with the other kids about all the levels. Everybody was playing. So we had the information. We had the information. It was just a different way, but we still have it. There's there's no... Look, I can do a test. I tell you what, okay, I promise, I promise you something right now. What age, I want to know, because I have kids. What age do you think is appropriate that a kid should be able to beat Castlevania 2 on their own? Because I, I, will, I will save the game for my son. And I'm going to throw him in, throw him in the, into the game. I'm going to ask him to play the game, I don't know, an hour or two a day. He's too young now, he's three years old. I think my daughter, she's, she's seen me playing it, so that's spoiled. She, she knows about the bullshit, right? But I think my son, just throw my son in with no talk. There's no fucking way he'll never beat it. But I, I will do an experiment. I'll, I'll tell you what. I promise you this. I'm going to have my son play Castlevania when, he, when, he's a bit, when he's a bit older. I'm going to have him play an hour a day without looking at anything. Six. There goes six. So, okay, when, once my son turns six years old... I'm gonna, and he plays games now, he's three, he's playing Mario Maker and shit, right? I'm gonna have him play Castlevania 2 Simon's, Simon's Quest for an hour every day, just about. He's free to do anything, so it'd be like a chore. Or maybe he likes the game, but after a while you get... And I want to see if he, can figure, if he can figure anything out, so I'll tell him, no pressure, just take it easy, just do like a half an hour a day, play a little bit here and there. Do save states, that's fine, I just want to know if you're going to figure out the stuff in here. I'm not going to tell him a script. I'm going to tell him this is the game. Yeah? Yeah, Tears of the Kingdom. That's true. That's that's good. It's good. But, uh, yeah, he wouldn't... Your son... I don't know if your son plays retro, but throw, any kid, throw him Castlevania to Simon's Quest. There's no way. Us back then and nobody now. Without knowing what's going on in that game a little bit, at least... If, if you watch the castle, uh, okay, watch the Angry Video Game Nerd episode, you, you you could be the game. If you watch that episode, it's short, but if you watch that, definitely, you would you would know what's you you already you prepare for all the bullshit. You know, there's a lot of crap in there, and you could uh, you know the kneeling and, uh, and yes, coming in and playing the game, coming in and, and think about it. People are coming from Castlevania One to that game, Castlevania Two. Imagine the shock. I didn't have the game as a kid. Ask him to play it and just what don't tell him it's cryptic. There you go. You can do it now. So your kid is old enough and is playing games, right? Do an experiment. Get your kid. My kid is too young now for it, and my daughter unfortunately she knows about the game's horror shit. So yeah. Uh have him play the game. Don't tell him anything. Record it as well. There you go. And that let's make a study about about how we can recreate it, right? What happened then? But again, back then we had the kids at recess. We had all that. But just, yeah, not now in the future. Yeah, let's do that. Let's make that happen. I want to know what happens. You know, if you can figure out any of the bullshit, there's no fucking way. It's horrible. There's no it's The dialogue is terrible. And it has to be the original. None of the redaction shit with the translation fix, because that's... The the, the, the villagers lie to you. It's, it's terrible. The translation was fucked. There's a Finnish guy that made an amazing page about all the translation. That, what went wrong with Castlevania 2, Simon's Quest? And a lot of it went wrong. Hit your head on Deborah's cliff to make a hole. Does that make any fucking sense to you? That's one of the lines of dialogue in that game. Uh, laurels in your soup it enhances its aroma. Thanks. That's the translation of shit. Must be some reward or he'll give up. I gotta have some reward, yeah. Tell him once he beat, beats the game, and this is from, straight from World of Combat 4. So he beat, he figures everything else, and he got every, everything else that, that in the game. The, the, the kneeling with the crystal, the tornado shit, all that crap. The fake tiles, goddamn. And then you go, I give you the gift of your existence. The gift of my existence, yes. 
I consume all the power around me. You must understand that. <laughs> That's Quan. Was it Quan Chi? Quan Chi is Anon. Shinnok gives him the gift of his existence. <laughs> I love that shit. Since you'll not be able to finish this. I, I want to write even clothes, you know, because it's so fucked up that game. All right, I, I'm going to take a leak and uh, ask my wife if she makes me a coffee here. Okay. Yeah, I'm in, I'm in the mood to play more. I want me in the mood to try. I'll try to get this dungeon here today. I'm not in a hurry. All right, I'll be back. Okay. Ooh. Shut up. You fuck off. You don't. My wife is making some coffee. So if you don't mind, I need a time to break here. I'm leaving the... Sorry about the... The screen is going to be a bit uh, bright because I had to open the door here to get some of the heat uh, out of this here room. Uh, I'm going to stand up here a tiny bit um, because of my butt. Or from sitting here. Okay. Okay. Kneel here. Kneel before me. This is weird. This is it's a weird thing to do. Sorry, I gotta I gotta just stand up here kind of bit. Just my, my butt hurts here. I gotta get a better chair. That's for sure. So I'm just waiting on that cop. Oh, there it is. Speaking of the devil. You alright? Oh, it's horrific, yes. Welcome to hell. Uh, where's the fucking coaster? No coasters? Well, the hell with you then. Oh, I'm not gonna fuck that. Fuck me. Thank you, my dear. I appreciate it. Where's the fucking coaster? What are you doing? Fucking around here, bitch. Hmm? Where's the fucking coaster? Where the fuck is it? It's never around when you need it. What the fuck are you on about? Fuck me, I'll use the fucking rubber gun. Yeah, there we go. Uh, when I was school says, Make him play 150cc Mario Kart start cut for an hour a day. Oh, he he will get very very angry with that. For sure. Speaking of which, would you even? It's on YouTube, by the way, folks. On Twitch, sometimes I'm reading comments and simulcasting on YouTube. 
most of the chat is here, but uh, there's some chat on, chat on YouTube here and there. Uh, just live stream, go to 9007 Perfect Dark on N64 or something. Oh, that's one, but my N64s, uh, they're crap, they're, they're, they're crapped out. They're, they broke. They're gone. I'm sending them to a friend of mine, Jerome. Well, I'm going to try a few things here. Just send me a few tips and tricks to try dry out with a soldering iron. I'll try to fix it, but, uh, uh, you know, see how it goes. I have I have three of them here. One is pelt, don't count. Uh, and the two, my two regular NTSC consoles just crapped out simultaneously. Basically, they're, they're just resetting all the time. Uh, it happened on stream. Had to give it up, you know. So, but definitely, uh, gold, I actually have Golden Eye here physically. I love that game. Grew up with that game. Teenage years, you know. I think the coffee here is going to give me the, the necessary spark, you know, to, to tolerate this here dungeon. But this dungeon is cryptic, by God. This ain't no, uh, no walk in the park here, let me tell you. But it would be nice if I could get through it. There's nothing in the other world if I can't uh, do it today, because uh, tomorrow I'll be back. The game has saved, so who cares, huh? I love one thing about the, them old games will save because, you know, or password, I don't care. As long as I can continue and do my thing, you know. Uh, limited continue games can be pretty brutal sometimes. I think CRT4K is going to sleep, but he was playing Castlevania Bloodlines. I think Bloodlines what makes it difficult is limited continue, right? Just so used to not having to deal with that on any Castlevania, and then all, all of a sudden you're out there in the code because you got to. You got limited continues on, on Bloodlines. I still love that game, though. I love it a whole deal. It's, it's my favorite 16-bit. I don't... What Rondo of Blood? Would that be 16-bit? Because, right, it's PC Engine CD ROM ROM. So... Is that still? 16? It's, hmm. I reckon. If that counts, then Rondo of Blood is my favorite 16-bit. But, of... Uh, of the regular ones, uh, regular 16 bits. Um, did I play Goldfinger? I played uh, one with Sean Connery from a, a hack, very well made one. Um, I think it was from Russia with Love, though. Was it Goldfinger? It might have been Goldfinger. Was that the one with Sean Connery? Did I play that one. 12 hour stream today. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. You can never be 12 hours. It can be 11 hours and 59 minutes. <laughs> that's pushing it. I usually stop within 11:40. That's uh, I'm already like, wow, well, I gotta go here. I did have one stream that went went on to 11 hours and 55 minutes. I had to rush at the end to, to finish that crap. And so maybe very awkward. You do a, a 11 hours and 50, no 11 hour stream. And then you go beat the game the next day, it's like 40 minutes long, or not even that. And I don't like different games on one stream, to be honest. My the way I do things, I'm not really a variety, I'm a variety streamer as far as uh, content, but I don't like to do variety streams myself, personally. I like, I, even offline, uh, I like to play one game and focus on one game only. That's just the way I am. I'm not putting down anyone who does plenty of people do a variety of streams that, uh, that I like to watch. You know, just my own thing. Uh, last stream was 12 hours. I actually popped into your stream, but very briefly, I was on my way to bed and I saw that you're on for past 12 hours. I was like, holy shit. Uh, but I was so tired, I just went to sleep. But I did check that you're on 12 hours. Went 14 hours, huh? James Bond, Russia from Love, a game on Classic Xbox. Oh, so that's a, uh, oh yeah, the gold, gold fingers. There's one with Sean Connor, so yeah, I'm mixing up with that one. Gypsy Claw, thank you for following. Just having a coffee break here, and we head on back to the game in no time. But, and I shouldn't, I should be standing up. It's the one, can you not do that? Uh, I should, uh, sorry, I'm gonna stand up here kind of bit. Uh, I need to rest my, my butt. Okay. So, yeah. 
Good old Sean Dad tired. Yeah, 14 hours a long time. I don't push myself to do a bunch of bullshit I don't want to. So to be honest, if I'm here for 11 hours, whatever, it's because I wanted to be here for 11 hours. So, but if you're happy doing it, even if you're tired, it's fine. I wouldn't make it a habit out of it though, because then what happens is people people start to expect you to do it all the time. You know, you can always tell them to fuck off. They'll say I'm not doing it, and they go, "Oh, what happened to the 14-hour stream?" No, it's not happening. That's that's what happened. So yeah, I'll do what you what you want to do. You know, Gypsy Claw mentioned I thought I was looking at picture too. CRTs. They look better because I got the I got the door open here and all the light is coming in. As soon as I go back into the game, uh, I will. Uh, you see, it'll look better even a, a little bit better. It could be look, look, it could look better if I had a better camera. I don't know what the deal is with this goddamn motherfucking webcam today, but it's pissing me off. Now there you are. It's all all real stuff. Hello. We can't do this with an overlay. There you go. No, I'll be fucked if I had an overlay. Even a mask here, because I'm moving around a lot. Is one of them woody sets. And I'm sorry, I'm sorry somebody is watching these in a full screen and they're getting dizzy as fuck. And the, camp, the, the camera is there's a camcorder, old fashioned one. And there's a, yeah, there's everything. There's a captain chair. I, I use this here for lumber support, but I don't know. So ain't no, this here, ain't no green screen, ain't none of that here, here. That shit. Oh, oh, the real McCoy. Oh, yeah. Now, I understand. I thought it was an overlay. It looked too perfect. Oh, man, just wait waiting until I get a better camera here. You get me a uh, Lumix. I'm sorry, I'm not in frame here because I need to... I need to stand up a tiny bit because this chair is, is harder as fuck. Uh, I love this Coca-Cola shirt. It's the American flag Coca-Cola shirt and cowboy hat. You think I'm more American than that? That's right. What in the hell is going on out there? I hear things out here, man. Strange things. Here instead. But not, I'm not going to sit here in jeans for it for for you know ten fucking hours now. Fuck that. I wear comfortable pants here. Yeah, I need a need to address a chair situation. It's an office chair. But people got to sit sit on the shit and work for like fucking eight hours a day. Fuck that. It's kind of hard. I don't understand. I put the pillow in here and he don't help much. I guess at the end of the day, we're just not built to, to sit, you know, sit for fucking nine hours, right? The joke was passed already. Sometimes it happens that you want to make a joke and say, but the time, timing is gone. Sorry about that, Salamander. Then welcome in, Gypsy Claw. Uh, it's important to walk in the breaks. Yeah, I will, if I'm doing this, uh, it's all about consistent, about... Wake up. It was all about consistency for me this week as far as the days, and hopefully next week it'll be, um, what's it called? Schedule. So, what am I on about? Something about a lizard? I don't know. 
tape and make my coffee here. Ah, let me give the cup back to my mop. I'll be back and let's go. Let's play some more. Oh yeah, I was gonna say I'll be off on Sunday. I want Sundays off on Monday, but I don't, I don't think this Monday I'll be off. If I get a schedule done, it'll be. I think it'll be Sunday, Monday off. You know what? I forgot what I was going to say. Well, I'll be back. Right. Oh, I'm sorry. Thank you, my dear, for the coffee. I'll be, I'll be seeing y'all in a bit. Goodbye, son. Have fun. Follow the fun of the gala night. All right, close this here door and make it as hot and stuff as possible in this here room. Oh, yeah. Yeehaw. Mm -mm 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 -mm. I wonder, uh, well, I guess I'll look it up after, because I'm only doing this dungeon here, and, well, say only. Can I even do it? Mm, you stupid fuck. Can you even do this fucking dungeon? I'm just getting my smokeless here. Look it, sir. And let's head on back. Yeah, when you stream for a long time, you want to have yourself some regular breaks here and there. You need a bald eagle on your shoulder. Complete looks. I do love our Coca-Cola, man. I love bald eagles. She's an awesome animal. Alright. Don't mess around. The Fape of the Ages. Let's go. Try to get better here. So we need to get the mirror. We need that mirror. Get your fucking mirror. Get your fucking mirror already. It's like a ship. Get back and get my groove. Get my groove back on here. And if y'all, some of y'all might have missed, I want to. The, the volume of the set here is pretty good. The speakers are awesome. All right, don't go, don't go crazy here. <laughs> Put it back. So you, you're listening to the sound of some madman ranting about nonsense. No, I'm kidding. You're listening to the sound of uh, the RCA out from the NES. It's mono, so I have a bifurcate, so a splitter, to dual mono, so you don't get only one ear, right? And neither do I, because I don't want that shit. Drive me nuts. And that gets split into my, you know, to my headphones, into a RCA to USB that goes to you at home, my good sir or madam. Now this year's like news, it's, it's nicotine pouches pretty much. That's all it is. It's got winter grain on it. You gotta be careful with winter grain though. It can be highly toxic. Get on all you're doing, huh? Just a drop here and there. That's all. All right, let's go. Let's go. I, I don't want you here. The fucking the webcam. All right, now it's for real. Let's go. All right. Time to go. Time to head on back. Everything fine? We all cool? Are we, we happy, Vincent? We happy? Is this the new CRT Rex? Oh, Aaron is here. How you doing? How you doing, Aaron? You doing all right? Aaron! Look, I need to talk to this feller. He's on YouTube. Aaron! Uh, I don't think y'all are in today. Because this feller's here in real life. Mm, I don't think anybody's in today because it's Saturday, right? Are you going to be here on Monday? Because if you're going to be here, uh, I need to bring a couple of CRTs into the room. And they don't fit. I cannot carry them because of the... 
they fit the the door perfectly. In other words, I cannot hold him. So I need a second person to kind of walk backwards here with it with a sad. Or you can go in the front, wherever you want to go. So I, in other words, I need help to bring a couple of PVMs here. They're 20 inch. That's a PVM and a bit. They're very heavy monitors. Right? And very awkward to get in here. I want to keep them here for me to use them. Will you be able to give me a give me a hand with that? Whenever you know next week. I'll clean up the place here. I got a spot for them here and keep them here in that Apple monitor. I want to bring it here too so I can use it here for the channel. So they're here just like the FW900, that, that big one. Yeah, just let me know. I don't know if it's still here. All right, enough of, enough of bullshit. Oh, and my uh, smartphone crapped out so I can't send text messages anymore. So if you send me text messages, you might as well go yell at your commode because I, I can't see them. The shitty ass. I'm back to the shitty ass dumb phone, but a, a real terrible one. So I bought the smartphone and it, it just didn't it didn't work out. It, it's broken. It's a shit. It doesn't charge. It's, I got a daylight robbery here. And of course it happens after the fucking return window closed. Cause why not? Oh jeepers. Sushi so Bell is still going or just started? No, I'm going. Isn't, isn't the timer down there? It's been 10 hours. Just a typical stream. It's above average when it comes to time. If I have to look at the history of my streams here, put an average, I would say eight, eight hours, right? Is there a problem here? What are you doing? About eight hours, eight. Maybe seven, seven, eight, nine, around that area. But every now and then I go, Go a bit loco here. Ah. If I'm having fun and I'm okay, I just I just play, you know? It's, it's alright. Okay, we kill them all. This game is good enough, you know? But sometimes it's not about the game being good. I mean, sometimes, like, you you had enough of streaming, you had enough of playing, and you, you want to go. Or you might have stuff going on, you know? Okay, Aaron responded. You sent us out Hampton next week, but I'll help you at the time I'm there. Oh no, I'll wait on you. I can't start it now. There's nothing. There's nothing. There's nobody. I can't ask my wife to do it. And that's fine. It's not, uh, it's not urgent. Uh, it's for future content. Uh, mainly, mainly, they're 20 inch monitors so for me to use uh, the arcade stick. So Mortal Kombat, fighting games, arcade games, that kind of stuff. Uh, no, that's fine. Whenever you uh, show up here again, uh, let me know. Just give me a ring. Don't bother taxing, because uh, the fucking phone sucks. For taxing. I can't even reply to taxing there. You can, but holy shit. I, I, I'd rather eat my own shit, man. Ah. Alright. Then tax on that fucking thing. Okay, we got the torches here. Uh... Oh, but the, the new monitor, the new CRT, uh, Aaron, thank you, Aaron. The new CRT uh, is the previous stream. I did a Rayman, I played the Sega, I don't know if you ever heard of the Sega Dreamcast. Sushi Basic Madman. <laughs> it's, uh, yeah, I'm gonna be it out there. Man. Oh, the fucking mon- Okay, wait. Nope. Fuck your star, I don't know what it does anyways. All right. What well, was it talking about here? Oh, I was playing the Sega Dreamcast. Playing a game game called Rayman 2, Electro Bugaloo. And, uh, no, the great escape. It, it looked amazing. It looked, it looked great. You're not fucking doing this shit. Not today. There you go. There you go. I actually, I know it's weird. I like this dungeon. You know, now, now that I sort of know the cryptic shit. So I gotta, I gotta jump on every fucking mirror here. Mirror. Uh, block. So yeah, I played, uh... So that monitor is very important to me, because I'll, I'll be using for Dreamcast, uh... X, for, Xbox. Original Xbox. Uh, what else? GameCube. Wii. Anything... And believe it or not, Xbox 360, whenever there's 4x3 support, that console actually has a lot of 4x3 support. PC! Come on, settle down! Uh, 
PC games. Anything 480p and above. Uh, 4 by 3 Get up here, you fuck. Oh. Mm-hmm. Okay. What was up there, was it? Mm. Which block was it again? Is that here? No. Hmm. No, I forgot which block. Okay. No problem, Sister Bell. Is that... Hmm. Yeah! So basically, if you ever played this game, all those uh, those easy axes here, they're all bullshit. You're gonna get nowhere. Nowhere. Uh, you gotta use the... There we go. I'm aware there's gonna be a big ghost here at some point. I can't remember what you have to do to find him. <clears throat> okay, and I'm gonna step on everything here all the time. To get the so-called mirror. And thank you once again, Arrow. I hope you're doing fine. And I gotta go here first. Jump on every goddamn fucking green block there is. Don't don't skimp on that. I like this here music. Okay. We're gonna head on downstairs now. Do I need to use the fucking thing again? Can I not use it? There we go. Save yourself a torch. So this here. I'm, I don't care what it is. I'm gonna I'm gonna jump on every fucking block ever. I don't want to lose. I don't want to miss out on the mirror. There we go. Shay's out there streaming for 14 hours. That's pretty cool, though. Respect, Shay. I don't know if you're still here, but you beat you beat even me, sir. You beat my own personal record. I never, the reason I never go past 12 hours is because of YouTube. I like archiving my streams. I like them to be always available forever. And uh, past 12 hours, YouTube may not, usually don't save it. So I, I could get past and then split it into Photoshop, Adobe Premiere, all that crap. I don't want to do it. I use you. There we go. And we know about the thing here. We know about the thing. Here we go, we got the hearts. Oh yeah, and I gotta return here. Fuck. It's such It's bullshit. That one there is bullshit. It's, it's kinda cheap. There we go. <laughs> Yeah, this crap here. All right. No. Come on. Come off it. Quick. No, 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 no. Nice try. Thank you. God damn it! No! Pressing the mirror is gonna be in uh, one of them blocks, yeah? In that hallway. There's a lantern. Good. Who goes there? Huh? Oh. Uh. Don't find Rex. Help. 
let us hear and join your stream a little bit. Confidence off. Oh, it's, I, I mention every stream. I've been over the moon. So if you're new here, somebody lurking here, uh, I used to have a lot of problems with the internet. Okay. And, uh, why, why did I, why did I, why am I still here? Okay, kind of nutty. Go, 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 ignore him. Got a heavy mutant. Yeah, I lost a lot of health. Don't jump up ever, don't ever jump up. Yeah, you should have a lot of problems with the internet and uh, it's been sorted, so. I remember here, do I remember? No, I don't. Sorry, babe. There we go. Okay. And it's so good to have internet at work. So the problem is the router with the 5G and 4G alternating. So the solution was just turning off to turning off 5G and keeping a 4G on it. That was it. Took one brilliant man from Scotland to figure it out for me. Come on. Oh. Oh. Come on! What are you doing? Okay. Look this bullshit here. Fuck you. Oh. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Alright. Are we getting to the room of thesis? Yeah, welcome. Oh, what the fuck are you doing, bitch? Oh, look at the challenge. That's all you had to do. Such bullshit. Come on. Come on! You're not gonna fucking ambush me, you asshole. If they're one block over, they'll, they'll kill you. Or they'll hit you. So, mirror. Mirror, mirror on the wall. Who's the ugliest of them? Oh, you are, you ugly motherfucker. Just making sure I touch everything here. Investigate everything. That's fine. Yeah, so before I would stream here, have no confidence whatsoever. The stream, the stream could die at any time. It was horrible. So in other words, I was a streamer without internet. How the fuck is that going to work? Well, it's not going to work, is it? And now it's been a little bundle of joy here. I don't need that shitty item. I need the mirror. Okay. And thank you, Aaron. Check everything. So we, not, we know here now about the fake entrance. So if you, were, if you were to go up here like a dumbass, you're done. It kicks you off the stage. You have to start from the beginning here. It's pretty brutal. Okay, so now we gotta we gotta use this thing. The, the torch is the torch. There we go. And I think where I went wrong is that I didn't check the, the green blocks here. I have to do it now. Not tomorrow, not after CSI, now. I'm gonna check everything. Not here, huh? Okay. All right. Mm, 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 mm. There'll be ghosts here. There we go. That's it. Don't walk out just yet. I'm not seeing no mirror here. Let me tell you. I'm maybe here, just last one of them dogs. I'm vicious. Ooh. Okay, please be here, yeah? Hey, hey! Hey, ho! So how would that work? I just use it. Okay, no, a, you can use it live, okay. We've got the mirror! Gentlemen! Prepare for redemption. Suck on that. Thank you. Suck on that. Thank you very much. Suck on that. You fuck! Suck it. Suck it. Suck it and suck it hard. There we go. Oh shit. No! What are you doing? Ah! I'll kill you. Nope. 
Here, I hope. Mm, not gonna write this. Look too easy. Why? I hope that's not a catch, man. Come on. Oh, no. Oh, my God. Come on. No. I think they're done. Fuck them up. Now, cut. Son of a bitch. Okay, there we go. I'm not doing good with the health here. No, 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 no. Check every block. Hmm. Typical humans. Check everything still. A lot of hits here, though. What the fuck, man? Oh, crap. Hmm. Oh, wait. Could it be? The prophecy? Ah! What the f No! It it's gonna kick me out. I can't just walk here. There's gotta be a secret here somewhere. No fucking way is just me going to that room. Ah, uh, it's gonna fuck me up. No, no, I don't believe it. I don't believe you. You're lying. There's something in here. What items do I have? It's not dark, so... Is there a ghost here? I knew it, son of a bitch! Okay? I knew it! If I had gone in there, I would have been fucked. Who goes there? Here's stuff out there. Just a second. What the fuck is going on? It's Saturday. Go home. Go home and be a family man. Yo! God damn it. Don't forget to lock the gate on your way out. When you're way out, you're gonna be here for a while. Uh, yeah. All right. All right. Da, 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 da. Security duties. The guy parked a van here in front of the gate, and don't know what the hell he wants. Working, because there's nobody here on Saturday. So somebody goes out there. It's my duty here to check. Well, not really my dude. Yeah, it kind of is. I have to check what's going on. You know, sorry about that, babe. God, the pig farm is stinking today. Something fierce. All right. So we got to go. I'm happy here. Let's see. Can we use the, the bolo thing? Let's try it out. Oh, shit. Motherfucker. Uh-uh. I'm going to win. Come on. You fuck. Feel the wrath, Shao Kahn. Oh! Ah! 
Bastard! No! God. Ah! No, I lost it. I lost all my life. Oh, you get, you go through the fucking things? Can, what the fuck are you doing? Please, leave me alone. Can't believe I died there. Taking too much fucking goddamn damage here from everything. Too much fucking damage. It's too much. Why can't you fucking focus on the fucking flag here and leave me alone with the background and disrupt, dis dis disrupting the immersion? I can't believe it. Okay. I need, I need to get wise. I need, oh man. I'm not gonna have the bolo things. I thought that was it. I thought I was gonna make it. I could have been out of this right now. I don't have anything here. What? I don't have torches. I don't. I don't have. I don't have a fucking thing. What am I doing here? What is this? It's supposed to be. No. Uh, supposed to go. Game over then. What's happening? No, I can't go here. They're, they'll kick me out of the level. What? What the fuck is this place, man? What is this place? I, I don't understand. I was so close. I don't know why I'm out here. What is this place? I, I don't know what this is. I, sorry? Go to hell! Son of a bitch. I lost all my... I lost everything. I lost literally everything. Fucking get off it. I lost everything. I don't think it's gonna happen, dude. Mm. Yeah, no. This is fucked up. Okay. Yeah, this is fucked up. What? Internet check. Every now and then I check out. Make sure everything's fucking holding up. Mm. My eyes are getting foggy now. Fuck you. Stop. What's it here to... Okay. Yeah. No, I have no health here. Yeah, I know the mirror's here, but look at, look at my... My health state. It's fucked. It's gone. One hit here, and I'm done. <gasps> yeah. A fart. A fart from an ant, and I'm dead. No hearts anywhere, is there? Do I have to kill him now? Yeah, I do, I do, I do. You're not doing this shit, bitch. Attack the weak. Might as well! Oh my god, okay. So, what was that? I gotta go... I gotta go down, right? Is that it? I'm not moving. You move. Oh shit. Can I go down here? Is there... 
Was there a chest full of things here? No, you can't go there. Oh, gotta go across that fucking asshole. Uh, and it takes my heart away. The little hand thing that pops up. Hmm. Yeah, I don't have any. I have to go. Right? I don't have any. Yeah. I have to face this asshole here. If you're quick enough, I, re I reckon you can do it. I hope so. Go, 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 go. No! Cunt. Horrible, horrible man. Look, not the end of the world. Try to maintain. Yeah, thanks. Okay. There we go. Anything here? No, it's not here. The the dogs. And use it again. Yeah, I love the pause menu. How how he holds a little placard saying pause. Okay, next one is a mirror, and try to be more careful with the ma magicians there. The magicians. There we go. We got the mirror. Right here, there we go. Equip the mirror. I'll be very no 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 no. Look, they cannot shoot diagonally, so just don't Fuck What the fuck are you doing? What did I do? One heart again. Why do I lose it here? The timing is not that hard. It's not that hard to get. Hmm. I lost everything again. How are you, son of a bitch? Not gonna ambush me. Let us. Whoa! Whoa! What the fuck was that? I got a heart. Gravy Pie 1971, thank you for following. Oh, no, 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 no. Get out. Out. Too hard, so come on. What's gonna happen? Bullshit. Okay, we get the things here. Okay. All right. Ah! Two sons of bitches. Nah, <laughs> yeah, sure. Yeah, I'm gonna be there. Don't come near me, you freak. God. Got him, okay. Oh, I got a heart. That's good, that's good, that's good, that's good. Good stuff. Find one. Find one. Okay, check everything. Man. High stakes here. High stakes. Got more of those? Okay. We can make sense because you need this now, so if you didn't have it, you'd be kind of fucked. All right, uh, okay, man, three hearts, I don't know, uh, God, wouldn't be nice if I could just walk on, no, 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 stop. Don't get, oh, son of a bitch. Don't get your clothes, dude, come on. Okay, maybe, just eat it, eat shit, damn it. out of here. Motherfucker. No, 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 no. Come on, come on. No. Ah! Ah! Should have stayed quiet! Son of a bitch. Come on, stop this. Get out. No! No! You motherfucker. Nearly kill me. Go, 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 go! 
Oh my god, I'm, I'm, I'm having goosebumps here. Yes. 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 Don't fuck with me, man. Don't fuck with me. Don't you fuck. No fuckery. Oh my god, I have one heart left. Oh shit. Let me out. Hope that's not gonna kill me or something. Yeah! Good. That's it for me today. Save, save my stuff. Wow, you've done it. Now saving your data. Thank you. It's saved. I'll say 10 hours and 30 minutes. That's 10 and a half hours of good stream. Let right, me look around here. It's been good. I like the game. It's been, it's been good. It's been good to me. All right, I'm gonna send you out. Folks, thank you very much for being here today. I appreciate it. And of course, we're gonna continue this, this game here. It's been wonderful. Two cryptic moments. Uh, thank you very much, piano artist, for helping, because that was good help, you know? I appreciate everyone being here. Thank you, Arcus, for the raid. Everyone who raided here. Is there a problem here? Why are you going black? Okay, yeah. Uh, yeah, it's been good, you know? We just organized things here a tiny bit. Just give me a second. All right, and that's it for me today. Thank you very much, everyone, who stopped by here, and have a good one. And I'll see you next time. Thank you, Salamander Jack. Thank you everyone who lurked and supported, who did everything, who just thank you for being here. Thank you everyone for being nice. Thank you piano artists. I should, I don't want to make promises, but I should be here around the same time tomorrow unless some catastrophe happens, okay? Uh, go ahead and turn this off for now. And there you go. And I don't even like to touch this here in my hand, to be honest. I'm a kind of a freak. I don't know if you can hear the sound, but a little bit. I'm going to send you on the raid here. All right. Thank you very much. Uh, God bless you, and have a good night, good rest of the day, wherever you are. Take care, and I'll see you next time. Thank you.